Yo, what up, boys? How's it going, chat? Hello, 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 hello. I didn't accidentally go live. I did have like eight DMs. Hold up. Oh, baby. Super auto pets, let's fucking go. So far, we have eight of the 16 contestants ready. All right, I love that. I love that. Damn near half. Damn near half. We're getting there. It's too early. I fucked up. I didn't realize that 11 a.m. to streamers was like midnight to a normal adult. And I tried to make it as early as possible to get Northern Lion involved. And then I realized that Northern Lion probably couldn't play regardless. So I could have moved it later. But, you know, I figure, hey, uh, you know, we'll do an early one. Because here's the five head thing, chat. Most of these streamers who are playing, it's so early for them that they're not going to stream. But their viewers are going to want to watch. <laughs> Which means that they got to go to the only live channel that's going to show their gameplay. <laughs> Mango! Get involved. Northern Lion. I do want Northern Lion on the mic. Mango, mango. Anyway, boys, we got the tournament happening here in just a moment. We have nine of our contestants now in the call. Still waiting on a few. I know five up is planned to be late. That's okay. Uh, I know Will Neff is planned to be late. That's okay. I don't know where the hell Stans is. That's just a weird one. You never expect Stans to be late. When Stans is late to something, you know you fucked up somewhere. That's like the worst case scenario. He's probably like busy or something with his wife and not just playing Super Auto Pets. <laughs> anyway, while we're here, boys, let me tell you about Twitch Prime. All you gotta do is click on a channel you like, click the subscribe button. Scroll down, see if it says subscribe free in the little checkbox. Hit the subscribe free button in purple. Super easy, super breezy. Northern Lion, ready to go for it. Germa, looking profoundly new to the game. Wait, is he selling Beaver? Going double spider? I would kind of respect that move. He's considering it. A cupcake? Peacock. Okay, he's he's all over the map. He's high as fuck. Bingo free space per space per perspective. What what did he take? Peyote? Hey Lud, hope you're doing well. I made a sketch video about you going to an audition. Uh I appreciate you making that, brother. It's a 10 minute video, and I have a tournament that I'm running, so I hope you understand that I'm not gonna watch it, but I do appreciate you making that. All right, we're almost, almost good with everybody in the call here. Still missing just a couple more. 
But quick rundown for everybody watching. This is a Super Auto Pets tournament. Super Auto Pets is a auto battler. It's basically the best description I've heard. A Fisher Price TFT. I think it's way more visually appealing for like a viewer perspective and also just to play. It's very simple. Uh, we actually are able to use the old life system, so I don't have to explain anymore. But uh, you have four lives total. Well, actually, no, it's going to change. I think you have like 10 lives. I don't know how that fucking works. <laughs> you have 16 people who are going to enter one big lobby. And then the top eight of those people, I'm going to have play a single elimination tournament. The bottom eight, I'm going to have play a nether single elimination tournament. So we're going to have like the pros and then the bros. Okay? Type of vibe. That way, if, you know, there's a bunch of people here who are brand new to the game, huge shitters, they're going to get absolutely waxed by stands. It's not that big of a deal. Let me hop in the call. Okay. Hello, hey, everybody. I, how do you play? Hey. Mascot? Mascot? Mesquite? Maybe? <laughs> I don't know. Uh, what, what are you guys talking about? Mes grapes. Mes yeah. grapes. Uh, uh, Japanese ever. grapes. Oh, yeah. Mesquite grapes. Oh, mesquite. Yeah, that's grapes. Nice. Okay. You say mascato. Mascato okay. grapes. What would you know about Japan? <laughs> I, I don't know a thing about it. Alex. <laughs> um... Anyway, what's up, guys? Hello, welcome to the tournament. We have a couple of uh, people lagging behind. That's that's mainly Will Neff and Five Up, who will be here shortly. Okay. Uh, but I'll give you guys the rundown right now because I don't think I don't think half you guys know. Um, <laughs> yeah. We have super Never auto pets. Anyone. Literally last night entry. <laughs> Jerma, why are people coming in my chat saying he's blazed? <laughs> Who's well, saying I that? I'm having like people come in here talking about how you have ancient peyote that the Mayans used. <laughs> Can I get some of that? I, I, I do not. I do not. I, I just... <laughs> that was convincing. <laughs> that was very convincing. <laughs> um, well, look, the game, we have some beginners here. We Can have you some. Explain the rules, please. Veterans. Like, I don't even know how the game works. I of just course. installed it 15 uh, minutes ago. <laughs> so the game, very game. simply, is an Same auto together. battler. You, you form a team of five, the best team you possibly can, and the team will battle against a random person. So we're going to enter a 16-person lobby. Everybody in this call will be playing. And then the top eight people from that, from that giant group will go to a single elimination bracket. Just the sweaty people. Just the stances of the worlds, okay? The, the, the yetis. <laughs> let's relax. Let's what? relax. Hey. <laughs> the I'm bottom eight will go to a different bracket. All right, a less sweaty one. The me youngs, okay? The people who aren't so good at games. Oh. I'm gonna get rolled. I have a chance. Why is that called that? Everybody gets, uh, so the winner of each okay. one will get their own award. Um, if you win the champion bracket, you get your own custom hat in game. It's a trophy hat. So you're the only person what? in the world who has it. If you win the loser's what? bracket, you get a joker really? hat. Um, and then also, 4K for winner of champion, 2K for winner of losers. Does that all add up? That? That's badass. Thank you. Okay. That's pretty cool. And that's There's money. Uh, what? Let's go. Hat. I, I just want a hat. I just want a <laughs> game. The hat. It's like triple yeah. my bank account. <laughs> yeah, the hat sounds amazing. So that's that's pretty much it. That's pretty much it. This is not sponsored by the people keep saying I'm sponsored because I keep playing this game. It's mostly because there's this bald guy on Twitch that I've watched a decent amount lately. Um, Hello. Oh, Northern Lion. <laughs> oh, I thought I videos I've watched this last guy in the past 24 hours. Um, <laughs> and to help out, by the way, uh, I have a Discord channel for all of you because it doesn't make a lot of sense for all 16 of us to talk on a Discord. Um, you can hop around Discords if you want, but if you could, uh, most of you try to sit in your Discord and then stream on Discord. That way I could just hop through and commentate it, yada, yada. Uh, and I, I predict cool. if you win this, it'll go max like three, four hours. And if you lose right away, it'll go like 90 minutes to two hours. All right. Uh, and cool. that's that's pretty much everything. Um, let me get you the lobby set up.
All right, all right, all right. Hold up, hold up. I need mango in the Discord. Should I buy a pet? Or should I just keep the default one? Oh yeah, shit. Good allowed? point. Yeah, I should have I should have clarified. I did forget about that fact. Um ho hold up. Actually, let me abandon this. Uh so for this one, for the big game. group, uh everyone use the free pack just for the oh, large group. Yeah. That makes sense. In the actual the turtle, bracket, right? you can use whatever you want. If you duck strat, you're lame. Just calling it out right now. Fuck you, Stan. <laughs> I'm not going to do it. I promise. This Discord call is going. Duck strat? Don't do it. Don't do it. That's the duck strat. If you Wait, only when... buy ducks for five turns, and no when one will like you. Use the DLC? Hands, don't leak my strats, bro. <laughs> well, I think, you know, you there's no strat. You're gifted the ducks. I, I've <laughs> never played this game, and I'm probably going to get rolled because I don't even know what I'm looking at here. I'm sure you'll be fine. Is there like a tutorial that I can look at? <laughs> Tony? I just, I just an cutest one. Guys, I have no idea what I'm looking at here, man. I, I need like a tutorial or like a breakdown video. <laughs> Kinda a little too late for that. Northern oh, line, now's your time to advertise. Oh, we're getting rolled. I do, I have a three hour long tutorial video. If you watch it on like 15X, you might be able to. <laughs> You <laughs> digest it. Just go to Northern Lion tier list, Super Auto Pets. Go to the very end, and then just look at that, and then buy the S tier. Just buy turtles and yeah, that's, 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 that's what that's I pretty much how I started. Yeah. That's what I fell asleep to last night. I I was lying there with um, with the iPad on my chest, just trying to cram for the exam, and I got Ooh, got to the. I was on the Northern Lion video. You gonna take like, that Northern oh, Lion? He said he fell asleep to that. It's long. I mean, like, it's I, mean like, it's I, I did really too. long. I was like three, four o'clock in the morning. I yeah. put the playlist on and tried to absorb it while I slept. <laughs> I don't, by the way, I think scientifically that doesn't work, Dan. <laughs> well, well, it looks like you gotta try again tonight. And I'll uh, <laughs> put some more mid rolls in that. Uh. Hey, do it for the next week. <laughs> See if it works. Oh, the lobby's up. All right. Uh, no, the new lobby. lobby. Oh, okay, new one? Mm -hmm. Yeah, I'm adding. Was there any rules that I needed to know when I missed? All right, let us go for it. Uh, no, you're good. All right. Uh, just, oh, just pack one. Yeah, pack pack one for the first round. All right. So are we, are we all jump. We're just doing the same. Uh, yeah, everybody can just kind of hop in. Wait, how do I join? Uh, so you go to a uh, private game, join, and then you type in the code I put in chat. I, it's because I didn't start it, me young. I kind of, I kind of yeah, ready now. Reject. Make sure you don't leak. It's very easy to do it. I Is didn't it easy do to leak. Yeah. Okay. yeah. Oh, join so private, so then enter game. Okay. Me young wins. She gets paid cool. and gift subs. Yeah. Don't say that. So well, it's a rule. Uh, Look, should I join or am I just gonna like capture your stream or like screen share or yeah my idea was uh, Everyone will enter their own call and then screen share So you can easily okay. bounce around watching POVs Makes sense um, But let me see how many people are in this Yeah, Ray is not streaming I'm gonna get there in a second. All right. Is it like a spectator mode? Why is there 17? Oh, oh wow, this really is super easy to leak <laughs> yeah, it just shows the it shows did the code you leak there it? Oh, until it starts. So just say full screen. For no, sure. I did not leak. No, I, I did not. Uh, okay, wait. How many people on this call? There's 14. All right, so I think we're just missing Saikuno and Mango, and then we're set. Uh, and I think one person in this call hasn't joined. Is that right? I haven't joined, well, but... No, 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 one extra person. In addition to you. Okay, okay. Hmm. You know, there's a chance, Northern Line, I don't know how much you want to risk it. I don't think it'll go that long if you want to hop in and play. I, here's the thing, okay? I'm... There's two things. One is I already have a one of one hat in the game, so I wouldn't want to take both of the one of ones. Okay. That's, <laughs> that's rude. And then the other one is, I think, 
my chat really has high expectations. They expect me to win, and that's a lot of pressure because uh, there's a lot of good uh, players, a lot of good analytical thinkers here. So I would rather just sidestep the entire uh, issue there and just commentate instead and act superior from an ivory tower. And then you 1v1 I the champion that, like brother. in the end of Pokemon Elite 4. <laughs> oh, oh yeah, you're work. like the thug finals. <laughs> Whoever wins plays Northern Lion at the very end. <laughs> And you, it's be, for it's pink like slips. If you lose, every you time lose that your someone loses, you just say, "Oh, they should have watched my tier list." <laughs> <laughs> Actually, the tier list is out of date with the new patch. Uh, it, I need to do a, a retcon, but I digress. Uh, Saikuno code is in general. Yep, I'm already in it. Is, Wait, you're does in? Does this code leak after the lobby? Uh, once no, you go into the game, you're good. Once we're live, I think we're good. Yep. Uh, I think. Is this, everyone hold up. I'm missing three people. I think... Unless I'm terrible at math, I feel like everybody in this call, if they joined, we would be at 16. I heard a distant whisper from 5up. I did not know what he said, though. I think he was talking to Tubbo. I hate Tubbo. I've always said that. <laughs> Sorry about that. <laughs> oh, you're good. Uh, anyone in this call have, has not? Is it five up? Oh, are you I'm the one that has not joined? I'm in. It Abe, says, are you uh, in? 15 out of 17. Abe, uh, confirming, are you in? I think he was in the bathroom. I think he's going there. Okay, okay. I'm just, uh, grab it. Do I have time to grab a coffee? Yeah, go for it. Anthony, you're in? Uh, Hello? yes, sir. Cool, love that. Sorry, I was pooping. All right, love that for Perfect. you. Alex, you're in? Nice. Yes, I am. Wonderful, Buddha. Oh, there's a 16. Oh, oh it was, it was the pooping way. man. Uh, can Northern Line, uh, can you just join no? and then um, do the old, uh, just drop from it? Oh, sure, yeah, yeah, yeah. No and problem. Then it'll, it'll start. When he joins, I guess we should wait a moment. Uh, so after it starts, just hop in your own Discord and then just Discord screen share. You can just mute or deafen in oh, Discord. Sure. Oh, Discord screen share. And then that's just an easier way to spectate. Oh, shit. I, I might have boned Germa right there. All right, we're in. Uh -oh. Uh, oh, oh, did the game re oh, in or are we yeah, let's get it. Do we restart? We might need a classy really? restart because I did tell him to go get coffee and then I forgot it auto started. Woohoo! Yeah, I didn't even yeah, join. Yeah, yeah, perfect start. Yeah, back out. <laughs> yeah, back out. Let's oh, leave this immediately. Give it more <laughs> chances for ducks. All right, we're yeah, ducks. We're cool. Good thing I got bad RNG. I Damn, had I had, ducks, I had three ducks, man. Stand. I had three. Uh, I'm actually not playing ducks because I hate them. We were abandoning, right? <laughs> it's on principle. Yep, 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 yep. yep. I respect <laughs> it. I respect it. Unless I get three. Yeah, yeah, uh, please do that. Yeah, well. Okay, the weird thing is there are 18 people, but somehow only six 17 are joining and i'm trying to figure out why this is the case yeti ray saikuno stands auto oh hop in all right all right we're good I'm trying not to play, but I had myself as like an adjustable man that I could add. Uh, yeah, because I'm going in this blind, man. I have no idea, no idea what I'm looking at. I think a few people are going in blind, and I think same, that's why we have the, the bottom bracket. So I think uh, it's going to be it's going to be hilarious. Mm -hmm. It's going to be funny. It'll be good content. Yeah. I don't know what we're going into, guys. And it was going to be fine. Yeah, we're going to get absolutely rolled by the pros, but that's okay. <laughs> All right, new lobby code, normal line. I don't need to join this one. We'll commentate together and hop through. Understood. All right. Uh, so 11 a.m. is early. Is this what I'm understanding? Yes, yeah, too early. <laughs> it's late for me. <laughs> it's late for you? No, it's a joke, but I do wake up at like 9 a.m. right now. Streamers, Bro, this guy's up at 4 a.m. in Japan, dude. I was up at 4 a.m. Yeah, Alex, that was the last place. night, and he's like, what time is it? I was like, 11 hours from now. He's like, yeah, I'll just stay up. <laughs> no, actually, I went to sleep 
Oh, you did? Like you you got your eight? Yeah. I had Dude, to. Wendy and I were awake at 7 a.m. and we're like, we shouldn't go to sleep. We're not gonna wake up. Dude, I got two. I woke up to two flight yeah. messages from me, Young, and Mango, both going like, <laughs> hey, don't hate me, but I might not be there. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I'm back, sorry. I've been holding everybody. I gave you my word. I, di I didn't cook for the house to be here. I appreciate that. Mm -hmm. It's a nice afternoon here in New York. That's all I'm saying. Okay, bad news. I think Myung stream effed. Oh, she's back. Uh oh, is that, I already oh, lost a match. Maybe our internet. No, no, no. No, we, no, a... we had to, we backed out for you, so you can back out. Oh, new code. Okay, okay. New code. It's in general. We have three more people who need to join, and we're good. Cool. cool. <laughs> apparently, apparently, Mango, because he's not on the call, was playing against bots. <laughs> He's like, wow, dude, so good. He literally said I was on a run. <laughs> hey, everyone. Uh, hey. What hey, Will. You win. Hello. Hello. Will. Will. Uh, all right. I think we almost have everyone. We just need two Maybe more. Two more. Yeah. Are we waiting on a uh, mango and Myun? Uh, I think it's me, Young One, and I don't know if the other is Mango for sure. So if you get all the trophies, that's like a win condition. Like, what what what, what would you consider consider a win? So, so the way it, no trophies in versus. Yeah, you the way it works in versus is it's lives, and you will die um, and run out of lives. So uh, you just need to live longer than the other people in this call. Okay, I see. I don't know exactly how they calculate how many lives you get because I feel like it varies sometimes. Uh, In the regular game mode, would you guys consider first round one heart. seven rounds to be good? Like eight rounds to be good? What what what's like? A, all right, that was a good that was a good run. Yeah, seven and eight's good. Yeah, Easy. seven eight's great. Yeah. I mean, or I don't I take like anything four. under ten personally, but I can appreciate seven. <laughs> what, what about what about between like three and five? Is that considered okay? Wow, well, should get at least five. <laughs> So, I'm sorry, did you hit us with a higher number and then you're whittling down to where you're at? <laughs> I think yeah, one yeah, to four yeah. is the only bad ones because you now, should just play for. You should sleep just for the say fences, one right? to Zero two. Zero is better than four. So, do you guys just leave game? Like, do you just abandon game if you no, have. No, no, because then you get a dunce hat nowadays. They patched it. Oh. Yeah, the game makes fun of you mm. if you abandon. So, you have to play it out like a hero. Wait, do I get a dunce hat if I already abandon then? No, if you, if you abandon a bunch, you're fine. Oh, like, okay, okay. Only pubs or something. Yeah. All right. Yeah, the arena. Resetting for that perfect triple fish. Thanks so much. <laughs> oh, uh, I think it's just me, Young. I think she's having some audio and stream problems. It just effed. Yeah, I'm also just downloading Steam, so I need a second. Yeah. All right. <laughs> well, wait, wait, Will, are you not in? <laughs> yeah, I'm trying to get in right now. Oh, then it's probably oh. just you we're missing on. Oh, then we need a bigger lobby, right? And where's uh, Myung already in? We shouldn't, right? Well, because Myung has enjoyed and then Will's still looking to join. I right? think Myung is in. Oh, okay. Hold up, let me go chat with her. Myung's struggling. Myung! Can you hear me? Yeah, I can hear you. I don't know why, but stream can't hear me. Yeah, I, I'm seeing your stream effed and then it crashed and then they have no audio. Yeah, I don't know what's going on. Uh, is it, is it, is it, is it both audios? Like, if you play something from your desktop, does your stream hear it? I don't, I think, do they not hear you? Because if they can't, I don't think they can hear me, and I don't think they can hear you. Is it popping up in OBS, like with the green? Yeah, yeah it is. Might just need a full restart. Like my PC? Yeah. Oh, they don't hear anything. Okay. I'll, I'll be right back. No worries. Go no worries. Go on without me. Wait, what'd you say? Go on without me. Do you want me to? Yeah, yeah. I don't know if this will fix it. <laughs> Look, everybody knows me. I'm just trying to sleep. <laughs> Stop. Anyways, I'll be right back. I'll try no to worries. restart it really fast. You're good. You're good. Thanks. Oh, classic 30 minute delay chat. Classic 30 minute delay. We're just missing Will. 
Uh, Will, is it just you at this moment? Uh, I have it. How do I join the game? The uh, code? Versus, and then there's a code that Ludwig posted. Yeah. In Discord. Versus, and then join private. Join private. Okay, got it. Yeah. And then just the name. Oh, uh, yeah, sir? don't say it out loud, because uh, people can just snipe it. Yeah. Um, I'm definitely leaked. Uh, oh, go, Will, go. Should be fine as long as Will joins in the next 13 seconds. Will, are you in? Was that you, Will? I'm in. Okay, yeah, hey. that's us. Perfect. All right, All right everybody so to hop to your own discords. Go. Okay. And own then Discord. go live on Discord showing your perspective. Yo, good luck, guys. Good luck. Oh, I might, you might, you might have uh, good I luck, everybody. Good luck. You guys, you guys are going to need it, man. You're going to need it. Because <laughs> yeah. they're about to get smacked, man, okay? But I can't do that. I'm on my phone. You're good. Okay. Well, well, well. Hello. Northern Lion, how are you doing? Uh, I'm doing really well. How are you doing? I'm doing pretty well, you know? I was just trying to not uh, talk at all when people were complaining about how early it was and say something ridiculous like, well, as a father, this is actually kind <laughs> of like midday. Is that a phrase you've used unironically, as a father? Uh, so I use it unironically but then i pretend it's ironic it's like i'm in the know but i really say stuff like people would not understand how hard it is but as a father and then they all journey with me for a moment let's take a look at some povs because they're already deep in it oh shit i should have okay sorry travel with no, me here wait. travel with i did ditch you i meant to i forgot I, we don't travel together let's let's check at some povs they're already deep in it let's go to uh maybe a Saikuno. Hold on. All right, wait. We're playing a little game of tag here. He'll find me. He'll join. As a father, I'm not very good with Discord. I apologize. I, ma I made it. Don't, you, that doesn't even add up. <laughs> um, but I figure we can just jump around the Discord here. Yeah, you, just, you tell me where to go. I'll, I'll do that. You, you could even drop like a context in. I'm I'm familiar with the commentary game. I watch Boomer Sports. Oh, that's cool. That's wait. Do you actually watch sports? I, sports? I do watch uh, sports. Sports. Uh, I have quarter season tickets to see the Vancouver Canucks. They're really bad right now. I'm sorry. Define all... quarter season tickets. Uh, so they play 41 home games a year. We have tickets to 10 of the games. Okay. Is that just season like... tickets would be would be forty and then you know right. half season is twenty one or something. Yeah, that you know that adds up. That adds up. <laughs> uh looking through, Saikuno doing pretty well. I think he's I, one of the like favorites that. to win the, the top bracket. I like the squad, but I gotta say I am very much a hater of the horse in every capacity in this game. As we I, I think it's unplayable. Um, but he, he did get a win in the first round. I'm just wondering if uh, if the horse and selling that duck early might end up coming back to bite him in a little bit. Yeah, I can appreciate this. I'd actually love to do. Let's go around. Let's see what you think about other teams in here. Let's let's check over on Jerma. Oh, he's not even live. <laughs> okay. Well, we'll. I'm sure we'll see him at some point when we. Yeah, maybe uh... <laughs> let's just go check out. Let's go check out a stands then. Okay. What do you think about this squad? Um, this is a very scary squad for turn three, for sure. I mean, a crab is like meta. The dog, the thing is that with a dog, you got an engine to get stats for the future. And that's something you need if you're going to win long term. Like this is this is a squad that's a little scary. It doesn't scare me too much now, but in like four rounds, this is going to be spooky. Did he did he save a snail there? Did I see that? That, I mean, that's the ambitious play, right? That that way, if you lose, you're actually winning. I I mean, I find it a, a sign of insecurity. I never save snail. But two stats for everybody is is Ooh. awesome. You know what? Ooh, I, this is that's a close one. I gotta say, Alex has a pretty good team as well. Honestly, Alex is good. The only thing that's gonna hurt him is he's awake at 4 a.m. in Japan and stayed up for this. I feel like sometimes it's like the Michael Jordan flu game, though. Like you know. Uh, <laughs> The Hard Japan times make 4 a.m. game. Exactly. Yeah. Like I this this team is he oh I'm I've never seen this before, but Stans is just gonna keep that snail frozen long term in case he gets a loss. A lot of people say like it's not worth it because you lose the reroll potential in the shop, but 
You know, if you know you're going to lose at some point anyway, maybe it's worth keeping it frozen. I feel like not using level two fish was psychopathic. It's good. I, I would be, I, I think maybe he was trying to make sure his gold usage was, was optimal here and he'll do it next time. Cause if you level up units on turn on odd numbered turns, like three and five, it actually boosts you one extra tier ahead. So instead of getting tier th three units for leveling up now, he'd get a tier four unit next turn. You know, See, I, this is the, it's the high level analysis that uh, I've, I've known it like, hey, you don't combine to level three or combine to level five. I never knew exactly why I did it. It's, there's, I'm of two minds about it. Like sometimes I think you can you can get around it early. Like you might want to get uh, like an otter earlier because the stats are nice. Maybe you want to level an otter to level two on the second turn. But I think he's I think he's playing the long game, which is what you want to do here. Okay, it looks like Buddha is doing really poorly. I'd love to look at his POV. Say no more. Here we are. Buddha, you might want to mute us, by the way, or deafen. What? <laughs> all right, all right. He deafened. He deafened. All right. This is uh, is is a spooky looking team. He's also playing on uh, not fast. <laughs> yeah, he's playing on the mode. Where he has to click <laughs> the go every time. That's but, you crazy. Know, for for somebody, oh I, no, I was looking at the wrong side. I was looking at Mango's team, and it's like a a shrimp at his eight five. It's pretty ambitious, but I guess he's got an eight seven here too. Seven seven honey badgers. Jeez. I don't know if you know the phrase goaty throaty. Um, it, it's a little after my time, I think, sure. but I can read between the lines. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Um, I would love to tell him about how to use. Let's check out Anthony. I think he's another newcomer. I got this, guys. I got this. Hey, Anthony, we're just checking in. Wanted to see how your team's doing. Honestly, man, uh, you know, things are on the up and up right now. You know, when I first started, I forgot to buy my pets in the beginning. Um, so I got absolutely rolled. I had no pets. Well, speak Second. to that. What do you mean you had no pets? Well, my, my chat told me that I forgot to buy pets. Uh, so, yeah, I, I basically got rolled the first round. Uh -huh. uh, second round, I finally bought pets, and then I got rolled because the guy had more pets than me. Third round, I actually had a decent roll of pets, I guess, and then I accidentally sold them. And, um, yeah, man, things I are – but I got a good team now. I got an elephant. I got two elephants. I got a fish. I got a beaver, and – a swan. Can I ask how you got a 2-1 fish when it starts as a 2-3? <laughs> Did you I, kill? I have. I'm going into battle right now. Did you pill something you shouldn't have, Anthony? I didn't even know what. Because you also have a 3-3 three, three elephant. Stacked! 10, 10, 9, 10, 8, 7. Bro, I'm going to get my ass kicked. What is this? Bro, I'm getting. I mean, what? I wouldn't count your three three Shit. elephant out. What? Bro, I just got rolled. Uh, let's. That's let's a strong over, team. Let's hop over to five up over there. Let's hop over to five up. I just got rolled. Bro. Yeah, keep it up there. Keep it up there, champ. <laughs> five up. You might want to deafen us. We're gonna chat about you. All right. Uh, this, oh, it, it was just for the deaf and some discord okay. shenanigans. Oh. I didn't want to say anything, but I feel like Tony squad has some serious problems. <laughs> <He's>, <laughs> there's uh duplicates of animals and, uh, they have lower stats than they start with when you buy them, but we'll just chalk he that He said up. he watched Learning your videos curve. last night. So that's the average Northern lion viewer. <laughs> well, that explains <laughs> why most people are getting 10 wins. I think every time they play right now. <laughs> Look, yeah, five up. Look at you see in the muscle memory like he's the APM is off the charts. I've never moved this fast in my life. I take up the whole minute. You were telling me like, hey, you can reduce the amount of time from three minutes. And I was like, oh, I use the whole three. Oh, I am like I'm a 15 second kind of guy in all avenues of my life. That's just a, a rule that I, I adhere to. Yeah. Yeah. I, I'm the same. And uh, my girlfriend won't let me forget it because she does stream and talk about that often. 
Um, <laughs> no, that's got to suck. <laughs> <laughs> no, it's I will great. say my wife went live last night and she was telling uh, all the viewers after she got the host that like she had to clean the bathroom and there was like, you know, pee stains on the underside of the toilet seat and stuff like that. I was I was getting torn up. Yeah, I get lit up constantly. And there's not like a period where, you know, she talked about not how I was a bad boyfriend, but how in her dream I was a bad boyfriend. It's like a universal truth. She's been telling me about Dream Ryan for like two days. Are you just devious in your dreams? Just terrible? I didn't even do anything wrong. It was some th ridiculous conspiracy where I'd take like a private jet to New York to gamble or something. Like uh, that is so you though. You've been telling me I've, how you want to do that. I that <laughs> it fits my personality. I, though I do fly. I fly charter though, not private. Come on, that's so yeah. expensive. I mean, you know, they're they're similar though. <laughs> Uh, I am actually surprised. I, I thought Five Up's team was was good enough, but the wet firemen, quite strong. A lot of crabs. Have you noticed that? The crabs are making a serious appearance here. Yeah, I'm not a huge fan of crab meta. I've actually never won with crab ever. There uh, was, it, it took the meta by storm about a week and a half ago. And then I think it's fallen off a little bit. It's led to a rise in skunks. It's led to a rise in the snipers like dolphin and crocodile. But I think we, we might be looking at some calcified meta here. Can you pull up Germa's stream here? Okay. And because just he's on his last heart. I figure it's worth kind of watching this unfold. Okay. Last heart. Let me take a look at this. First off, he's on the DLC. I'm not very good. He is on DLC. It was no DLC. Him and Will Neff somehow managed to end up on DLC. Um, but that being said, I, I think for round seven, he's got some serious problems here. Like a chicken is a great idea, but four three is not gonna get you there. The similarly, like the meat on the uh on the bird, I'm not I mean, it's only a a ten four really with that. I don't think the peacock's going to get you there. He tried to apply the salad to a unit directly, even though it's a random <laughs> buy. I, it's just uh, I'm a little <laughs> perturbed. But let me say, I think the hatching chick combined with the peacock garlic armor, if he gets a good matchup, maybe maybe he can stay in there. I mean, I think you switch a hatching chick over to the rooster and you win. I don't know. I think I would, right now I would rather okay. have the eleven fourteen oh, peacock with sure, garlic totally. armor. Long term, right. I think that that rooster is his only way out, though for sure. Okay, wait. Let's see how he does. This is his life. If he loses this, he's out. So much of this I comes to the matchup. <sighs> hmm. That's fine. I I see a level that's, three that, horse, and, and problem, if I'm Germa, I'm not that scared. This is problem. You uh, are. He might not I win, but I'm. I'm a big horse hater. I do not gone. like the horse That's whatsoever. Fun to say what you've been fucking lost, isn't it? I I think it's like, oh, it's always worse right. than you think. That, that is very lucky, though. Ram, spider spitting God, out ram. That's bad luck this? for Germa. But it's it's a well known meme. Like when you uh, have a spider, it only spits out snails, and then for your I, I, opponents, it always spits out turtles and sheep. I didn't play the first two rounds. I didn't know there was a timer. I was talking about about cakes of the time. and waffles and shit. This I didn't is curtain timer, spring. and I'm using the wrong pack anyway. So, so that will send Germa to the loser bracket. But you know what? Plenty more time to watch the tier list because it could take another 40 minutes to resolve this <laughs> lobby. <laughs> I've never... You've spent some time on that tier list. Oh, okay. Other people I were I thought... I, I, no, I don't know me. if you're the, the same thing. Out. Like, I watch you rank the sexiest M&Ms. Right. Uh, I always think that a tier list is going to be, like, half an hour, and then three hours later, I'm, like, rushing to make sure it's done by the time I get offline. <laughs> to be clear, the sexiest M&Ms, that was about 20 minutes. Well, after there's green M&M, like it was like them, 30 right? seconds. Yeah. Well, I mean, <laughs> 15 for me, but. <laughs> <laughs> uh, let's hop over to someone who's still in here. Uh, I would like to take a look. I think Wendy's out. Let me real quick watch. Let's see. Oh, I'm dead. Oh, you're dead, Wendy? Yeah, I'm dead, dead. There were a couple, Wendy, I will say you were right. There's a couple paid up win pack users. <laughs> who snuck in fortunately they're terrible i think and both lost very early i didn't notice there was a timer in one of my rounds and i missed out but it's all good well you are still in the bracket and the bracket still has a good prize a couple a couple racks Woo. you know that, that's that's decent but let's hop over to auto see what he's doing Okay, three lives. All right, this is his final life, perhaps. 
Who is Logic Defender? <laughs> it's <laughs> yeah, it sounds like he should be a debate bro. Yeah. He's, he's just a viewer of mine who who challenged me in a Mario race and then is kind of oh, like I see. You could call him Ludwig's um Dan Geesling. Well, excuse me, has he ever <laughs> won Big Brother and then come second on Big Brother? You know, he came pretty close. I think he got second on Hive Mind. Okay, that's, I mean, they're roughly the same level. You know, they're equal. He's like the Ben Shapiro of Twitch with no politics, and he's not really. <laughs> oh, <cute. laughs> so he has, what, he's he's He might five, be Jewish. Four, or, yeah, okay. He's short and might be Jewish. <laughs> I gotta say, I'm I'm happy to see like a slightly non-meta squad. I love the worm. It's 13, 16 already, pretty strong. I, I'm sure he's trying to figure out right now what what kind of equipment do I want here. He wants some garlic on it at some point, but he he hasn't got the the gold for it. He Check. You tell me who's out. Yet. You know, I I think that this worm can take people by surprise, but it's kind of your pot committed. Once you get it, you got to go all in. I like Alaskan Bullworm, but I don't love... Can, can you explain, by the way, Four Squad Marty, where that comes from? Four Squad Marty is uh, when Super Auto Pets meta was still in its infancy. If you ever ran into somebody that was running four animals, uh, you knew you were going to win because they didn't know what they were doing. But then the meta changed a little bit, and in some situations, you realize four is the number that you want because it's better to invest in your existing units than buy like a trash unit just to fill out the squad. Unfortunately, it lost here, thus rendering my point kind of moot, but <laughs> oh, and, yeah. that, and wiped as well. Let's hop over to Logic Defender. I want to see who's still in. Logic Defender, yo. Hey, what's up? Can you do me a favor and scroll through who's still in here? So it looks like we have, hold up, we have Will Neff, Five Up, Yeti, Ray, Abe, Stans, and yourself. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I think that's it. Which is top eight. Yeah. That is, that is the difference. All right, so our, our final brackets uh, have been set now. Well, congrats, you're, on, you're in top eight. You can still win this, play it out. Nice. Do your thing. Um, let me, let me hop over and see what Dan Corona is up to. Will was, I mean, oh, Dan's big time out. All right. Yeah. I should have known that one. Curse of the spectator. Wait, did I get eight or nine? I have no idea. You are ninth. Oh, fuck. You All are right. on the cutoff, but there's still, there's still prizes to win for you. Okay, okay. Feeling good. Feeling good. You should feel good. You, you've done well today. Uh, thank and you, then, thank you, thank you. Wait, we also have Alex. Is Alex still in two? Let me check him. Yeah. Oh, Alex, you're out. Yeah, I lost. I got really bad luck. Um, wh 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 What happened to you? Talk to me. I just had no scaling at all. I was just getting no scaling pets. I was running off of a... A, a a really strong rat, but it kept uh, making me lose every time because that's all I had. <laughs> Wait, did you just get out at the end there? No, I think I might be in the bottom eight. Maybe I'm not sure. I like think maybe it might be two of the eight. Uh, Ray's still in. Let's tune in with Ray here. Good luck, Alex, in the in the in the bottom eight. In the yeah, pro tournament, on. anyway, it doesn't matter. Hello, guys. Oh, Ludwig, what's Hello. up? How you doing, Ray? I'm dangling by She's a doing great. I walked I lost in at a bad time. So fast. It so was I couldn't talk to me horrendous. because people were in my chat telling me that you got really unlucky. I got like, look, I had a cricket. My strongest <laughs> unit was a level oh, two cricket no. on turn ten, and it was it that was it was cooked. Is that I rolled? I kept rolling. I kept seeing one and two dice blocks, and it was just it was just. Uh, at least I get to play with all my friends in the amateur. Is that is that like a roast? That wasn't intended as a roast, but um, no. <laughs> <laughs> no, the the amateur bracket, honestly, I think it's a little more packed um, in terms yeah, of yeah. clout, <laughs> you know? Wait, what? That's a fact. What's that supposed to mean? What? Well, you don't have to slum it with the logic defenders of the world. Who's the logic defenders? The stanzas. Oh, oh, stanzas is pretty cool, yeah. Yeah, it's pretty cool. Yeah, I'm uh, just going to I got a cricket at round 10, and it was just cooked after that. 
And let me tell you, cooked cricket does not taste very good. Um, not that I would know. I've never eaten a cricket, but. I have. It doesn't taste good. You're right. Wait, I, like really? I didn't scale fast enough. I mean, I like the tiger. Let's go. Bell, right? Yeah, but yeah. it's not. Yeah. Tiger chicken's pretty weak. decent, but the chicken needs a little buffing, you know? Yeah. Too weak. Everything's too weak. You're yeah. already in top eight, so you're good in that end. Oh, I guess so. No, I want to be the other bracket. <laughs> Do you want to be it's in the. It's too late, Ray. Right, you're already right. in the top eight. No. So the rest of this game is just for gravy for you, right? No. You, know, you know, Ray, I did say you're the one who introduced me to the game, and you're, you're like, uh, you know, like you're, you're the super auto send pee. But I haven't played this or no. this pack. And you're still better than me. Absolute gaming legend. Oh, I'm noticing a 39-4 melon rooster in the back there. Yeah, that's pretty scary. That's pretty scary. A little scary, bit of yeah. a meta build for sure. Here's the thing, though. I think Ray wins because the roosters respawning have no health. Oh, the, the hippo. Wait, where did that come from? Oof. Oh. Oh, my gosh. Oh. oh. Oh, that, that hippo, that hippo clapped it because of the... <laughs> Wait, Ray, can you scroll through this for a moment? Oh. <laughs> no, never, never mind. I was never talking to a different Ray. <laughs> uh, let me tune to the stands. All right. I'm going to go to auto, ask him. Okay, auto's out. Love that for me. Love that for me. Let's check in with Logic Defender. Logic Defender, are you still in? Yes, sir. Can you do me a quick... Uh, don't, are you the game open right now? Yeah, I do. Oh, you're in. Do me a quick scroll through. I don't want to take up too much of your time here. Oh, shit. Oh, you're in it. That's yeah, all right. All hey, after this round, it's fine. Yeah, no, I just accidentally clicked the replay. Oh, okay. Hey, you're good. All right, you're good. That's all I needed. Imagine farming me for, 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 for who's still in. We need someone who's consistently still alive. <laughs> it's fair. It's fair. I Look, a spectator it. mode would be great, but instead I have to go to one of the greatest players this game's ever seen. You're all good, by the way, if you want to go. You have to play around here. I'm a sample. Yeah, I do. I do. Uh... Need a fan favorite for sure, for sure. <laughs> I'm feeling good about you. Gone. You seem it's like a, a squad. A strong squad here. It's an, a bit of a nasty squad. I'm not gonna lie. I'm not a man who uses two of the same unit. I usually go for a level three, but this this seems right. crazy. Dude, two it's... roosters is kind of gross. It's yeah. a little gross. I would not want to queue into this. <laughs> and you keep queuing into the stands over and over. <laughs> oh, poor guy. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, his level one like, snake. please kill me against somebody else, please. <laughs> his level one snake just not cutting it. Yeah, it's tough. By the way, I respect someone who plays on normal speed, slow speed, instead of the speed up. Yeah, I think it's easier to watch, honestly. Uh, I got it on 150x now. Like, I, I can't feel something unless the projectiles <laughs> are just whipping by at light speed. <laughs> put, put it on two times speed just to feel something for a while. All right, give me one more dual check. Sure, sure, sure. Just, just a Mother brief one. I always click that button by accident. That's not my fault. This five seconds is your time wasted. Actually, true. This five seconds is mine, though. You are in first <laughs> right now. Yes, sir. All right, all right. Go for it. Go for it. Mm -hmm. uh, and let me go over to Stan's. How does Stan's come back from a sweaty double rooster level two user? I think he's doing the right thing, honestly, by, by like wiggling that scorpion around. Like if you're not gonna, if you don't know where what? your big guy is, you got to pop it down somewhere. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. 11, 10, level three fish. I don't want to call this guy an idiot, but you know. Okay, well, it's bumping oh, my bison to be clear. It stands. <laughs> <laughs> Just wanted to say, I'm, um, you know, already top A, kind of going for the achievement maybe. Sure, sure. Uh, definitely no achievements in verses, but you know, uh, well, I can appreciate that. Uh, yeah, the, I mean, if you get early Dodo scaling with rooster, I think you just win, but maybe we get some lucky snake snipes, huh? That's mm -hmm. what I was just saying. I like the way you're, you're moving that scorpion around too, just to try to keep them off balance. Yeah. There's, so there's a Swan and a Dodo mid lineup for some other teams like that Dodo right there. And so my goal here, oh, that scorpion doesn't have 21 damage, was to try and hit the snipe on it. Oh, you hit the tiger there. Still looks fine, though. 
Uh, no, we draw. Not a loss. Not a loss. No, not a loss. Top three, baby. Uh, I told chat that five up or logic defender was going to win this lobby because they got the early dodo twos. But I might be able to actually change the paradigm, you know? Well, I think you've been known as a paradigm shifter in the past. Is there a world? Deaf enough for this round? I don't want to. I don't want to. I don't want to sway yeah, you. Yeah, I don't. I don't want to. Yeah, I don't want to. I don't want to little... sway you. No shot. I don't he think wins. he's gonna. Yeah, it's not <laughs> possible. <laughs> I think he, if he gets super lucky with the snipes on the with the snake, if he takes out roosters, but like the roosters, I think have melon armor on them now. Like it's it's really tough. <sighs> yeah, I. uh... I mean, if he buffs up his bison a bit so it can live a little longer. Or if he just found a tiger. I honestly, my my play in this situation is you dump the fish and then you just try to fit like another scorpion in. But that's just like, it's desperation plays. So I, I find myself running like three scorpions and then one big unit sometimes. Like just a hope and a prayer? Yeah, and then mix it up. Put it like one, four, five just to, just to trick them doesn't always work maybe uh, never works some people might say i've been accused of it but you were a big fan of the uh big scorp i've seen you win with that before i love uh, uh so for people that aren't in the know when you get melon armor you're protected from 20 damage uh or whatever under 20 hits you is just nullified so if you have a scorpion that does more than 20 damage it will kill something even if it has melon armor so you can get a scorpion that can like kill their 50-50 melon armor unit. You can get a scorpion that lives through like two units and gets death touch on both. There's a there's a chance. Not first stance oh. here though. This is uh this is a nightmare. <laughs> yeah. Good placement, but did not really change much. If he kills the tiger, he still doesn't have it. Rooster is just honestly like it's probably the strongest late game unit in the game right now. And Dodo Rooster is like a classic combo to just, you know, steamroll people at the end of the game now. All right, I'm going to hop to general. I think we have a draw, though. I think we need to do a 1v1. I believe so. Because uh, I think someone dropped out 8th or ninth. Let me double check here. So it's uh, top eight for sure is Logic, Stans, Five Up, Abe, Yeti, Ray. And then I'm hearing Five Up's game broke. Uh, I think that's all right, oh, though. Oh, no. Because he's still, I mean, he was still in top eight. But the fact that it's crashing now is a problem, but hopefully it fixes. Um. Did Alex make it past Dan and Will? I thought Dan and Will were the last two chat. Am I crazy for that? Or did it auto make it through? I think I made it through. <laughs> you think, well, <laughs> Will, it's unfortunate you did make it through because you slightly cheated there by using the pay to win pack. <laughs> Listen, I was told I could use whatever pack I wanted to. I don't I think you thing. were, you were told that? Yes. <laughs> by, by who? Uh, this was the common conception among the pro circuit. <laughs> now you're just saying words out loud. I'm glad I wasn't the only one. I got. I'm, I'm sweating. <laughs> I was I was here and prepared like yesterday too. And so it's wait, like, oh, I yeah, don't even know what I did. Question. What did I do? You used the pay to win pack, and I said it was free to uh, free to win only for this one. And then I said the the main lobby, oh, the brackets. My, my bad. I, I didn't even know. I was using a browser version. Yeah, you know, I I think we'll 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 let it slide. I I honestly don't think it's like a um, a big difference maker. I mean, if you don't expect it, it can be a little weird. But I don't think pay to win is better than free to win even. Sure. Uh. I have no idea which bracket I'm in. Was I the only one who didn't buy pets on their first round? No, did I did not buy pets. <laughs> <laughs> no, I, 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 I didn't either. I didn't either bro. I'm, I'm I didn't sitting either there. I'm meta. sitting there. I'm not knowing like what I'm looking at, right? I'm thinking I'm looking at the the fucking starting screen. Chat, am I right? By the way, I I, I want to mute for a moment. I I just there's no way to spectate, unfortunately, because the way the game works. 
Um, was Is this right? Logic stands, 5-up, Abe, Yeti, Dan, Ray, Will. Because people are saying these people went out at the same time, which is fine because then they'll be 7 and 8. I mean, I could make them 1v1 for seeding, but I think this is right. I couldn't remember. There was a person with one pet. <laughs> uh, Will, you can play any deck in the second half. Right? Wait, uh, Will might be in a one v one against me though for the eighth spot. So, oh, well, no, no. I I believe you guys are both uh, in top eight. You guys did oh, really? draw, but you drew. Yeah. So I, I think it's Logic stands five up. Abe, Yeti, Ray, Dan, and Will. Uh, and sure. then the other bracket is uh, Wendy, Jerma, Saikuno, Mango, Buddha, Anthony, Otto, Alex. Uh, Very cool. I believe is the seating for each, or not oh, the good. seating, but the 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 people in each. Um, and then give me just like a couple minutes. I'll get the seating up, and then we'll start the tournament, and everyone can just play one v one at once. Sounds good. Let's do it. Mm -hmm. All right. So did what you say about like any pack this time? Does it matter? Any pack, yeah. Any pack's fine. Right. Any pack, I would just recommend buying. I'm gonna play Anthony in the first round, please. Me <laughs> sliding. Yeah. <laughs> Me. Just don't right. buy pets again, please. Where's Ray? Oh, dude, I totally forgot her. <laughs> Save. Let's go. All right. <clears throat> uh, single elimination tournament. No match for third, really. That doesn't really matter. Um, specific cap. We'll do eight, start time, tentative. Bing, bang, boom, save and continue. Game being played. We'll call it Super Smash Brothers Melee because I don't think they have Super Auto Pets. And then I need participant list. And we'll add them in bulk. So this is the seating for this one. I'll put Will in last because he cheated. And I feel like that's, you know, that's hard to argue. And then we can lock that in. Start the tournament. Boom. All right. Here's our first event. Now, the, the seating for the other one, I didn't really see. I'm not going to lie. There's no way for me to, like, tell because I can't spectate. So I I, uh, I might just do seating based off these humans. Because I have no idea. I could also do random, but Mi Young's uh, stuff crapped out at the very last second. And she said, sorry without me. Auto was the last eliminated. All right, so we'll put Auto first seed. I can't imagine putting Saikuno lower. I just think it'd be unfair if it's like Auto. So it would just be like, I think Wendy. Wendy lasted a while. Alex lasted a while. Those got to be the top four. Mango, and then Buddha, Anthony, Jerma. I think that works. Alex's uh, Twitch username is Arix. Spelled Buddha wrong. Appreciate that. Appreciate you guys. German won a couple rounds. You know what? Well, the, then then I would have... This is fine. This is fine. Maybe I'll do it like one of these. There we go. There we go. That seems good. That seems good. That seems good. That seems good. Then I need to go to Challenge. Create a tournament. SAP small time. And now we get to the fun part, which is the bracket, which hopefully is all good, dandy. That. Yeah, that's my <laughs> fault. I should I I chose the wrong pack. My, uh, I clicked the replay button by accident, and then it just flat out broke the game for me, so I don't know what happened in the final rounds. Oh, oh no. I hate that replay button. Oh, it's God. right next to the little, uh... uh... 
Uh, look at the magnifying glass. Like, yeah, the magnifying right. glass. Yeah. I, I misclick it all the time. <laughs> yeah. Guys, I have both of your brackets here. The top one is oh. the um, consolation bracket, and then the okay. bottom one is the winner's bracket. Cool. Okay. Okay. Um, and give me just a moment. Okay. Oh, okay. I see. All right, Ray. All right, Dan. Oh, All right, I'm back. Dan. Hello, Abe. Okay. So what we're going to do for <laughs> no, this no, is no, just... uh, we'll have you... Uh, whoever's playing, enter the same Discord call. Mm -hmm. um, okay. And then just stream from there on Discord. Sure. And challenge each other. Uh, I'm having sick change it. So We're allowed we to talk moment. to each other, right? Or do you want to be muted? You can... Uh, no, you'll probably... Uh, I guess... You could have some friendly banter. I don't see a problem with that. You could have friendly banter. The, the, there's no problem with that. It's more so for me to spectate and chat with uh, Norman when Lyon. You, when you join, um, yeah, we'll just be we'll up. Just yeah. Uh, yeah. We'll just hop in. If I guess if we're not in there, it's totally fine because most people we won't be in there for. Oh, oh, yeah. so that's not perfect. Entertainment for our own stream. Yeah. How do we know who we're going again? It's, uh, it's in the bracket. Yep. Oh, okay. 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 <clears throat> Sorry. No worries. It's Daniel and Daniel. So, do we make the games now? Uh, yeah. We'll just uh, you're gonna hop in the call. Yeah, make the game against each other. To make the game, by the way, if you guys don't know, um, all you need to do is do create private game, hit max players two, make the name, and then just put it in general chat and at the person. That's who, okay. who, who we got here. Well, I should be good to make ours, I think. Uh, All right, Logic, I'll jump in your little thingamabob in Discord. Sounds uh, good. This is, by the channel. way, this is a best of one. You can use any pack. Mm, okay. And uh, should if you we, get eliminated, you're out. Should we be in the same call as our opponent? Yes. Okay. Yeah, just hop And then in. are we streaming our, our perspective? On Discord, yeah. I mean, only okay. one of you really... I, you know, I guess it'd be a bit cool if both of you did, yeah. Yeah, just stream your POV. Okay. <laughs> Yeah, yeah sounds, sounds good. good. About the way that my stuff hooks in through OBS, it like it always shuts off. Yeah, Jeremy, um, I know your shit screen. fucked. That's good. You're good. <laughs> Sorry about that. Uh, and also, if you uh, don't start round two, is the only other thing. Oh, okay. So if you make it, so wait, told. wait until everyone's done. Yeah. All right, we if we good? Can we go? Can I go to stand? Yeah, go off, go off, go off. All right. Uh, just so enter this. your group, um, or just enter wherever. Good luck, everybody. Fuck. All right, where am I going? Hey, what's up with all the licks in your chat? Um, I I don't I don't know. I mean, they like licking. How, how did you have my chat open? I am restreaming your stream and then uh, putting my face over your face so people don't notice that there's an audio to video delay. <laughs> Appreciate you telling me. <laughs> All right, where, uh, where where am I going? Round one, group uh, four. Jerma, you are up against Wendy. Wendy, yeah. Hi. Um, so just any call with Wendy, yeah, you can enter. Yeah, I. You know, people didn't really, um, uh, you know, heed to the to the group location. So. Uh, okay, I see, I see. So you can pick a random one of these rooms. You could just pick any room. Okay. How about uh, round one, group one? That sounds good. Mm-hmm. Uh, and Saikuno is going to be going up against Buddha. I don't like it when they do the thing and then they put my at after it. Like, I know that it's not actually licking me, but I kind of feel like a presence. Wait, what do you mean by that? Like the lick thing? Yeah, like I kind of feel like I'm being psychically assaulted. <laughs> well, you know that you said that they're going to do it like... 10 times as much yeah that's uh, that's my plan <laughs> that's my <laughs> secret you like being psychically assaulted. exactly um alex you can just make the code and then send it in general to mango do we do we just start right away though yeah you can just start okay cool we're just gonna run all these ones at once gotcha um and me and you we're gonna hop around what, yeah, is there a match you're excited about you want to take a look at um i want to see uh like 9v16, so I, I think the one with, with Anthony, to see if he actually buys pets this time. Because mm. I think that this is his last-ditch effort to possibly stay in the game. It would Otto be a versus upset. Anthony. Yeah, Otto versus, versus Anthony. Yeah, let's take a look. Uh oh Oh! 
Hello, gentlemen. Oh, it's a draw, Poggers, dude. Let's go. <laughs> Yo, I told you, man. You ain't got shit on me, bro. I watched the tutorial right, 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 for right. like five Damn. minutes, man. I am cracking Damn. this. Are game you getting now, lit up in here, Otto? Oh, he's getting lit. Yeah, I drew he's getting turn lit. one. It's not getting lit up. <laughs> he's going down, bro. You're going down, man. Listen, I watched the tutorial. Right now, I watched uh, the you tutorial. Know. You're going down, bro. 100%. <laughs> hey, hey turn two, I destroy you. Uh, oh, wait. You only have like 30 seconds. Good luck, gentlemen. Oh, God. This is Otto's POV. This is Anthony's. Anthony's on the left side, Otto on the right. Boys. I'm going to turn off super fast forward for you, Ludwig. Made the right move. Oh, God. <clears throat> hey, that was close, man. Let's take a look at the five something, up and bro. right. I, I don't know what happened, man. Uh, you know what, Ray? I totally didn't int there. It's perfect. No, you're fine. fine. Oh, did you miss Hello, out? guys. How's it going? Hi. Uh, very good. We are the warmish balls. We're the warmish balls and hotcakes. And the hotcakes. Battling it out. Okay, five up is the hotcakes. Ray is the warmish balls. Yeah. <laughs> going into, is this mosquito. your second battle you've had? Mm-hmm. Uh oh. We're, we're in, oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> uh huh. It's the dream. Yeah. That was so satisfying. I've <laughs> never seen a more effective use of mosquitoes in my life. I'm in so physical satisfying. pain right now. I'm in pain. <laughs> what was that? Oh. Okay. Hmm. Uh, what's, what's Five Up's counter here? Okay. Hmm. Interesting. Hmm. Interesting. So, yeah. It's a position for sure. Oh, that was definitely not the play either. Uh, let's take a look at Buddha Saikuno. I imagine this one. Oh, Ludwig, what's up? How's it going, guys? Just Did hop just in and see how you're doing here. We just started. Um, I'm getting absolutely Ludwig, rolled. You rigged this, I'm man. Barely holding on. I Wait, what do you mean I rigged this? Bro, I have no idea what I'm doing. You put me up against like, you know? Well, I got destroyed in the first round, so. Do I win? What you? Um, you I'm almost won that one. I'm you almost rage. won that one. I'm gonna rage. The first Stop few rounds actually win. don't matter to thanks to the new right health now. system. So. You were a single Not HP so away. I wouldn't. I wouldn't beat yourself up for that. Yeah, it was one HP away. It was. It was a close one. Guys, I'm gonna rage, guys. Okay, what? don't. What? Don't rage. Well, I, I wouldn't necessarily do that, but I mean. Uh, let's hop over to Alex in Mango here. Dude, we're seeing so many horses. Every, yeah, a every lot of horse play. we go into is just one one horses as, as far as the eye can see. Ooh. Dirty rat clutched there. Yeah, everyone's everyone's open calm, so I don't want to. I don't want to. I know, yeah. I was trying. I was gonna light them up. I don't <laughs> care if they are in. strangers to me. But then I, so they weren't deafened. I said, okay, I'll I'll reserve a little bit of judgment. Oh, I like this move from Alex, though. This I this team can go the distance. Like an an ox with melon armor on it by default is cracked in the mm -hmm. mid game. Mm -hmm. Like, it can just win you games by itself. And then it's like a garbage uh, disposal. Like, if you've got trash units you don't want, you just pill them right in front of the ox. The ox gets another two attack. Like, this can this can go hard. Yeah. Oh, I just realized I can come in and server deafen people. Ah! They let the ah. shade fly. And now they just suddenly can't talk. Their voice has been taken away from them. <laughs> All right, I, I I mean Mango's pretty good at this game. He's the know. number three super auto pet streamer in the world right now. Okay, I'll take your word for it. Um, maybe number four. You know, <laughs> that, don't don't be too confident in my word. <laughs> I'm. By the way, can I point out another four squad Marty? Yeah, it seems like they deafened me. I did. He's, I did. Oh no! Did they hear me though? 
He's wise to the. <laughs> to yeah, the he caught on quick. Uh, we, we can hear you. We deafen, so you you don't oh. hear what we're talking about. Gotcha. My bad. <laughs> you're good. You're good. If he ever does it again, though, he's not good. Yeah. <laughs> we force him to sell his his worst animal. I feel like you know I, I've. I've learned pretty fast that I'm I pill too early too often. I honestly I'm I'm a big time pill fan. You are. I I love to just like if I've got a garbage unit I'd rather spend okay, one nice. to get the buff than uh, than sell it. Like that I'm telling you that ox is gonna go hard. That's it does that's look gonna good. be hard to come back from. Mango also has an ox, but it does not seem near. I mean, honestly, the dodo is the difference. Yeah, it makes a it's a big. Uh, difference maker. <laughs> I got stun locked. You took my exact wording. I'm uh, not taking the. Apparently, rap. Logic Defender is having trouble against Will Neff. Let's hop in. You got to slow it down, you know. Yeah. I'm yep. deafening you guys. I'm deafening you guys while we commentate for a moment. Fair. Okay. I don't want to hear Will anyway. Okay. <laughs> Will didn't even hear that. That was just an insult. <laughs> <laughs> Will is on pay to win, and he's running like. Very, it's, it's almost Germa's build from last time. Very food focused with a 5-5 five, five ladybug, a caterpillar that in three rounds is going to start stealing stats from something else. But everything else is basically the exact same as it right now. So I don't know, to be honest. So this, he, this could go he either won. Way. He straight up won the bracket, um, the entire 16-man group. And Will was the eighth seed. He's playing on like a mobile phone in like the middle of Los Angeles. It hasn't lost yet. It is pretty crazy. I want to see what uh, what Logic Defender's team looks like because I think that there could be like a sleeping giant factor where if you play it slow early, take some trash animals, but they give you scaling, you could come out and, and just clean house at the end. That's a good bat. Level two bat early is, is pretty spicy. You got a great hit on it as well. The worm could get strong. I, honestly, I still think this one could go either way. Uh, yeah, I'm, I mean, I like Alaskan bullworm. Seems like Will's going for a good pivot. I don't think butterfly makes any damn sense though. Yeah. He needs something for the butterfly to actually hit. That's the problem. He's right now, like bird it, it's, it's going to get debuffed <laughs> right now. Like it's going to be like an eight, nine, and then it's going to inherit the six, six swan stats. But okay, I guess the we'll dumbest. See possible thing he could do i think is use that caterpillar on the caterpillar uh i i think you could do it either way like I, get, I don't think you need with so much hp you don't need to level it up early i like rolling two caterpillars though if you can make it work it's, wait like two you know, butterflies yeah yeah you're, it you're takes is a lot of setup time but hey this is the it's the ludwig invitational like if you're not gonna bring the creative plays to this then then why'd you even show up yeah, I actually really appreciate you saying that. People have been talking about that. Oh, he's thinking. I pretty much think he just rushed a debuff. Yeah, with the good news of in this, he might be saying this on his own stream, but now the Caterpillar will level up on turn seven, which will give him early access to tier five units, which if he's getting a little desperate or he thinks might be a good time to make a pivot, might actually be in his best interest but it, it seems ambitious for now for sure okay i yeah i uh definitely yeah exactly what he said turn seven. Oh, got rid of the garlic this is the greatest bat i've ever seen in my life the bat is doing great work a lot of people after the bat got nerfed and weakness got nerfed they uh, they were singing the praises of its demise mm -hmm. it's i mean just removing equipment's enough Exactly. That's my philosophy. Logic Defender, he picked one win up. Now he's falling off a little bit. I love Amoeba. It's a lot of fun. It's so a hard it, counter to bat. It People don't see it sometimes because they it, it doesn't show up that much, especially if you're not playing pay to win. But Amoeba is like a bat on steroids. It replaces equipment on everything with weakness. So if you run an Amoeba at the front and then a turtle just behind Logic, it, are you there? Everything gets weak, and Logic, then the melon armor me? supplants it. <laughs> it's okay. Oh, he's going with it. I want to like see this, this one. We'll move after this game because I think Will's just thirsty for some shit talk. <laughs> I like this a lot. I think this is a big play. The only thing you definitely want to see a turtle because this mm -hmm. works on the element of surprise. 
So starting like in the next round, in arena, this could get you like 10 wins, easy, uh, if you got a turtle with it. But in versus, Will's going to be able to counter, or sorry, uh, yeah, Will's going to be able to counter this uh, if he gets beaten by it a couple times and might be able to counterpick it in the future. So I, I don't know if it's the right time, but we'll see. Oh, yeah, he'll just literally see and then just change. Yeah, like run his own turtle or In arena, or you go through like, like five Northern Lion viewers. You know. Those are easy wins, though, because I still run into people every round. They're still doing horses. Every, and then they go, you just don't understand. You haven't seen it work. And I'm like, thanks well, that's, for the free I don't win. know who they're watching. I, can't, <laughs> I, I literally don't know who. You're not the, the horse popularizer? I promise you, I, I, I chastise horse users. I'm glad to hear it. A man of taste. This was a great amoeba. I think it's going to get the job done. The, the thing is, like, it working once is, like, guaranteed. It'll be interesting to see if, if Will can pivot on his smartphone at the corner of, you know, California and Van Ness right now with <laughs> the sun beating down on him. Yeah, let me undeafen these guys. Let's move over to a five up Ray. Actually, no. Hello, guys. I'm going to deafen you while we just commentate over for a moment. Okay. Ray perennially sounds stressed out playing this game. We're trading back. And yeah, I, oh, she. Deafened us. <laughs> oh, I'm I'm looking at the F five ups team. I'm, it's a good team in composition, but it's I think it's getting to the point where it's like a little bit late. Like yeah, you this is the kind of team. Still running peacock. Exactly, like a peacock with a B, a five six dog at turn eight is a little weak. And I always find like whale sheep. Is fun, but it's a little wow. ambitious to think it's going to be. Oh, that was embarrassing. He did that on stream. <laughs> oh, buying a seal? Or, oh, no, thinking he had the gold. Yeah, he the, tried yeah, to buy yeah, the pair. Yeah. I, we've all done it, I'm sure. I can appreciate a honey dick, though. Sure, okay. Let's, what? I want to see. Well, because, you know, it's a peacock, cock dick. Mm. Okay, you know, I, I understand. So you got to work for it a bit these days. Yeah, I, I, I get it. This, these are two strange teams going at each other. Uh, two whales, two dogs. Uh, Ray is running a snail in her build. It's a little unusual. Yeah. You know, I think this is some Saikuno influence. I don't know. He's, if, a, he's a snail player? He's just the most devout whale lover to uh, a fault. I think it's a fun unit, but I, I find it a little overrated. And, like, the, the situation there also was, like, why garlic armor is so good. Like, the sheeps do nothing against that worm with garlic armor. They do one damage each. Like, it's just uh, doesn't have enough gas yet. I'm looking at Ray's POV right now. Neither of them have a level 2 dog. That would be, like, probably guaranteed win status here. I see a lot of buying and switching, you know, that's what you can get in versus sometimes, you know, in, in arena, you got to scale completely, but, uh, in versus, if your opponent pivots, maybe you decide a pivot's worth it too. Yeah. I feel like, uh, in, in this game, like, okay, you do arena. I need to build a team to scale one versus one. You're like, all right, let me just buff these absolutely shitty units and try to steal away as many hearts as I can as quickly as possible. Yeah, yeah, I think so. there's like a, almost like a fighting game psychology that happens with it. Or you could just run two whales against each other, I guess. But yeah, that also works. I think I think Ray's in a good position here. Level two dog and worm both give her scaling. She's got a rooster, which is one of the best units in the game when it gets buffed. The ox is going to get, I mean, it's probably going to be a 10-9 by the time it attacks. Maybe, maybe a 12-9. A I, I think she probably takes this round. What's five up got? He's still thinking. Oh, he's. Oh, I like Whale Mammoth a lot. You know, it. I, I think that <laughs> the benefit of Whale Mammoth is maybe it helps get the garlic armor, make that less of an issue. But I, I, I don't know. I still like raise odds here. Yeah, I guess. It just, should... just on dog man. Although 5 Up has a level 2 dog now as well. I we'll do see. think it's weird to use a whale on probably your strongest unit, though. Yeah, there's some debate for sure. Like, is it worth using the whale to get the trigger when you'd rather have the stats instead? But I don't know. We'll see. Hey, this is curtains. <laughs> I think he still has one loss left that before he gets lethal. But, I mean, he's asking a lot of the seal right now for sure. I'm imagining it's a, it's a Ray win. Let's move over to Saikuno. All right, 
Hey guys, oh, Ludwig, you're back. How's it going? Just came to spectate a bit. Ludwig, I just Yo, I just want to ask if I if I lose this, am I out moves. of the tournament? You would be eliminated, yeah, if you did lose this. Well, thank God I'm probably not going to lose this. <laughs> He's in the call what? with a Saikuno. Well, I mean, it's not fair, I, man. It's it's it's. It's, He's it's got 10 attack? Oh, he's got a level 2 bus, man. Yeah, a level 2 bus from the whale. And then another bus comes out. You guys have very similar builds. It just feels like Saikuno is the older brother right now. <laughs> what? I don't know what I'm doing, bro. Like, you I'm know, just you're not say, doing the that shark bad. Is carrying. The shark is carrying this for sure. Look at this thing go. And then double melon. Double melon for the chicken and the shark. Oh. Chicken, it kills that thing. Oh god! Chicken kills that thing. I got. It. Last chicken's kind of weak. It's this not gonna kill beautiful. a dog, but the melon armor I think will will cover it. This shit. is beautiful. I, I imagine the death note playing right now. We did it. Yo, this is. Oh, rigged. it's over. Me against I'm a barely held on. Barely. Oh, it was a close uh, one. Uh, you know, great job, guys. Great job out there. It's rigged. It's rigged. We did it. Against professional. I want to call rigged on this tournament. I got destroyed. <laughs> Uh, let's let's hop back over. Let's see who else is out here. Abe and Yeti. It's here. How deep are we in this one, boys? Talk to me. The last round. Last, last round. round. What's the hearts at? It's one to three. three to one. Oh, this is whoever wins. This wins the game. Yeah. yeah. Juicy cool. butterfly. Oh God. Abe on the left. Oh my God. Another spider. The turkey build of a lifetime. Oh, it was two away. Oh. Big gorilla. Yeah, that is a big gorilla. Big gorilla Let's gets go. it done. Hey, with wow. one HP left. He had me at one HP when he had 10. <laughs> what a close game. Did Dan Corona win? Holy shit. Hold up. Let's hop in, uh, in with Dan. It's Wait, big upset. Dan, go. Dan, what happened here? I fucking gambled in the DLC. Can you show your winning team? What, 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 what? It's right here. What took down? So, Stans okay. was, I think, the, the favorite. Really? I, yeah. I would argue. Yeah, his DLC, Butterfly, was killing me. And I, I dropped in the Scorpion and just completely flipped the script. Wow. Tiger Dodo level three. Is that even... You have like the worst rooster in the world. <laughs> <laughs> He's, he he drops a fifty because of the dodo, and then gives like troops in front of it with the extra life that just like eat the coconut melon or the 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 melons to get rid of. Because he had a did lot of melons. Did you go duck shield. strat? Talk to me. Duck strat into I had a I had you did dodo, go du you crab, ducked him peacock. Yeah 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 duck strat dodo crab peacock garlic the peacock have him give his high health to the crab. The crab takes right. the damage from the dodo. I scale with giraffe and monkey, then pivot to either tiger or scorpion or uh, buffalo if I have a level three. Um, shroom rooster doesn't even do anything. Roost, rooster pivots I mean the shroom. Um, well with the um, with the uh, the dodo because if I get him to level two, he drops two fifty chicks, two like fifty damage chicks, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. and just like time. roll through shields. Two chicks. Yeah. Same time. So if he if he's this far back, like like third row or like third spot. Um, the two in front of him are dead, so he can drop two level. He has room to drop like two or three level fifty chicks, depending on what level he is, with the with the dodo and then double tiger scaling. So it's just like it, it, they die immediately, but it's like fifty damage, fifty damage, fifty damage. You know. Damn, damn. All right. Well, let's. Uh, congrats. You know, you're moving on to semis. Let's see what else is going on here. Thank you. Thank you. Five thank of you. Valkyrie. And while we wait for everyone else, Ray. Yeah, Who won it? Oh. Ray, did you win? Oh, they oh. finished. I won. Ray won. I won. You did <laughs> win. Very close, yeah. All right, I, can't I think that's it. just about everyone then. So let oh. me go oh, update boy. the brackets. Okay. I'm going to hop in general if you guys want to hang. Oh, baby. Ray wins that one. All right, I think for semis, we're just going to go one game at a time, chat. So it's just going to be uh, two semifinal matches, one from each bracket. Oh, so which, who's oh. going first? Who's going first? So it's going to be Ray? it's going to be Logic. Uh, excuse me, no. It's going to be Dan and Ray are going to play right now. Logic, Yeti, you hold till they're done. Sure. And then um, it's going to be 
Otto Mango, Saikuno, Wendy, hold till they're done. Sounds good to me. Woohoo! All right. Uh, let's get it started. You can just join semi groups one. That's Saikuno. I'm trying to think. No, no, excuse me. That's uh, Otto Mango. No, it's Dan Ray. I'm Dan I'm smoking Ray. reefer. Okay. Dan Ray, you're auto uh, your group one, and then Auto Mango, your group two. Sure. Uh, okay. And Auto, you just set it up and put the code in general. Mango will join. Yeah. Let me uh, let me just make sure I, I I'm very clear. If I lost that last game, that means I'm out of the tournament. It is single limb. Yeah, you're out from here. Okay. But thanks for playing, Jerma. I actually had a great time. I hope you had fun. <laughs> it was man. like actually it was like really fun. Uh, it's oh. a, it feels like a bit of a Jerma game. It's a yeah. great game. I I love it. Some people have called it the next battleship. <laughs> I, I mean, I, I don't know if I'd go that far, but yeah, you know, <laughs> so addicting too. Give it a couple it's of months. battleship was pretty fun. It was really fun. Jump of the Good. gun here, Northern Line. I mean, it's not that big. Uh, all right, let's get it started. If you guys are want to spectate, or if you're like waiting, you can hop in. Just um, like mute okay. and. Um, Wait, so where, where do I go? I go to Semi's group one or? Number so it's like, you know, we're going to hold your match because we're just doing okay. two oh. right now. So it's going to be uh, Dan and Ray and then Auto Mango. Uh, oh, so I watch Ray's game. You just watch Ray's game, yeah. Okay. Thanks for yeah. having me, by the way. Thanks, Bye. Alex, so much for playing, brother. Yeah. Yeah. I'll, uh, I'll see you guys later. Bye, guys. All right. Good peace out, brother. Uh, all right. Bye. Hop in, get Bye. it started, you two. Or you four. All right. Uh, and we're going to occasionally hop. Oh, I should tell him. You too. Uh, we're going to still hop in and I'll occasionally deafen you guys. Okay. Um, you, 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 we still hear you when you talk. Oh, uh, okay. You know, Dan, we heard you talk to yourself for like five minutes. There's a little embarrassing, <laughs> but, but <laughs> sorry. I, me and Stan <laughs> were, uh, chatting. We were talking shit, you know, throwing yeah. insults back and forth. Yeah. You guys were, you guys were pretty savage. Um, <laughs> but if we do deafen you all and deafen you when I hop out. All right. Sweet. We um, Ray, I promise not to talk shit. I will. I will stay well mannered. Oh, okay. Oh, you, you definitely won't, cause she's so good at this game. She's it's gonna win. <laughs> don't worry, so I, sorry I got your back, him. Ray. I got you. like a hired hype man. <laughs> oh god. I got Saikuno to deal with too. Yeah, you, you got him, it's Ray. You got him. All right, Northern Line. Let's hop over to semi group one. Uh, well, I want to hear your predictions. I think the the whole bracket just got turned upside down by Dan beating stands for sure. Yeah. I look, I'm not trying to be a hater. I think that there were it was a tale of two different kinds of teams that we saw in the quarterfinals. Uh there were teams that were a little mid, you know, a lot of whales, a lot of horses. Then there were some teams that were like mathematically optimized, like the Tiger Dodo Rooster team. You can't always control what you get in the shop. It's not always player difference, but I, I think that we could, as much as I'd like to see some close games, I wouldn't be surprised to see like a clear Mods, delineation let's do predictions from the, for Dan the people Ray. who are rolling as many monkeys as possible early and the people who are just here to have fun with some whales. Uh, you know, I can appreciate all that commentary. I think you, I think you make some great points here. That's why, and that's why you don't play. It's because you have too much wisdom to drop as a commentator. I'm it's because I worried that I would be in the stands position where I would be a favorite and then lose and then like honestly end up crying on stream and, and i don't know if i would ever recover from that and then you can never play the game again i'll be like oh they ruined it new patch ruined it uh yeah that's what you gotta do it's the heart system uh let's watch uh let's check in semi groups too because i think they started their bit in it okay mango is so fast yeah, I'm trying to pull up their teams here. Let's see. Well, I tried. Staff is is a little ambitious for sure. Oh, the uh, is this Auto? Yeah, Auto has a giraffe going. I actually think that in the new patch, the giraffe is kind of playable because it its stats actually suck, but you get more time for the buffs to come out. I mean, are we judging three though? I mean, three squad Marty is is very unusual. That's atypical. Yeah. But this is a big fish. That is a big fish. That's I mean, I like the elephant at the back for Mango out of uh, as some ballast. Like, man, that's a three squad Marty wins. Wow. And it looks like he has yet to lose. And is also running with like 13 frames. <laughs> I've noticed that as well. <laughs> <laughs> it's like so 4K. I've never seen the game look better, but it has zero frames. 
Let's see. You you keep an eye on Mango there. I've got Otto. Yep, Mango, the thing about him, so I tried teaching him this game. I'm the one who showed it to him. Uh, okay. And the first day I played it, he just, he likes, he's the highest APM of any Super Auto Pets player in the world. He seems to play with his heart, for sure. Yeah. Not that the squad is bad here. A, a Dodo is uh, is optimistic, for sure. It's very playable. I don't think I'm he thought much about, because he has three gold, and he's looking at honey and meat, because he used all the animals in his shop. Can't right. really roll. I mean, I guess you could roll, sell, buy, but he's Auto just stuck now. <laughs> I I think you gotta in, in my opinion at least on this one is you roll meat on the elephant Ooh. and then you you got an eleven seven elephant basically well, is he listening? It's exactly <laughs> what he did. It's exactly what he did. He's deafened, so he can't even hear you. Okay, this is and just then great. Otto minds. Otto is trying to figure out where to put the giraffe. What what dance partner is he gonna stick with long term? It looks like he's gonna go for an eleven ten fish. And then probably everything else on his squad that you see is sheep, an elephant, and a peacock. They're probably not going to be long for this world. But that, that giraffe and that fish are going to be, you know, team captains for a little bit. I'd like to watch this fight, then hop over to the uh, champion bracket. But uh, early Ram? Why do you put Ram in first spot? I, I think that... It might have been a slight oversight, but I also think like Ram in first slot. I think it's a little underrated, quite frankly. But okay, speak to that. Uh, I just think that the second Ram that you get out of it is not always that valuable. Sometimes having good positioning can be a little bit more, uh, more important, have more of an impact. I think. All right, a perfect draw. Seems like this will be a tight one. Let's hop over to winners. Oh. Wait, have you guys not got it set up yet? Oh wait, no, you're in it. They're deep in it. Oh, I started. Quadruple duck. Come on. <laughs> wait, he's actually doing the duck build. Dan is a one trick, is what I've learned. Because he's played this I call game the duck build for a couple of days, and he exclusively uses duck builds. Um, I think which, it's really, really, really good. It's great, and I, I'll call it the stand strat. Stans actually entered this tournament, and he said, I'm not going to use the duck build because it's so cheesy. Uh, and he swore it off. Dan, on the other hand, has $90,000 of student loans and said, I will use whatever tools I have. <laughs> I, I don't care. So I, this is a guaranteed loss in this round, but then the shop that they get on their next turn is going to be a monster. Yeah. yeah, I'm kind of excited to see the shop. I think with the new health system, the duck is actually more useful. I, I losing the early rounds more. doesn't hurt as badly. I mean, he is he's down four hearts. So that's a bit tougher. And he found a fifth. He just rolls for ducks. Okay, now this is still it, doing he's, it. He's flying a little close to the sun, in my opinion. Uh -huh. Oh, he, he's second thoughts. <laughs> it's, he's having a crisis of faith. I think he's trying to do some math here. You know what a good duck buff would be? He just rolled past a duck, too. What, I don't know what he's looking for. I think he's looking Maybe for he's, his payoff unit. Yeah, now. he's trying to set it up for the big sell-off. So I'm trying to think. He's he's gonna he wants to keep <laughs> that, that crab good. for some unit to go with. He wants uh -huh. the dodo to buff the crab's HP, and the dodo is gonna be like a five eight or something crazy. Yeah. Um I don't know. I, I think he's just looking maybe for as crazy as it sounds, maybe like a whale that comes out as a 7-Eleven after the duck buffs. Even if it doesn't eat anything, you've got a 7-Eleven whale and then a 311 crab, which is actually going to be like 811. I can't even do the arithmetic in my head. If right he now. ends up winning this, I'm going to say Duck might need a buff or a, a nerf. What? I mean, a, a nerf, a nerf, a nerf. <laughs> <laughs> misspeak, a misspeak. <laughs> Devs, please. I feel like if you sell Duck, it should maybe not give you a gold. Um, it's a, I, I do think it needs a change because I, I think, especially after this, it's just going to take the, the meta by storm if it hasn't already. What is he? Oh, mm -hmm. he wants peacock. He's spending a lot of gold to make it happen. I'm yeah. just, we'll see. Is yeah, he this double is, crab. Uh, it's a big gamble, I think. In the meantime, Ray has a a bison, so she's looking to get a level three. She doesn't have it yet. She's two away on a fish, two away on a swan. But if that bison starts popping, it could be, it, it could be competitive. 
Yeah, I'm a little shocked that he rolled by that turtle, too. I feel like a turtle would have been great. And he also didn't freeze his 8-8 crab, but I guess it's weird to freeze. I don't know. All in all, uh, this man confuses me, and somehow, somehow he still has three people on his squad. That looks really strong, though. I mean, yeah, That's a big crab. And, and garlic as good cover. as it is, I, I think if Ray can get some equipment, like I think if she can get some meat so she can punch through those early units, like the problem for Dan now is the rest of his shop is gonna like pale in comparison. Like what do you, when you already have like a 12-12 a this early, what do you spend three mm. gold on? You know, so I, I, I think that she can still, she can still hang if she gets her units some equipment. You're saying can't go back to weed after doing heroin. Exactly. You'd what? like when it, when you've got a, mm -hmm. a tier one unit that's like an eight eight. What are you gonna buy? Like a one four? It seems like a waste of money. So you just end up rerolling twelve times instead. This is a weird order. If you want to pop back to, do you see Dan's order here? I uh, so this is uh, a, a little known technique called the dodo chain. Because of the way that the the actions take place in the game. The units with the highest attack have their abilities happen first. So the dodo at the back will pass its attack to the dodo in front, which will then pass all of that attack to the crab. Uh, but it, wow. you give up a lot, of, a lot of space. You give up a lot of real estate just to make one thing happen. But the plan is you add another dodo in like your next shop roll, then you got a level two and you got more space for things to, to really start percolating back there. All right, what's Ray doing? She's going dog. She's juicing up the dog, it looks like. Don't love the bison. That feels like you're hoping for something. It feels like it's just a dead spot right now, and I don't think she's getting a level three anytime soon. Okay, that's... Oh, that's just a little... Oh, Jesus. That's actually... That dog was huge. Oh, wait a minute. Oh, yeah, you're right. Jesus. Yeah, this is really bad for Dan, I think. Yeah, you, you, I mean, he's you need to so much. <laughs> when you lose four rounds deliberately, mm -hmm. you've really got to pick up the next, like, five or yeah. six, I think. Yeah, he's got so little health left. It's, uh, it's Now, tough. the keys in this, as a spectator, you watch Dan first because he makes all of his moves in about 30 seconds, and Ray spends the entire 90 seconds. Now, it reminds me when I play with someone. Not that it's a bad thing. <clears throat> Wait, are you talking about me because I go slow? I'm a thoughtful player. I didn't say that. I just said it reminded me of some games uh, I've had before uh, is all I said. I, I, but I well, mean, if you, if you remember, so I... Dan did the classic lose and then change absolutely nothing. I think that, I mean, it's not over yet, but on round seven, you gave up way too much to just, you know, stop rolling the dice on a 6-10 peacock. It's just not the peacock can be good for a little bit, but once you get into the late game, you're going up against some teams with like some real scaling. It's it, it's not gonna get you there. You needed a bigger payoff. It is a two star unit. Was that a, a rival tier list? Rival oh, tier, tier, huh? tier two, tier two. Okay. Oh yeah, yeah. <laughs> I mean tier two, like you know the the numbers. I, yeah, um, yeah, yeah. I love this meat roux. Ray is just clap it. He's he's cooked. He's cooked. It's it's uh. This might be over for Dan. Yeah, I mean. All right, what's he gonna do? What's his big strategic change? I don't know. He has know. a level There's... two dodo. It was just kind of weird some... to blow all five ducks on a peacock. Yeah, it just wasn't enough. I I think Ray's going for the kill. With ducks, you gotta just sometimes accept that like selling five of them to get like an early seven eight fish I, even though it's not interesting is is just a better play than being so precious with it oh uh, the is hippo's over. not gonna do very much against the dog ray uh, muffined up this, this has round. to be it's the biggest gg i've ever seen yeah is she this. she bought like a is it a cupcake or a muffin i get a lot of the names wrong in this game but... yeah that was the, that was a she very quick won. semis wow she just absolutely clapped it 12-0 Ray wins. Dan moves on. Uh, let me undefend them. You know, she them. is the person who introduced me to this game. She's Ray, kind of congratulations, <laughs> Dan. Uh, I Ray. got no scaling. Da oh, you know, it was a gamble. It was a gamble, Dan. The ducks. All yeah. in on the, duck. The ducks. I, I, I've never seen ducks like that. I got scared I when you had that crab. Amazing yeah. RNG against stands, and I got no scaling against Ray. One uh, trick duck man takes out one, one of the best duck. in this tournament, but then falls to Ray. <laughs> Well, Ray's a professional. She's been playing she this game for ages. 
Yeah. Ray, I, I, I thought you were bad at this game, but I think you might be secretly cracked and have been selling yourself short this whole time. I haven't <laughs> played the normal one. I've only been playing the expansion, I swear. I thought you were bad at this game. Um, <laughs> I'll say it. All right, let's hop over to the, uh, the other match going on here. How are these people doing? They were close last time we checked. So, Otto is 12 HP. And it just, I, I don't know what Mango has, but that does Nine. Nine? Wow, yeah. no, so they're, they're taking forever. There must be a lot of draws. I think there's been a lot of draws, yeah. Because their units seem pretty strong. I in the C. I do feel like Otto's team is a little bit more... Well, it's tough, because the Hippo can be incredible if you get the, the right kind of opposition. But Dodo Rooster, it's just a matter of time until that starts ruining your life, so... Uh, I'll give it to Mango. You know, Dodo Rooster, not creative. But the other three units, I feel like one of the most creative. Yeah, you Dolphin. don't see a Blowfish too much. Yeah, Dolphin, Whale, Blowfish. That's like... I feel like Mango picks a new team almost every time he plays. And look at that. A 9-10 Dolphin, too. It's been buffed a little bit. Might even go for the level two. I that's what I think is interesting about versus too. Like if you're going up against like a, a rooster build or something like that, you got a level two rooster on the opposition, you get a level two dolphin to counter, you kill the rooster, it doesn't spit out two roosters because there's no space on the board. All of a sudden these units that might not be so good in arena can can actually win you the game in mm. versus if you play your cards right. Yeah. You just need a, you needed the the dolphin hit right. I feel you like if if Mango wanted, they could sell. There, it doesn't seem like they're gonna. <laughs> but he could sell Elephant and Blowfish, and then roll the Dragon and just start swapping Tier Ones in and out to get scaling. But it, okay, it so seems Dragon like hops on screen. Bit. My chat, just everybody types Dragon in all capital letters, right. like like it's the Messiah coming down for his third tour. I I've heard people say it's must buy, and I've heard people say. Every other streamer I watch disrespects it. I think if you've got two spaces that you can, you know, part with, it, it can be really, really good. I think it's viable, but I, it's not, you know, I don't get as torqued over uh, a simple dragon as I do, like, a T-Rex. Oh, I mean, of course, but the the T-Rex the is only in the pay-to-win build, so some might call the dragon the T-Rex of the free-to-play. Uh, that's actually, you know what, the wisest thing you've said all day. Well, thank you. I'll take it. And Mango, since we've tuned in, has crushed him. I'm looking at Otto's team. Otto's team is very... It's built for Arena right now, which might end up working. You know, there's a monkey that's buffing Ooh. a hippo, and a strong hippo is going to do some serious work. There's a penguin. It's buffing a, a It's a GG hippo. over here. I'm sorry to cut you off. It's, it's over. I'm looking at a tiger. Do you think it's going to be a, a tiger behind a level 2 rooster? You throw the tie. I mean, that dodo's not doing that much. You could just sell the dodo. You could you could sell the dolphin and maybe get crazy I, here. I guess. Just like I think that blowfish is gone. I don't. I don't think it's making it. I think knowing Mango, he keeps blowfish. Okay. See, that's the insight that uh, you can only get when you have that kind of relationship with the player. He likes playing cool, and I think he knows deep down that rooster is lame. Anything that's meta is lame, really. So I think he'll yeah. need, like, you know, at least half the units to be cool. Speaking of which, we're going to get a, a counter pick out of Otto. He's got a 12-10 Leopard that he's going to try to use to snipe two of the units on Mango's team. I'm just trying to see. I think they're doing math right now to figure out how they get the Leopard to go after the Dodo so it does more damage. Now Mango's they've got a rolling. tiger. They're oh. trying to figure out where to place the tiger in this complicated Auto web. also gets a tiger. The tiger, it's arguably good. the best unit in the game. Uh, it it complements everything for the most part. Mango so went for they, a counterplay here. Oh, genius. It's tough. Auto's got to do something. They're yeah, that on was... lethal now. Mango loves Scorpion, I think, because it's like, it's just a hard read. Yeah. I mean, when you when you have a big unit at the front and somebody else puts out a 3-3 Scorpion, it's like they just, they own you. There's no other way to, to phrase it. I spend 50 gold on this hippo, you spend 3 gold and just, like, we trade it. It's unfair. Uh, I'm not feeling great about Otto's chances. I'm still, I, I, I love the ambition 
of trying to figure out how this leopard is going to, you know, descend from the heavens and snipe exactly the right <laughs> units. But I, I, mean, I would love to see it. I, I hope they go for it. I, I don't see it. Oh, I can appreciate that play. I, it's a squad. I don't even know how to analyze it. Now, now they're going leopard at the front because they think that the scorpion is going to kill the leopard. They don't want their hippo to die to the, uh, the scorpion, so they move the hippo a little bit further to the back. They got the snake behind that, hoping it'll get some snipes. It's, uh, it, this is going to be a weird one. This is like rolling the dice. This, it's smashed with the items on. Yeah. Yeah, I like that analogy. I I just Mango has rolled like a god. He's looking at level two Dodo, level two Rooster. He's got like basically three fifty fifty units going, or fifty two units, I should say. It's it's really hard to concoct the strategy that beats a buffed level two Rooster. But garlic on you snake, know? I'll tell you what, is not the answer. <laughs> <laughs> that's a desperation play when you've yeah, got that, like four gold left this two hp <laughs> is a game changer <laughs> so the leopard snipe is is basically the only chance here it's got to hit like tiger or rooster oh it doesn't even get the kill oh and the scorpion perfectly lined up yeah that's man uh, I, you can twist yourself into knots trying to figure out where to place the units, and you just read it perfectly. And wow. that's a Mango win. So Mango's going to be in the finals, perhaps playing Saikuno or Wendy. Ray's going to be in the finals playing the winner of Logic and Yeti. Uh, let's go to the general. Let's get everyone involved. Auto, GG's. GG's, Auto. GG's. You see Auto get red? One. What's up? Did you see Otto get hard red with the oh, scorpion? You did you read the scorpion the replacement. But, well, it would have it would have hit my dodo if you hadn't got lucky on your scorpion. I know. A lot of things went right. <laughs> Mango, I think you like scorpion just because you can read where they go. Yeah, he's tight. Uh, anyway, Mango, you are in finals. You're going to wait for the winner of Saikuno Wendy, and you'll play them. I uh, would. I didn't see my mic, though. You're good. You're good. Hello. 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 Hey all right, uh, Wendy, you're going to play Saikuno. You can just mm -hmm. hop in the uh, the semis group two. That's fine. All right. And then Logic, you're going to be playing right now up against Yeti. Yeah, that's good. We're going into semi group one, two. Uh, you know, semi group two and winners. Sure. And uh, and I'll hop in, in a moment. I'm going to take a quick piss. Cool. All right, boys. We are almost done at the tournament. We probably got about like four matches left, and uh, and uh, and uh, yeah, should be fun. Let me piss. Okay, I'll fast forward too then. Oh, Yo, shoot, can you guys go live? Share our games. Oh man, I need to spectate your games. Oh guys. wait, wait, we need to go. Sorry. We need to turn on. Sorry, I was, I was just, oh, God. Oh, I was God. just raring to go. Um, panic, panic.
Logic, make sure to go live when you can. Sure. Yep, yep, yep. And let's do it. Oh, maybe this channel, it's not enabled. Uh... I keep jumping around groups because Northern Lions. Northern Lions trying to enter the call I'm in, so I keep jumping around every time he enters my call. <laughs> All right, let's see. Let's see if he falls for it again. All right. Oh, I think we're good. Ooh, what name is he picking? This is Yeti. He's going for the loose puppies. Like someone, like who let the dogs out? Is that the precursor to who let the dogs out? Loose puppies? Sorry, I was, I, I got, I was off on a rant. I'm back. You're right. I, I was, I'm going to, full disclosure, I was kind of fucking with you a bit because you kept entering my call and I would switch. Oh, oh now I understand. It was, just, it was just me being a bit of a troll. Because I was, I was ranting. I was like, I hate when people enter the call and then leave the call immediately. <laughs> and no, I yeah, was that was me. That was. I, I was actually part. talking about horses. I was just saying that I, I can't believe people are still running horses. You don't thing. go a day without talking about horses. I know. You can't. It's a problem. I know. It's a, well. It's. I think it's like, it's hurting you now more. Like you just gotta let those horse users be themselves. It's free wins, so I don't know why I complain so much. But yeah. <laughs> you're just yelling at the cloud, you know. You're you're inches away from like Bill O'Reilly status. Oh, can I tell you? Like my when my mom was here a couple of weeks ago, I saw a text she sent my dad, and she said, "We'll do it live." F it. They're, my parents are fine. <laughs> what? Like, like the 15 year old Bill O'Reilly memes where he goes, uh, "We'll do yeah, it live." Yeah, fuck it, we'll do it live. Yeah, but they don't Did say the f word even in, when they text each other. They just say f. <laughs> oh, so she <laughs> and she also reversed. She said, "We'll do it live." F it. Yeah, she said f it, capital f. Yeah, that's that's just a cute message. It is. They, 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 they got a cute relationship for sure. Are your parents funny? Um, not as funny as I am. <laughs> yeah. Uh, yeah. yeah, they could be funny for sure. Yeah, that was you know what? That was reassuring. I'm sure if they're watching, they're like, you hear that, honey? He said, yeah. I would want my child to say that I'm less funny than they are. Otherwise, all have failed as a parent. Yeah, that's fair. That's fair. I think if anyone's like, oh, my dad's so funny, you're like, I get it. You're homeschooled. <laughs> He's the only guy you hung out with for the first five exactly. years of your life. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> um, Yeti versus, this is a pretty typical start to like Yeah, any we had game. two very strong gamers here. The, you know, there's ants, there's, uh, there's fishes. They're both playing pay to win, which is a little surprising to me, but... Uh, uh, it, it's pretty close, but I got to say, I always bet on the swan. I think a swan fits into any build. I think the team that has mm -hmm. the swan tends to tends to get a little extra gas moving forward. So I, I do like Yeti's team maybe a little bit more. Yeah, I'm a swan lover. Uh, they both but I have got to wonder, too. if you had entered this event, would you have gone pay to win or free to win? Uh, I think I would have gotten free to play for sure. Like I, I think that pay to win can be better with food early, and like puppy caterpillar is a really consistent strategy. Bats really good, but I, I just, I don't know. The free to play, I, I just feel more comfortable in it. But honestly, I was saying to my own chat, I think Mango probably would have bodied me if I was playing Mango because I just focus on you know getting the stats as high as possible. I felt like he was actually running some kind of like. I don't even know, like like Krav Maga Capoeira strategy that do I. Do you know I, of Mango? Like, do you know who he is? I know he's a melee pro. I I it's, would say you're selling him short with that. He's known okay. as the goat, the greatest oh, of all time. I, I didn't know. Yeah, so you know everything that I think he enjoys about this game is probably just beating someone else, and yeah. like thinking he figured them out or read them in some fashion. Yeah, that, see, I, that's another reason I'm glad I'm on the I'm in the booth today. Mm -hmm. <laughs> you say they got, I can't stand to be red. That's why I, I well, there were two reasons I quit Among Us. One is we had a baby like right as it got popular. Yeah. And then the other one is I hated being red. And then you get the people talk essay after the episode or after the round. I knew because you were schmooving in electrical and you never schmoove in electrical unless you are venting and you're in the empire. And I was just like, I can't handle this for like an extra half an hour after every round. Can you just tweet out, there are two reasons I quit Among Us, and then in parentheses, part one of 15? 
Mm-hmm. <laughs> <laughs> I think it could it could work for sure. You know, I think that, that's like there. a four hundred like tweet at least. Is that good? What do you what do you like in a tweet? Like you tweet something out, you're like, oh yeah, that hit. What's the number that you feel good about that, honey? Uh, one, honey, I got a thousand. Yeah, at one k, I'm like, I I hit above my weight class there. You lift up your kid, you go, hey, you <laughs> Papa's famous. Daddy trended today, <laughs> kind of in a very small <laughs> Daddy, portion of the internet. Daddy trended amongst and then college see, and like, early working class adults. <laughs> People like Saikuno though, they tweet like, "I'm up" or something like that, and it gets like twenty five thousand. And I'm yeah. like, I got a long way to go. <laughs> yeah, that's well, that's what I found out is the key. I've discovered how to do Twitter correctly for Minecrafters. Mm, okay. All you do is you just tweet once every like week and then just you get like 50,000 likes per tweet now. Man, that's genius. It's, you just tweet less frequently. How do you do that though? <laughs> <laughs> it's, it is hard. It is hard not to express my opinion for a moment. I do the thing where I'm like every joke that I have needs to be tweeted immediately. Then I wake up the next day and I'm like, that's not that funny. Like that tweet where I said I want to smoke the shit that Morpheus hit before he went glasses shopping. <laughs> I I was thinking about that for like two hours before I posted it. It was the funniest thing I ever thought of it, or I thought of. Next day I was like, that's not that good. You no, you're selling yourself short. You went live, and then talked about how funny it was. You said you guys see yes. my tweet. I dropped the. Uh, you know, you're like Papa came in with another banger today, <laughs> kiddos. I believe that's my exact wordage, uh, verbiage. Yes. <laughs> yeah, and I, and I looked at it, and I was like, you know, hey. You the, know? The, the glasses are kind of funny. They're funny glasses. I think I like, think it's oh, just the form. It's the format that's outdated. You nailed the format. Yeah. Okay, I'll, I'll work on it. Also, real quick, embarrassing moment yeah. from Yeti. He skipped the bat. Could have had a level two bat. Mm. Um, I, that probably was not intentional. It's no. a, when you're on the main stage, the the nerves get the better it's of the you. The nerves, you no, know? it happens. This Schooled is... finale. I did. They said who conquered the Incan Empire. I, me being a dummy, I said but Juan Ponce de Leon. What was I thinking? Yeah, it's so I, you're so <laughs> you're dumbass. <laughs> I don't even remember who it was to be honest. Now that I think about it, you know, I thought you did great on that show. Oh, thank you. I appreciate it. I I can add I can add two numbers together. <laughs> <laughs> that, better that's than good most enough streamers. to get you into the finals. Yeah. Hey, better than most streamers. That's the difference. Uh, this seems like a close one. Let's hop over to Wendy Saikuno. This is the uh, consolation bracket chat. Winner will go to the finals up against Mango. Uh, for all intents and purposes, I think Saikuno's a favorite. Because he was definitely expected to be in the uh, the big boy bracket. I'm looking at uh, Wendy's squad. It's I gotta say it's like the definition of solid. It's nothing stands out, but you look at it and you say, okay, seven eight fish. That's a level three. Maybe a good bison uh, partner for the future. Mm-hmm. Seven seven mosquito, pretty strong. And honestly, I think the kangaroo is one of the most efficient units in the game. Even though it's a five six, it's probably going to end up being like maybe like a, a nine twelve by the time it comes out. Or a, I, I I can't remember. I think it's one two. It gains every time the unit in front of it attacks. So like this squad is deceptively good on stats right now for sure. Yeah, it does feel average though. You know, like. I'm not getting out of bed to look at this. I'm not oh, excited man, I'm about trying this. to think about my moves a little more, but it's If you have this squad, you don't post a screenshot on Twitter. Correct, yeah. Yeah. I would agree with that. I will say I Saikuno with the the kangaroo really good as against well. Malone. A a good uh, early monkey is like a huge correlation for success as well, but Ooh, I th I think it's just bad math for for Wendy here. Yeah. It's oh. oh never mind. <laughs> you know, hey, that's that's neck and neck. Yeah. Also a close game. Thirteen to twelve. It's so close. That's the thing, right? You look at a two three kangaroo versus like a, a six seven or something like that. Those could like you need to do the math in your head to figure out where they're actually gonna be when you get out there. So yeah, I it, this is pretty close. Two two very normal squads right now. I think the main problem is Saikuno's relying on Cricket to buff the Kangaroo. That can't last more than, like, two more turns. Three, yeah, five, at some Cricket. Point, 
usually you, you, you either end up, that's, that's why I think maybe Wendy has a slight edge here long term. When you get your early units to level three, at least they'll play well with something like a bison uh, and, and give you an engine to get stronger in the future. But I think like a 2277 cricket or a, a tier two seven seven cricket probably is not going to get you there or mosquito, I should say. I'm a little nervous on her time. She's got 30 seconds and nine coins. Freezed two crabs, which is confusing. Just it's like Zach Galifianakis in The Hangover. There's just like animals and mathematical equations swimming in her head right, right. now, and then it's all gonna coalesce at the exact right moment. Which is garlic on the four four spider. That was a shock. <laughs> that was unexpected. <laughs> <laughs> I guess I guess she's thinking she'll sell the mosquito and keep the spider long term. Oh but man. I, I would disagree, but it's like, who's going fine. big I'm spider? I'm concerned, like big but spider. hopefully, oh, that turtle is gonna be really bad for me. That camel okay. This turtle's gonna bit. hurt. Uh, my ox is super buff. I don't know if it's buff enough. Oh, that's unlucky for me, but I think I'll come out okay for the most part. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, I'm okay. I do like Saikuno's monologue. Let me tell you, he does the same monologue even if you he knows you hear him. It's it's very relaxing. It's in it's no, it's upsetting when you're playing him. And he goes, oh, I don't think I have enough. And then he immediately uh, has enough. Yeah. It's the it's the I don't think I did well on this test into an A plus. Oh, I hear that. Yeah. And it's like, oh, OK, you hear that because you were that. No, I was always I did GPA do badly. GPA, well, what's your GPA or your Canadian uh, PA? Well, in high school, it was a four. But in university, oh, I don't know, it, was probably, okay. it was like a three point. And so, you but feel me? You think Canadian, you know me? A Canadian A is 80% plus, so it, it's a lot easier to get a 4.0 in Canada than it is so to get one in So I've heard. Doesn't but let I was, me forget about his Canadian 4.0. <laughs> it was just, we just do it differently up here. Oh, damn. Saikuno's really getting oxes. Mm. I've never gone deep ox. Honestly, I, I think it falls off pretty quick, Ooh. but... I mean, I don't know, because now it's getting four attack per death in front of it. So it's going to be a 1611 with with melon armor. And that's pretty nasty. Oof. You hate I, to see I think Natsumi, I think Natsumi is in some, some serious oh, you got the trouble. Level two actually. crab, level three fish. Yeah. Like a big power up there. I don't a know. Five eight crab is as just long like as it's, this crab doesn't it's not good enough for where okay, we're at in the game. That, is a level he's two riding crab that ox all the way. Even better? It does not does a level two crab not do the same thing? Yeah, it doesn't it doesn't get a, a benefit when it uh when it levels up, it just gets more attack, basically. Yeah, that's a little weird then. Especially because it's taking from an eight health unit rather than just taking from the kangaroo. Uh, it, I think you can do kangaroo behind crab because you'll have like a super tank unit in front of the crab, which lets the kangaroo get insanely good stats behind the crab. But I, this right now, I think she's got to dump the sheep for sure. And maybe maybe try doing some snipes. Like a, a dolphin or crocodile could... Mm. Croc would be kind of big. If you could somehow snipe the ox before it, it starts to get powered up, I mean, you'd need, like, a level 2 dolphin to hit perfectly, but... I'm thinking that she does not have enough lives to make it through because she only has, what, two more? Two more attempts? Yeah, two more. Let's hop over I... real quick to the other side. Uh, this one, it seems like they've had a lot more draws. It's seven and nine HP. Well, okay. Uh, <laughs> this is crazy. Logic is running two goats, uh, which is you, you really, I mean, that's unorthodox. Two, Wait, what, two, what is that? What does it even mean? What is two goats? Uh, when you buy an animal and you have a goat, the goat gives you one refund gold per animal. So right now, every time they buy an animal, they're spending three and getting two back. Right. Okay. Uh, so it's one gold for an animal. Yeah, the problem is, what is that trying to like? Dude, look at what's this. the benefit of it right oh, now? Oh, this caterpillar is almost gonna debuff. Oh, this is uh. There's no way Logic wins this round, but if like a dragon or something shows up, oh, 
and then I, I honestly have no idea what, what is happening here, but I, I don't doubt it though. I, uh, I, yeah. I, they must have something up their sleeve if that's what they're, if that's what they're trying to pull. Well, let's see. Let's see. This is uh this is a big turn for them. Yeti looks like he's running basically a, uh, you know, conventional tier list team. Yeah, which seems to be working out for now. <laughs> but I, I'm okay. So I I see that there's a lot of tabbing going on here. Uh, Logic is trying to figure out what he just lost to and build the perfect counter. This is a a very strange team. Yeah, and he has two lives to uh to make something happen. It looks like he has a few cans though. Seven seven off spawn for the rooster. I'm wondering maybe maybe he did a chicken level one build. It, like you can buy a chicken and then buff everything in the shop by just cycling tier ones as much as possible, but I, this I, I can't see how this could win. <laughs> I don't mean to be dismissive, oh! but it's let's see. He was given the gift of goats. He might want to save that snail. Hey, King, save that snail. That's a sign from God. You don't pass that snail. I, I, the tabbing is so. <laughs> I I. It's like it's creating the. <laughs> that there's some kind of master plan about to happen. Yeah. I, I, mean, I think what it is... The snail, like, there's a chance he wins this one? So the plan is that the skunk goes and nerfs the unit that they're gonna give the butterfly HP to. So that's... Yeah. And that happened, which is really good. I'm I'm losing my mind, because actually this gorilla is gonna go ham here. Wait, is he gonna win? No. He might not be as far no! off... No! What? This is actually like like Giga Brain 300 IQ stuff here. All right, quick and update. And the best part is the goat is gonna. It's so sellable that he can upgrade his squad so easily at any point. Okay, quick update. Saikuno did win the other bracket, beating Wendy. I don't think that's too much of a shock. When we left, he was kind of crushing with his ox. Yeah. But this is this is interesting. He I've seems never like he seen wants this to before. Drop a pill here, maybe. Just tab a couple times first. Yeah, yeah I love the tabs. <laughs> I think now, and, and I might be out of my intellectual weight class here, I think he's trying to make sure that the math works out so his gorilla will live long enough to get its coconut armor to pop. Yeah, and I think bullworm in front would be a bit of a game changer. I guess it won't do enough still, though. This is... It's mighty interesting. Four, four squad. <laughs> 13, 13 gorilla. Butterfly level two skunk level two goat. If if this works, I got to shred the tier list. Even if it doesn't, he has two cows waiting. Yeah, okay. That's what I thought would happen. But I think he still lives. The skunk is doing uh, amazing work. Wow. It's basically like ruining two units at the same time. This is a good gorilla. This is, it's actually insane. In a draw, oh, not even a draw. Oh my God. I mean, when you lose to a, a, a four squad that has a, a goat and a, and a skunk and a gorilla, you just kind of, I think you just bow down. Oh, and you dude, just, cows are so good for him because he buys the cow, he gets gold back, and then he sells the cow. It's a one. Yeah. Two coins for 8-8? Eight, eight? Like, it's it's actually crazy. Like, you're, this is just being... And I, I want to be clear, you know, to people watching from Yeti's perspective, I would be getting bodied as well. Like, this is you, this is just a situation where you're being outthought. No, Yeti's team looks like he just pulled up, you know... Northern line tier list. You went, okay, butterfly is pretty good. I got a worm here. Oh, T-Rex. That's nice. It's a great team. I mean, how, how do you lose with the great scaling from a T-Rex? You got almost a max worm at, uh, you know, round 12. You got a caterpillar inheriting the stats from the worm. Like, I, I think that Logic Defender is running a team that probably gets its ass beat in arena. 
Maybe I'm I'm Ooh. maybe speaking above my weight class saying that, but but in verses it's it's cracked right now. He went for a last second goat sell too, so he got a lot of value out of the goat and then brought out the T Rex. So it's double Rexes now. It's an it's an incredible play. You know how like Green Lantern is weak against Sinestro because Sinestro can make things that are yellow and Green Lantern specifically can't counter that. Like that's what's happening yeah. right here. Hundred percent. Of course I know that. Sinestro. Sinestro, yeah, it's looked up. Mm -hmm. Say <laughs> less, see King. the Green Lantern movie? <laughs> <laughs> it's pretty bad. Don't go a day without watching it. Oh, the melon armor is a game changer. They're perfectly even T-Rexes. <laughs> and that's only because of cans, too, actually. He just had a lot of cans because it's a level 1 T-Rex versus a level 2. This is uh, it's a battle of minds, not merely a battle of animals. Um... This is game point, by the way, if Yeti loses. So he can't sell the gorilla. He can't sell the skunk. He can't sell the caterpillar. Mm -hmm. But he could at any point pivot the T-Rex or pivot the scorpion. For example, you could run two scorpions instead of one scorpion and one T-Rex. Guarantees you one kill. Because uh, the first one, at worst, will burn off melon armor. Or, I, have, I don't want to interrupt his thought pattern right now. <laughs> He's tabbing. <laughs> He's tabbing. I don't know why he tabs, because every single round that Yeti has played, he has put the worm uh, close to the front or in the front. And then he was like, no, I'll put the scorpion in the middle. So I don't, I don't really know what the tabbing's doing for him. Yeah, this is so good. This I, is I, like way ahead of me, like, just psychologically. <laughs> This is, you know how like Mango tried to specifically put the scorpion to find a position? Yeah. This is the nerdy version of that where he's trying to like Y equals MX plus B. Find the exact line. See, don't, don't uh, besmirch your own intellectual capacity. Y equals MX plus B. That's, that's 4.0 speak right there. <laughs> that's finding a slope in the sixth grade. I think we didn't even learn negative numbers until like the ninth grade up here. I don't know a what big bullworm. Let's see. Lots of melon armor. Oh, three HP. And he's gonna lose. Dang, that was so that was uh that was bad order. Bad order, and you know the turtles are, are doing a lot for Yeti now as well. It, no matter what, this is match point, unless it's a draw. Yeah. And he's okay. I like selling scorpion, going snail, selling snail, going scorpion. It's a nice little little cycle. Nothing in that shop is particularly useful, but I, you know, I would have said that about a gorilla and a goat what? and probably a skunk as well. So he sold apple or bought app. I mean, I guess you know, I guess that was a it was a math play. <sighs> oh, because at uh, at thirty one damage. The gorilla will kill something <laughs> through melon armor. Yeah. Uh -huh. and he's getting a plus two, plus two buff here. Okay. He's tapping for a reason. There's there's math to this. He's, he's yeah. Tapping. Oh, and he that's right. He gets the gorilla to 31 HP, so it'll live through a, uh, through a scorpion or through any attack. Indubitably. This is it's a little tough to follow. <laughs> Just enough that that one apple is going to be the reason he doesn't lose. They're on X Games mode right now. That's crazy, crazy if he's right about it. If he lives with one HP. <laughs> I gotta give this guy some credit. He's thinking with his noggin. And this is is this too much. His last one. Winner goes up against Valkyrie in the finals for all the marbles. It's funny that in the other winner's semifinal, it was just uh Dan rolling ducks. And then basically just burning <laughs> out. And then this one is like the world chess championships. Yeah, this is art. This is this is Magnus Carlsen versus Anand. Ooh. Good pull. Good pull. Interesting order. Okay. Coconut I'm armor. Does fortunate some great amount of work. HP. Yeah, Scorpion doesn't finish the job. I. I think Yeti's going to win it. I believe 
It is game over. Logic Defender had a chance, though. I think that squad wins with different order. And actually, like, incredible match. Yeah. Yeti, Yeti, uh, he had his work cut out for him. Uh, but that is over, which means... Hey, GG's Logic. GG's Yeti, close game. Hey, that was a great well war, gentlemen. Great war. That was, that was very that, close. The skunk gambit was so much better than I thought it was going to be. Oh, the skunks <laughs> are undervalued, man. That was insane. <laughs> uh, all right, we are in it for finals now. Nice. Uh, Saikuno, I heard you won this one. Yep, barely as close as close. Congratulations, um, Wendy. Good job on, on getting top three. Yeah, thanks. That was cool and badass. Uh, we're now <laughs> going to go to finals. I think we'll do Saikuno versus Mango first, and then we're going to do Ray versus uh, Yeti after that. Yeah, makes sense. Um, so makes let's jump exciting. in. Give me just a couple of minutes. Get the lobby set up. Don't jump in just yet. Uh, okay. We I'll should both go to the finals and start up the old stream, right? Yeah, just go to the finals, start up the stream, but don't start the match just yet. Okay. All right, Thank see you guys in just luck. a moment. Well, the reason we're not going to start a chat is, well, it's a great reason, in fact. It's one of the best reasons in, in, in the world. Because if you guys don't know, we're $4,000 is going to the uh, the winner of the championship bracket. 2000 going to the winner of the consolation bracket. And you guys can check out good old Luna Mattress to get a win of your own. Luna. Luna Couch Transport. Luna Couch Transport Let's just take a quick look at this at, at this video. Woo! Luna Luna Couch Transport. Luna Cloud Gaming is the future. Wait, is that Ovali? Luna Cloud Gaming is the future. The future of you getting absolutely destroyed. Could you just pick a game? On it. Ah! I'm coming for you, Sancho! I also have to turn down Sancho. I feel that. This game is co-op, by the way. I still think I'm gonna win. Okay. <laughs> Cloud gaming with Amazon Luna. Wow, that was that was that was awesome. Anyway, Luna is Amazon's cloud gaming service. It makes it easy to play great games on devices you already own. No waiting for lengthy downloads or updates. Just play with Luna Couch. You can game with friends even when you're apart. You know, boot up a game, share a code. Easy clap, seven day code trial, amazon.com forward slash Luna. That was not a script. I read that from the heart. Please, thank you very much. I love Luna Couch. Uh, Luna, yeah, Luna Couch. All right, Super Auto Pets finals. I, I don't think I'm going to win. <laughs> I, I've been, I don't know how I got here. Right, yeah, all you do is sell yourself either. short and then crush the souls of the people who wanted it more. True. <laughs> It's, it's about keeping the small content creators Yeah, I feel like now. Mango's kind of cracked. Is it just me? I, I'm running hot right now. Oh, God. Oh, no. Mango's all heart. He could crash and burn right. at any second. Uh, let's get that stream rolling, and you guys can start the game whenever you're ready. Yeah, you got it. Start that up. You want to make the game, uh, Mr. Mango? Yeah, I'll DM you the code. Okay. Uh, I'll probably deafen you guys for this whole game. Uh, you guys can talk. Okay. We will hear you if you talk. If you Sounds good. Throw your oh. insightful commentary. All right. Uh, Yeti, you are not playing right now, to be clear. Oh, I'm not playing right now? No, oh. you are, we're watching oh, Saikuno you're, you're versus it. Mango. Right. Oh, and then okay. I'm going to watch um, your game right after. Cool, cool. So Ludwig, how good of a gamer is Mango? You played Mario Party with him before, right? Uh, he's probably the greatest gamer I know. Yeah, I'm gonna be honest. I saw him play against uh, who was it? Um, and he he like knows what he oh against Otto, and he was absolutely collapsing. Yeah, he's um, got you know he's got some tricks up his sleeve. I put the code in general, collapping. by the way. If you saw it? Yeah, right, yeah, I saw it. It's uh, not working. Okay, Mango lied to me. Mango, it's... I put the code you told me. Yeah. Uh, oh, I didn't create it yet. Oh, yeah, that would... Well, now the code is leaked. At, uh, Just do it. Go. Let's go. Okay, this is, I'm joining right now. I hope that's okay. me. Are you in? Are you, Are in? you in? Yeah, we're good. Okay.
Uh, Mango, are you live? Yeah. Oh, do you want me to do it in the Discord? Yes, sir. Yeah, give me two seconds. All right, good luck, you two. I have now deafened them. Northern Lion, how you feeling? Who you think wins this one? I I really do feel like this is the classic, like, you know, brain versus heart situation. I don't even remember Mango's team. It was just, it, it won on the, the strength dolphin. of he was pure the dolphin soul guy. reads. Yeah, yeah. it's it just Dolphin Scorpion. The Dolphin Scorpion, yeah. I feel like Saikuno has an analytical knowledge of uh, of what he's looking to do in the game. Like, it, it should be a good match. Even already? Mango not streaming yet? Is that Am I right about that? The only thing I'll say, I didn't see Mango's shop. But anytime I see someone willfully choose to roll a pig, I am not bullish. I just, I, I question their judgment. I may be wrong. And that doesn't mean it can't work. But I, I just don't see the, I, I don't see the value in the pig personally. But I could be wrong. Uh, Mango, you, you haven't gone live on Discord yet. I am. All right, he heard all of that, and now we'll never be best friends. <laughs> no, no, he didn't. I just undefined. I just undefined. Okay, I swear. okay. Uh, okay, he's on my Discord now. Um, I think so. Mango has this weird trait about him. You distracted where, me. Uh, oh, did did it? Did he? Did he? Did he? Did he not? What did he not do? He hopped in and said, "I distracted him." Is he about to lose? Did I fuck him? What happened? What? I mean, what, he did lose. What happened? <laughs> you were talking to me, and then I went, and then I ran out of time. I I asked I you. I hate to... you. Shut up. <laughs> All right. You know, thank God don't, for the new heart system. Up. Yeah, yeah. Uh, Mango has this thing about him where he'll latch on to a unit, or you know, this happens in many games. That's like bad, conventionally bad, but it'll mm -hmm. be like it's like something he just latches onto, and it's like oh, it's his unit now. Okay. So what in, uh, in, in Melee, what is what is the Mango character? Well, like, I guess it would be, like, maybe Scorp. Like, he plays Mario, who's, like, conventionally bad. Oh, yeah, okay. Yeah. But in uh, in this game, it's the rat. So, he'll like, his chat will spam Mango Rat. And, uh, and he'll just try to use the rat anytime he sees it. Which is, like, not the greatest unit. No, I feel like the rat is, like, it's almost unplayable, but... You know, I'm. I, he he's doing some crazy stuff right here. He's gonna end up rolling a three squad. He's got a five four pig, a four four fish. He can choose one of spider or swan here. Yeah, this is this is crazy. I mean, this three squad does not win. This it loses this round for sure. I think <laughs> he just left a coin too. That's also something he does. He just leaves a coin, like for luck. Yeah, it's like a you know like a wishing well. Oh, that's a great roll. Yeah, it's a good spider hit for sure. Okay. Right. So it, it looks it looks not great right now, but it's still very early, and a swan gives you uh, a little extra gold to work with in the future. Yeah, he's still running down pig meta. In fact, this might convince him to go level 2 pig. He is going to go level 2 what pig. What does that do? <laughs> what does that do for uh, you? So instead of selling for two gold, when he sells it, it'll sell for four. Okay, you know. Um, but hey, there's, a, and I'm being sincere when I say this, it gets him closer to a level three, which helps him if he gets a bison. And a level two allows a penguin to actually hit it and buff it. So it's not like game losing to just invest in a unit like that. It's still early. Saikuno has decided to go rat. Or excuse oh, me, not rat. Dodo. I was gonna say he's using the mango. Uh, he's using no, the mango no, no, rat no. against mango. He's going dodo. He's a lover of cricket, and I'm a firm cricket hater. I think the cricket is a, a low value early unit. I think you could play it, but it's. Uh, it wouldn't be my first choice. Like, I'm, I'm an ant, fish, mosquito, duck sort of guy. This doesn't add a lot of insight, but I think the pig looks cute with the America hat. I think so, too. It, it reminds me of the 4th of July.
We're getting into like desperation hours, I think, here. It's not a great start, but 1v1s, you can come back easy, I think. You just need some kind of attraction. Right now, like, I, I don't see the engine being there. A couple of otters, maybe? Two two otters and some good luck could, could start to... I mean, yeah, you could sell the pig, buy both otters, sell both otters. You'll have, like, still, like, 10, 12 coins. I don't know if he's ever selling the, the pig. He does <laughs> seem locked to the pig. I think that, that pig is going to be here, win, lose, or draw. This team does look like some infographic to teach kid about politics. <laughs> okay, slightly buffed Dodo, freezing a sheep. Some desperation rolls to try to figure out how you oh, get out of the Oh, this is hole. best of three. It's the finals. I did forget about oh, that. Oh, okay. Well, I should in hop that in. Case, I should. Yeah. Uh, hey, hey, uh, by the way, guys, by the way, I did forget to tell you guys this. This is the, the finals. This is the yep. finals. Finals are best of three. Oh, oh, God. Okay. Sorry. I should have addressed that earlier. I didn't. Um, yeah, that's fine. Finals are classy best of threes. Uh, anyway, sense. GLHF, GLHF. This isn't. Right. This seems like something I just threw in because I like mango, <laughs> and I was like, "Oh yeah, no, it's a best. It's actually a best of five now." Well, with that in mind, now we can speak frankly. I don't know how Mango gets himself out of this jam here. Yeah, because before it was like, you know, hey, for the viewers' sake, maybe there's a chance. Yeah, anything could happen. You never know. I mean, Giraffe now, Dodo is effective. It is. It's. I, I'm just not that impressed with like a three-five level one Dodo. Like it. It just needs a little bit of extra sauce to really get there i think what's oh that's a pretty fortunate roll i don't really get why um uh, it feels like saikuno has no power unit to put all of his resources into because he put the melon on the dodo yeah i was gonna say the same like i don't think saikuno's team is necessarily like lights out yet but uh i mean definitely you know eight hp ahead but needs a needs a little bit more But I'm still, I'm, I'm just, it's, it's mesmerizing trying to figure out how Mango's going to get himself out of this hole on turn six with a three, four, 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 one, three, three, five, seven, six. Northern Lion, there's a rat. There is a rat. Is it, you think that's what's happening? Right I, I mean, he's taking a long time to think for a man that usually plays in 40 seconds. Oh, okay. Oh. Okay, so the kangaroo behind like the that. pig. I, th I like that as well. And he rolled past. Pass is the rat. Ooh. He's thinking about selling Swan. I personally here, I mean, I, if, if you're going to stick with the pig, so be it. But I would probably sell Giraffe. Pop that snail in there instead. Dif different strokes for different folks, though. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. And then you, know, you gotta you sell gotta a snail and buy an ant. Yeah. Gotta get the ant here. He's eyeing the mosquito. He's eyeing the mosquito. Hey, you know, if it snipes the melon armor, then that play will make him look like a genius for sure. Oh, yeah. Okay, so he, no. Oh, he's gonna roll mosquito maybe one round and then ant till next round. Yeah. That's crazy. It's it's ambitious, but you know what? If, if it, it snipes the, the melon, melon armor, armor, he's a genius. Let's see. Ooh. Oh, well, <laughs> close. Yeah, would have been cool. I don't even, even then, like the melon armor, like 2-4 dodo. I don't think it's that scary yet. This kangaroo's looking pretty juicy. Pretty beefy. I'm really, this is controversial. Maybe my most controversial Super Auto Pets opinion. I don't think the whale is all that. Anytime, I, I think the whale, if you get it at the earliest moments and pair it with a good unit, it can carry you for a couple rounds, but I think we're already past its like it, it, its main value. I'm like pretty good friends with Saikuno. He'll send me DMs sometimes offline of him winning, and it'll be a squad. And sometimes he yeah. sends me DMs, like most of the time even, like over half, and it'll be like a whale game. Yeah. And I'm like, oh, like, great job, man. But in the back of my mind, like, my heart is saying, like, this is my dad sending me a picture of his Reeboks. Like, look at yeah, the new like, drip I got. Nice drip, dad. Yeah. yeah. Very cool. Hey, Very cool. I had the, the most fun you can have with a whale, I think, is if you get, like, a whale 
and then a hedgehog and you just you know build a squad that can survive the mm -hmm. the nail bombs going off and then the other teams never expect it but yeah i like I, that i think it falls off a little bit there's some exceptions but like the classic like whale sheep or whale cricket i i think it falls off around like turn five or six I'm going to say you sold Mango off. You said you don't know how he's coming back. This squad looks good now. It looks good. I, I think maybe, uh, especially now with Melon Armor on the pig, like that's going to do some serious work. I think that Kangaroo's going to be beefy. I, I, he might even be the favorite now. That's all it takes is two rounds. Let's see what Saikuno does. Hippo. No whale. No whale is what I, that's what I like to see. I do like that. They're gonna trade. The kangaroo's gonna be pretty beefy. What what Saikuno's gonna want to see is uh, like a ram or a tur turtle's okay, but the melon yeah. armor already existed. Yeah, and so it's like now I'm looking at the melon armor that he put in this dodo, which is still a two four dodo. And it's like, was it really worth it to put the melon armor on that guy? Yeah, that's a problem. Four I points mean, I, for a two four unit. I I definitely. I, I guess it's like maybe he pilled a turtle in front of it and didn't have any other options, or maybe um, he's building like anti-snipe technology in. But I, I can't imagine. Mm. I I do see there's a pig. Yeah, he, I I think he's eyeing this pig. If you're gonna go for a level two pig, why why wouldn't you get a level three? Is pig? that six gold if you sell a level three? It is, yeah. I mean, it's Look, a great it's pivot unit. <laughs> I guess. Actually, you know what? It might. It might be. It might be. Yeah, six gold. Six gold sounds right. So you spend nine gold right now to get two more later. This makes sense. Yeah, it's perfect. I like selling the giraffe. I feel like it's Tony's I, job. I agree. But you know, I, I, if you're winning, I don't think you need this. Well, he just did, but. <laughs> I uh, I think you could keep the giraffe, but definitely you are gonna want that rooster. That's like your your late game carry unit for sure. He's low on time. You need you need to get more roosters, and then I think the play is gonna be, um, yeah, buffing the dodo, and then at some point going dodo rooster. I I don't know if I would do it right <laughs> away, but he just throws honey on the pig. <laughs> it there's the melon in front of it too. It doesn't even matter. You know, is it it's. Many people would say it's an unconventional play. Uh, yeah. I, I would go as far as to say bad. <laughs> so the Dodo is gone from Saikuno. I think that, you know, that's a mature play. Yeah. Re represents a willingness to accept that that's, you know, not working. Get that out of there. His level one Dodo is so powerful. Yeah. I mean, that's, I, I said the giraffe was not that impressive, but he actually got great mileage out of it. Oh, this is one of those things that I, it frustrates frustrates me about the new patch. Is like, okay, one guy has seven hearts, the other guy has six. That seems close. It's a yeah. world of difference. Yeah, it's it's two versus like two lives left versus three basically. Mm -hmm. I don't know. Mango looks really good now. Just to be honest, I, you're probably gonna see. I, I think he's saving the chocolate to use for a level two rooster, but he'll use it on the kangaroo if he has to. He might sell the pig. Wait, he might sell the pig right now. You still only gain two gold, by the way, when you sell a level two pig. You, you get two for selling a level two and then two extra. So four total. The honey, unfortunately, is just uh, okay. that's a sunk loss. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, the honey was just, you know, that was for the fans. Didn't use it at all, but I like shark. A shark, okay, yeah. I could see it. Garlic on the kangaroo. This is a terrible rooster now. It's not good, yeah. I think garlic kangaroo was the was the perfect play if he does. Yeah, there you go. Mm -hmm. And Saikuno also seems to be. Uh, oh, his hippo's getting pretty big. And this seventeen twenty. Oh, if he had a level two hippo, it would have been huge because this rooster is just gonna buff him up. Yeah, th this composition is is gonna work well for uh, for Saikuno actually. In order to counter, Mango has to get the higher HP units to the front, but it's it's hard for him to do because he needs the Kangaroo to have something in front of it, and he needs the Dodo to be behind it. So it's kind of wedged into the middle of the 
of his positioning here. I, I think Mango will lose this one for sure. Yeah. Yeah, it's looking like it. This shark is not getting beefy enough. Also, turkey. Uh, yeah, I, Saikuno, uh, like, very quietly just pivoted, like, bit by bit to, a, like, more of a meta build. If, if you can get a level 2 turkey, I think it could beat the Dodo Rooster build. If maybe you get, like, Tiger Turkey Fly or something along those lines. It's kind of weird to roll it with Hippo, but you, he also had to stabilize. So I think that, I think it's close again. Our mango's thinking deep. My opinion, you got to sell turtle mm -hmm. and then put the cow in. Buff either the dodo or the rooster. Double cans is not going to help you in this round. Oh, and he just passes the cow straight up. You know, I uh, he's the goat. I would never try to suggest that that was a misstep. Maybe it's just he, he's getting that 10-11 rat ready to go. <laughs> there he is. From you know the top be crazy? Road. Here's here's my strat, triple okay. can. Yeah, I think you could try it. You got triple one life can, to play with. You have a life to play with. Next turn you come out, you win. He's really eyeing up that rhino too. I don't know. It's what tough because the, the yeah, you can really only put the rhino in uh after you kill their hippo. Otherwise it's just gonna bounce off. So I, I think he needs really what he needs is a scorpion at the front right now to to kill the hippo with garlic, and what? then the rest of his team team can go wild. Okay, he froze the can <laughs> and left three coins on the table. I, I maybe he ran out of time. Yeah, maybe. Yeah. That's a big hippo. He's not even gonna kill it with the rooster. Yeah, and once the hippo goes off, like that's the end. He's not even gonna well, kill it with the dodo. Level two hippo is pretty nasty too. Yeah, the kangaroo is like a direct counter because the kangaroo gets four every time you attack. So it's like they almost build equally. But uh, this is, again, has not even seen what the turkey is going to do back there. Yeah. So for Mango, th there's no alternative way to win. The hippo has to die. The easiest way to do it is going to be via Scorpion. Mm -hmm. Looks like he's searching for one. <sighs> Didn't get it. Could roll one more because you're selling the turtle anyway. True, true. And I but, think, I, I don't know if there's anything else in this shop that even really comes close. Like Rhino's just going to get blown out. Yeah, he's still eyeing the Rhino like... Maybe it'll do something, but you're just going to lose to the hippo. Yeah, this, this, I think this is over. Game it's one tough. Yeah, has to be going to uh, Saikuno here. I feel like if we get a little bit more HP, maybe a tiger kangaroo could start to get it working, but... I mean, this is, uh, you know what? I don't think he's going to win, but I think he might make it a little bit more interesting than I originally thought. He's going to get through the, the hippo at least. Yeah. It's like Kuno pivots to snake. You know, he's not that far off. Got a turkey yeah. with sheep. Like, <laughs> what a frustrating build. Yeah, this is the kind of build you oh, play it Jesus, online the and do you have to hit fast forward like a thousand times just to yeah. have it finish in less than 10 minutes? Uh, let me undeafen these guys. All right, that was that was that was game 1, gentlemen. Game 1 goes to Saikuno. That was a close one. That was a close one. Let's get game 2 underway. Pass me the code. I'm going to go grab some coffee.
leaked for sure. Who leaked it? Uh, I had the stream wide open. So who am I playing? Not Saikuno. Okay. How'd you feel about that one, Mango? Any thoughts? I was running like shit. Yeah, you're going also, for Scorpion you just again, got right? bad luck, honestly. I... I'm also not used to playing. I, I always do the other one where I have a lot of time to think. So the time keeps owning me. I think they reduced it, but I'm kind of happy about that. I feel like two minutes was too long. It used yeah, to be yeah. three every round. Yeah, yeah three is too long. long. Yeah. It scales up, so like at the end you have enough time, but like the first round you have... Okay, can... Um, uh, okay. <laughs> see the code there, Mango? Uh... <laughs> mm -hmm. You see it? Yeah, I see it. No, I see it. Okay. You know that's not true. Eh. <laughs> Don't come on. I'm gonna go to the bathroom really quick. Yeah, go for it. Boys, hope you guys are enjoying the tournament. Right now, we are in the finals of the consolation bracket. So this is Mango against Saikuno. Here for your information is the bracket. So these were the bottom eight people who played in the total 16. Mango beat out Alex, who, God bless, stayed up in Japan. Beat out Otto and uh, is now in the finals against Saikuno. Saikuno won game one. It's a best of three. Uh, and then Saikuno beat out Buddha, beat out Wendy, and then is um, possibly going to beat out Mango. And that's this. Right after that, it's going to be, uh, I believe, our winner side of the bracket, our champion side of the bracket where Logic Defender got dethroned by Yeti Apocalypse. And will be going up against Valky Ray, who beat out 5-up, and Dan Corona, who beat out Stans. So, Ray's been playing really well today. We'll see who wins that one. Sorry, it's not winners and losers side. We had 16 people. We had them all play in one giant hey, game. Ludwig, is this the first tournament of yours I've been in that I didn't lose first round? No, no, you won Battleship, Saikuno. Oh, yeah, I won Battleship. I <laughs> is this a that. way to... Are you flexing on me right now? No, no, I forgot. I forgot. I just remember <laughs> the Tricky Towers one. PTSD the trauma. Um, thank God Jerma is in here. Otherwise, that would be awkward, huh? <laughs> yeah. yeah. That would be awkward. Well, he's... Thank uh, God he's not yeah, where, here. Where's the code? Where's the code, Ed? It's uh, in general, I think, Mayo. Do you put it there? You give it to him. I don't see it. I don't want to type it in, bro. Why? What Do you want me to tell you why? Yeah. <laughs> What's, what is it? I'm typing it in. Did you get the code, Saikuno? Um, yeah, I... Oh. Um, I'm not gonna hide my screen for this, but I, I don't support this at all. Just saying. You could have hit your screen. <laughs> well, I, been... Don't worry, I clicked it really fast. Nobody saw it. Nobody saw it. No, no, no. <laughs> all knows. right, very cool, very bomb, um, champ. Yeah. All right, good luck, gentlemen. I'm gonna meet Stefan both of you. All right, Northern Line. We're in the uh, possible last game for Mango. Are you are you eating an untoasted bagel from Starbucks? It's a warmed bagel. It is toasted. It's just like okay. 45 minutes old because I was commentating. I was, because I was trying to guess what your Starbucks breakfast sandwich order was, and uh, when I saw you rip off part of a, what appeared to be an untoasted whole wheat bagel, I was very surprised. My normal go-to? What's your guess? I would say everything for Son Ham and Cheese breakfast sandwich. You flatter me. I don't have the calories to afford that. It's normally the, uh, the turkey... I think it's reduced fat turkey... Uh, um, yeah, turkey bacon. Turkey bacon, something or other. Yeah. yeah. It's like 230 calories. Hey, that's not bad. It tastes terrible. I really can't stomach it too much. 
But there's something about the Starbucks eggs. Like once a week, I like them. If I have two of them within oh. like a couple of days, I'm like the eggs just aren't. Are you right. talking about the sous vide eggs? Yeah, yeah, yeah. They make my stomach curl if I eat. Like if I if I wait more than like five minutes after getting them. It's like egg foam or something. It's yeah. just uh, anyway. it's off putting. <laughs> Still get a couple of, yeah, you know, one or two a day, <laughs> something like that. <laughs> Are you a fit bird? Do you work out? No, I did. And I have like a tweet tweet that, that precedes disastrous events. I was pretty yoked like March 2020. I was I was doing what, what's some yoked to you. Um, like I was I mean, not ripped, but I was strong. I was probably like 205. I was squatting like 400 pounds. I was going to the gym four or five times a week doing heavy compound lifts. COVID starts making waves in the news. And I go, uh, you know what? Like March 15th, I was like, I don't feel comfortable going to the gym tomorrow. Maybe I'll take a week off. Have not been back since. But not then we a, not also, once? We, we had a baby over that time period as well. We, time became very at a premium. And now like we're, I'm, I'm getting back to it, but uh, allegedly. But 205 right squatting 400 is pretty crazy. Yeah, uh, but like uh, my deadlift was pathetic. I just have like, I, honestly, I'm just going to say it. I got a dumpy. <laughs> wait, wait, you know, I'm known for having a dumpy, right? I did not know that, actually. Uh, you know, I'm, I'm not dropping your numbers because, you know, I still I, I, you need a little fat to have a great dumpy. But uh, I'm, I was like 200 squatting 300. Hey, that's very strong. Yeah, you know, I was like I was like 300 squat, you know, like a 300 deadlift, like a 225 bench. You were at 225 bench? Yeah. That's insane. You must have also been there. No, my, my bench and my deadlift were terrible. Wait, my what is terrible? My shoulder How press you... what? and my, my squat were insane. Wait, okay, I bet, okay. I, I, I bet I was benching like one, like around 190. And I don't even know. My deadlift was like two, 275. Like it was lower than my squat. Like I think I think I got a one of one body. That is like shocking. <laughs> Like that the things that, that most people are like, your deadlift should definitely be higher than your squat. I'm like, not for me for some reason. My, well, I'm with you in that. My squat's slightly higher than my deadlift. I think it's mostly uh, fear-based though. Yeah, that's fair. You know, I don't want 300 pounds on my back all the time, or um, like, like lifting up my back, it's scary. Yeah. Yeah, you can screw it up pretty easily. That's why I, that's part of my problem with the bench as well. I'm always, I, whenever you see a video of something going wrong at the gym, it's always some dude who drops 800 pounds right on his rib cage. And mm -hmm. I'm anyway. also telling you old numbers. I'm pretending these are my numbers from like, you know, December or, or like I guess Subathon was my peak strength because I worked out okay. so consistently. Still, Nowadays, all I do is I, I rock climb. That'll that'll do it. That'll, that'll get you in shape for sure. Avid climber. You know, next time you're here, I'll bring you out to the walls. Sure, yeah. I, uh, I'm i very bad at rock climbing as well. <laughs> That's why I, I like to bring people rock climbing because it's like you can learn it very quickly, but you'll never be great the first day. And since yeah. I've gone for like two months consistently, I'll always be like, you know, Oh yeah, let me just show you. <laughs> you're doing like this. You're going upside down, and yeah. you know the yeah, ones I'm that like, are just like quarters glued to the wall. It's something that if you had gone for two weeks straight, you could probably do everything I'm doing. But you, since you haven't, and I'm the guy leading you out, boy, do I feel good. I'm also. I gotta say, I'm a little scared of heights, and I, oh, my I don't top line. strength is not that good. I, I boulder. Okay, well, I'm also fine. scared of heights. On, on top of the, it has like the foam mats underneath it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. I could do that then. Uh, I haven't commentated on the game much. That's that's true chat, but. I, I didn't even want to point out, but Mango did just buy a 1-1 one, one horse as like a fill <laughs> for his. Like, I, and it, it's, he's got more HP. He actually won the round, but it's, I'm just a little offended, but I'm trying to get over it. There's like two humans, right? There's like, okay. One, I have three gold. Let me just roll and see if I can get something great and freeze it for next turn. Two, let me buy maybe the most useless possible thing, horse, honey, that's not even going to be used. And, you know, just like, hey, maybe this one one unit changes the game. Well, that's why, like, the horse offends me the most because it's like it's an apple. It's just a, a flesh apple, but you're going to sell it next round anyway. I guess you get one gold back, so there is that. But yeah. 
So yeah, this got, guy knows how to manage money. <laughs> we we've got uh, we've got a tale of two builds right here. Saikuno is rolling a, a pretty classic, I must add, also as a horse on the team, build with a, a garlic camel up front that will buff a blowfish behind it, a dog that he's trying to scale, mm -hmm. uh, and then the horse that's just kind of along for the ride, I think. Mango has a spider that cannot be killed, but will not scale well into the mid and late game. Strong ants, a very unusually placed camel, but it might it might get the job done, and a giraffe for future purposes. I, I like Mango's odds right now, honestly. Yeah, I think he, he did a huge pivot. He got rid of four units, three units, something like that, and he just kind of switched the entire board. But I think it looks good. He's also he probably wants to switch that peacock for the kangaroo straight up. I would agree. But I think he's trying to figure out how to fit them them both in right now. Yeah. But oh, he's gonna run out of time. Oh, he had no gold anyway. No, no big deal. This is a big spider. You know, stats just work. You know, you get you got a basically an eleven six spider. Like oh, send it. God like to. <laughs> I'm just saying the team that sold their horse first is now winning. <laughs> so <laughs> you can't go a sentence. You like sneeze. You go fuck horses. It's six round six with a <laughs> with a one one horse. My God, you must wake up, wake up your baby and your wife in the middle of the night, having nightmare that you bought a horse. <laughs> My only nightmare is that I eventually start losing to them, which has not happened yet. So I see. I got nothing to worry about. It's like the uh, it's the Batman meme. You live long enough. You either die a horse hater or live long enough to uh, become a horse user. I see. Yeah, I was trying to think of what Batman. <laughs> yeah, that was, I was just. <laughs> right, so I was just fun. thinking of. Uh, you ever see the comic book uh, panel that's Batman and like Raphael from the Ninja Turtles, and he says like, "Raphael, this is where my parents got murdered." <laughs> that was the first thing that popped into my head. This is yeah. where I watched my parents die. <laughs> Usually, when I have a reference. It's like, you know, pretty ubiquitous. Um, but I feel the like Batman you throw out movie. references and it's like, oh, you remember that, um, you know, that old 1970s Cowboys game where it was uh, Tony Romo's grandfather came out on the mm -hmm. field and uh, he walked on with a, it was a leg injury, right? <laughs> I, look, I'm just saying you, you can just admit that you don't know who Sinestro is. There's no shame in it. I know who Sinestro is really mm -hmm. well. I'm an avid Sinestro enjoyer. He has a, a ring that makes yellow things, which Green Lantern, a.k.a. Hal Jordan, can't counter for some reason. Uh, obviously. Oh, one of the best badgers, by the way. Gets rid of the melon armor. It is. It's a, a very good badger. The, like, Saikuno definitely is, is not sunk, even if he loses this round, which he did. Um, or which he will, I should say. Uh, but he needs to get that dog going. And this is the both the the benefit and the cost of a dog build. If you get a level 2 dog, you're off to the races. You can beat anybody. If you get stuck at a level 1 dog for like the whole game, you're you're sunk. You can't sell it cuz it's your best unit, but you don't get the tools to upgrade it and you end up just falling off. So that's we're like right at that sort of pivot point right now. He's got two lives left. I want to let you know he did freeze a whale. He's I attached think, to the whale. Yeah. I feel like he's gonna buy visions it. of a, <laughs> a ox whale rooster. Like it, I don't I don't I don't know. I don't I've I've got faith he won't get rid of it because I don't know what he sells to to dump that whale in there. If he sells the kangaroo, it's over. And Saikuno is he's in there, he's hard locked with twenty seconds to go. Mango. He's tabbing. He's so canning. Kuno's looking for an achievement for least time used. <laughs> I'm like when I play versus, I'm I'm too impulsive as well. I think I'm done. I click the button. Someone in chat's like, you know, why is this thing at the front? And I'm like, oh crap. And then I just sit there for two and a half minutes. I'll come clean. I've clicked out of your stream three times now because you've made a stupid blunder. <laughs> from speeding up you've passed yeah. over a unit that like would have gotten you level two and i go mm -hmm. this guy i can't happens all the time i can't or buy a buy a bison and then immediately sell the level three unit that was supposed to let the bison mm. actually do something it happens mm. all the time i pilled a swan the other day it was like I, a like a i 15, know that swan i was there live for it and i said hi youtube in my head <laughs> it was a bad moment 
This is a big ox. It is a big ox. The frame's kind of shit the bed for me here. No. <laughs> well, there's a lot going on. Well, I don't, honestly, Saikuno took that one quite comfortably. Really, like, what this comes down to right now is uh, whether Saikuno can punch through the spider without losing too many of his units, at least based on how the game's being built as we speak. Saikuno's making big moves right now. Are you seeing? He's, he's moving stuff before the the first thing <laughs> is actually resolved. Like, the, the rooster's still eating the melon, and he's like, get out of here. I got to put a sheep in here. Yeah, the devs can't code fast enough for him to make his moves. The temperature in his room just went up by like two degrees trying to process all this. I was wrong, by the way. He, he did manage to find a way to put a, a sheep in there. A whale, yeah. Or a whale, yeah. Thank you. Yeah, I think it can work because like the, the kangaroo is going to get like a minimum of, of two or three triggers, which will make it relatively strong. But I still, I, I think it's a little sentimental. I'm trying to look at what Mango's doing. Nine gold, 20 seconds left. A lot of gold. 15 seconds. 10 oh, seconds. No. Takes oh, a no, roll. No, no. Throws out a salad. 5 seconds. 5 gold. Roll twice. Save the spider. Nope. Save the dolphin. There you go. I think he wanted to save the turtle, but couldn't. It's two very strange teams. Oh, but the, the mango snipe on the kangaroo is actually insanely good. Yeah, that was clutch. The, the kangaroo is only vulnerable when it first comes out. After that, it becomes, like, unstoppable. Steel doesn't look great for him, though. Yeah, he still didn't quite get it done. Closer. That'll take... Mango, he's on seven. Let me check here. Any of you know what's going on so with the six, mobile version? Seven. Like you said, six is lethal in two. Seven is lethal in three. You know, I think I am single-handedly preventing thousands of people from playing this game. Yeah, are the servers going like they're this, terrible? They're, so you can't play on mobile. There's like a just an issue with the code in the update. It broke the mobile version. They're okay. holding the update for this game, for this tournament. <laughs> <laughs> thank you. Thank you, team. Thank Wood. you. Thank you very much, devs. Appreciate it. Much love. Much love. Sorry to all mobile players. Hope you guys enjoy the tournament. <laughs> also a great way to force viewership, though. Very true. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, there is a game that uh, I, I've played a lot of called The Binding of Isaac, and it was uh, an expansion to it like five years ago. It was set to come out at like 9 or 10 a.m., and uh, it didn't, but people who had press codes just got to stream it when the embargo popped. And oh, man, was I jealous. <laughs> you didn't have one? Not that time. Now you but do, then, surely. No, like the, the, when, the, when Rebirth first came out, I got press access like months early. And then just like they were like, don't play too much. And I was like, OK. And I basically didn't play at all. And then for the DLC, I, I was not I was not tapped for for beta testing. It's okay. I don't I don't mind. Sounded like you minded a bit. I don't I don't harbor a grudge or anything. In many ways. Wait, that dolphin snipe was huge. What did that kill? Because the I didn't yeah. see the rooster. It just disappeared. Yeah, I think it sniped. It the, sniped the ram? Yeah, it's like the sheep, so, and then he swallowed so the, the rooster. So he swallowed the rooster, exactly. What the hell? That's, that's just a terrible sequence of events. Yeah, this dolphin's actually... I've never rated the dolphin. What do you rate the dolphin on your tier list? I would say that with... Um, uh, it's hard to say. I think it's better now, because sniping a backline unit is, is pretty important if someone's rolling, like, a, a, a score. Well, actually, even just, like, it's anti-scorpion technology. So yeah. to, to just shoot a scorpion pretty much by default is pretty valuable. Um, I think it's okay. I think it's better in versus too, because people's team compositions are so much more like built to counter your build specifically. So if you can do anything to screw up their order, it, it, it's disproportionately <laughs> beneficial. You see the Saikuno play he's making? Double oh. turkey, just it makes me upset, but I, I can't deny that I think it's going to work. Yeah, he, he switched it up for snake last second which I think makes a lot of sense. 
Yeah, I think it's a little bit more practical. And people will say, like, what, oh, you got the ram at the front or the sheep at the front. You're going to lose the value of that. I don't think so. Like, again, this is a situation you lose one 2-2 two, two sheep. It's not that big of a deal. And mm -hmm. there's really no place for this other stuff to go. Like, there's, there's no other way to set it up. Maybe you sell a sheep and then you roll either a turtle or a deer next time and you feel like you're not wasting some opportunity, but it'll, it'll do some good stuff. This is game point for uh, Mango. Saikuno loses here. He's out. Mango still has three lives. I think I think Saikuno will win this round. The sheep will get sniped, which won't be a big deal. Well, then the whale can't swallow. I think it. Which means no, you're the whale right. it didn't. Yeah. Which means the scorpion won't do anything. You know, it might be closer than I gave it credit for. Uh... The snake's just a little too weak, I think. Also, oh, level two is brutal. Yeah, Saikuno's taking this one for sure. That was close. Dolphins just, uh, it just wrecks whale, it feels yeah, like. Yeah, you can run whale, I guess. Or, I, I, I guess you could run a weaker unit deliberately. Deer. <laughs> yeah, okay, oh, isn't it? Yeah, this I is getting... see. Uh, I think it might be a 2-0 here. Oh, but it's... I'm trying to think what's gonna get shot now. Like the rooster might get shot and lose melon armor. Cause the dolphin, hey, this is really good, honestly. Like this is the, a great comp. The dolphin will hit something, but it won't kill anything. And that was really the only thing keeping Mango's hopes up, I think. Let me, yeah, let me there's see what double melon armor too. He's rolling. I, I think that he's just too attached to the units he got early. But we'll see. Like the, he's, he's rolling a rooster, or sorry, a hippo with chili pepper could punch through that deer and then also punch through the bus and live like this hippo could make some noise yeah it's just a level one because level is, one with yeah. turkey i mean that's not gonna do that much hippo does really well against turkey spawn builds but if they uh i mean it, at some point if you got level two roosters coming out for like 30 damage it doesn't really matter a little steak not that key honestly Pair is probably better. I would, I would, I mean, he's got 12 seconds. I think I would roll once and sell the cow to try to do something, but I don't know. Three seconds. He's just going to pair and hope. He's got two lives, so it's okay. All right, we're going to watch Saikuno's POV in the fight. Starting out with a strong deer. Dolphin won't kill anyone. It's really all about the uh, hippo here. Yeah, it did nothing for him. If the snake shot the hippo or shoots the hippo, then it'll be a bit of an issue. But Level 2 turkey is just, it's good. It's just good. Turkey just in general is like, it's insane. In a level 2 rooster, you don't even get to see. Whew. All right, last life. This is everything. Oh, and Saikuno rolled so well. I don't even know how he sells, though, to be able to... Oh, he just sells this. Oh, I love that play. Just refresh the snake. Oh, no, he goes fly? Oh, I'm disgusted now. now yeah, this this is the build where you're like, okay, I look, there's money on the line. I yeah. get it. I can't I be get mad, it. but... <laughs> I'm Freezing things Mango. like it's not the last one. All right, fair enough. Mango, Say what do you got? Just, Mango, he's, he's getting a scale out there for some buffing. I think he's going to think about rolling... Oh, you know what? A tiger... Tiger dolphin or tiger uh, tiger dolphin would kill someone, right? Interesting. Yeah, it should. If he can stop the whale from eating, then it might help. I don't know. I'm too lazy to to think about how this would affect his composition. <laughs> I think he guaranteed hits the dolphin. So if he goes tiger dolphin here, then it will kill the 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 deer. Yeah. Or the fly, because he he just bought a Saikuno just bought a fly, right? Oh, true. All well, the flies twelve twelve. Uh, I think that level two dolphin does 10. So it, a tiger will, will make it do 20 to the fly. But he hits the lowest HP unit, right? Oh, yeah. Okay. So, so he'll end up hitting a kangaroo in, or instead. Or not a kangaroo. What am I? Let's just let's stop trying to memorize the squad. <laughs> uh, he failed to freeze the dolphin. Let's see. He's not going to get. All right. Hold on. I want to watch Saikuno's POV here. He watches it slower. Dolphin the kills the deer, no swallow. 11 11 is just so strong. And the fly is actually not going to help Mango too much because it's an 8. Oh my god. 
Level two turkey, it's just hard to compete with. Yeah. Yeah, I think that's gonna do it. Yeah, that's that's oh, that's GG. That is GG. And that is a W for Saikuno. It's strong, guys. Yup. GG, gentlemen. GG. I can't believe I came back. Uh, I threw yeah, I so thought... hard at the beginning. I, oh one of those rounds, God. I legit, I wasted my, I had six gold left. <laughs> I thought you were going to get rolled. And then, uh, you yeah, know what? So Level two I. turkey kind of gets the job done. Oh, man, I did it. That means I win, right? Best so of three. You did win. That is true. Yeah, we you get a it. crown and you get a couple racks. We did it. Paul, oh, that was such a comeback. GG Saikuno. I thought I was I thought it was over. Uh, oh. Well, thanks for having me in the tournament, Lud. Congratulations, brother. Well deserved mm -hmm. win. Mango. I threw so hard. Gets thanks for playing gifted. Mango. Uh, he left. Where where'd he go? He left the call. He's gone. He's a gamer, man. He gets sad. Oh. Well, it's it a good match. It's close. It was, it was I almost I lost. Even. Yeah. So now it's a Ray versus uh, Logic. That's right, yeah. Ray versus Logic Defender. Right. Man, Wait, that uh, was a comeback. Or excuse me, Ray versus Yeti. <laughs> oh, Yeti. Sorry. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> All right, good luck. Yeti, we cut you See out you without telling you. Uh, no, no. Woo! Like, who know you won? Good luck, Ray. You got it. This is the finals for 4K in the custom one of one hat. Oh, oh man. You'll be the only people in this game to have a champion hat. Whoa. Oh man, that's cool. So close yet so far. <laughs> Full best of three set away. <laughs> oh god. All right, let's go. Best of three. Yep. Uh, do you want me to make a code, or would you like to make a code? Uh, could you make it, please? <laughs> You've got it. <laughs> Thank you. And again, I'm gonna luck, definitely guys during the Eddie. actual game. Uh, uh, but luck, I still hear luck. you talk. Can you guys chat out loud? All right, um, do I need to make this a three lobby, Blood, or am I able to just start a two, two? Yeah, just you guys. Okay, cool. Uh, best of three again, best of three. All right, this is going to be the code. Uh, enter it as soon as I do so that anyone snipes it. Oh. Predictions are open, mods. Okay. Valkyrie Ray versus Yeti Apocalypse. Who's going to win the finals? Cool, you in? The prediction is for game one or the whole set? Yes, All right. I am in, I am in. All right, cool, cool. I think we have to deafen up. Mango, Mango's fine. Mango probably just wanted to go. Fucking eat. Woke up at 11 a.m. Played for three hours. Still has to go live later today. Game one, probably. Love the probably. All right, we're in this. Uh, Northern Line, are you? Am I holding you? No, no, no. I, it's honestly, my wife has like an extra 20 minutes of, of leeway. So I think I, I can swing it, I think. At All least. All right. Finals. And honestly, like I always, I bake in a little tolerance at the end. Anytime there's going to be an event, two streamers can be punctual, but like 12 streamers, it's just, uh, you, you know, as well as I do, it adds like another hour on top of everything. God damn, do I hate it, bro. <laughs> <laughs> I, I got, I'm texting everyone. I'm like, hey, can you be here this time? They're like, yeah, yeah, yeah. A week ago. And then day before they're like, can't you make said 11 a.m.? <laughs> You you explain the rules as soon as you finish explaining the rules. One person says, "Hey, just one question that you've already answered in the thing that you literally just said," and you're like, oh, "I gotta be polite about it." I understand. I have you know dreams sometimes. I think I'd be an, a phenomenal substitute teacher, mm, and okay. then I hang out with these streamers, and I'm like, "Oh no, it'd be fucking terrible." Yeah, I don't. I did not like being a teacher. Uh, you were a like, teacher. I, I taught ESL in, in South Korea, so it, like the oh. teaching part was fine, but the the actual behavioral management and like making sure thirty kids all like you know don't die is uh, that part's annoying. Is that like the jet program for Japan? It is, but it's like if you if you can't get into the jet program, <laughs> then you go to Korea. <laughs> At least that's what it was like in two thousand and ten. Was that like, were you trying to go to the jet? Is it the jet program also through Korea? That's only Japan, right? No, yeah, that's Japan. So like the thing with Japan, I think that at the time they have more stringent requirements. Uh, like you needed a degree in uh, English or teaching or something. Uh, I mean, whereas to be for clear, I I tried to apply for the jet program with a degree in English, and uh, you know I thought a decent GPA. I was cum laude. Still got okay. rejected. You know, I, I, there's a lot of demand, at least at the time in Korea, you literally just needed a bachelor's degree in anything. 
and yeah. he qualified. So, you know, it's it's pretty. They they. they it was a rogues gallery of people who were directionless at the time in their lives, for sure. How's your Korean now? It's not very good. Um, my wife is Korean, and mm -hmm. we, you know she watches Korean drama and listens to Korean music. Since we're teaching the baby like both Squid languages, we, we watched Squid Game and and I'm my sorry, name. I'm, I'm and, sorry. No, don't 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 back me up on that. I it's just, a it's a good <laughs> uh, it's a good show. <laughs> But I'm I'm learning uh, I'm learning more Korean vocabulary because we're I'm learning alongside the baby right now. So, you know. Oh, but, so the baby's gonna speak Korean and English? Yeah, That's yeah. Sick. It's 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 gonna be cool. Yeah, it is cool. Like some people, they just uh, you know they're born with parents that speak multiple languages, and you just mm -hmm. you are born better than you know eighty percent of Americans. It gives you a huge advantage. Like, I, I we'll have like the one North American baby who Europeans can't smugly be like, you know, how many languages do you speak? Mm -hmm. Oh, only only two. <laughs> and as as one of those babies that speaks French and English. Oh, I don't use it. But boy, do I love flexing it. Hey, you know, congrats. I, I, I do speak a, a little French. Un petit peu. <laughs> Sous mon bicouillon. Mm, they have no idea. Uh, je ne parle pas français. Puis je l'ai uh, à de bain, s'il vous plaît. Désolé, désolé. Pardon. Did you, uh, did you, uh, how often do you travel to like a Korea? We went in, in 2018 for the Olympics. Uh, mm, but Winter Olympics, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. prior to that, uh, I mean, we, we go to Japan more often, actually. Like my really? Wife, yeah, my wife likes Japan a lot. But obviously I'm dying we haven't to go to traveled in a while. But uh, dude, Japan is awesome. Like, it's uh, it's just honestly, people they're always like, what, like what makes it so fun to visit? The food is great. You know, it's it's a totally different culture to like anything you can see in North America for sure. But then also just like the, it's just weird to be in like a society where people are like respectful of their surroundings. Yeah. Instead of just like, you know, any city you go to in North America, you're like, nice buildings. The street level scares me a little bit. There's just garbage everywhere. In Japan, it's just like, you know, I'm not saying it's a perfect country, but you're like, wow, it's just kind of like tranquil. Even though there's a lot of people, like everybody's like minding their own business, kind of. I'm sure beneath the surface, there's a bubbling discontent. But yeah, I think you know, the for... fabled wisdom is wonderful place to visit, terrible place to live. I, I would, could definitely believe that for sure. I'm, I plan on going for a, a month, 2022. Yo, that'll be sick. Are you a content guy when you go there, or are you just a tourist? Not nah, just a tourist. I see. No aspirations of being the next Logan Paul? Uh, no. <laughs> <laughs> I uh I don't I just I, I enjoy my private time. I think I'm like maybe it's not just a personality thing, maybe there's like an age thing as well. But like I came of age in an era where there was no like always on twenty four seven IRL, like monetize every minute of your entire life. So anytime I find myself in that environment, I'm like a little uncomfortable. I'm mm -hmm. like, get on, do the content, and then I wanna like get into isolation and seclusion as uh as quickly as possible afterwards. Yeah, I can feel that. I am not that, but I can feel that. <laughs> I, I have 13 yeah. cameras trained on me for a month straight of my life. <laughs> I get you, though. We're the same. I think it's different, too. Like, it's it depends where you're at, like, in your life. Like, I was already... I, I got married in 2014, so, like, Twitch was on its ascendancy, and I was, like, an old man, even though I was 25 or something like that. You got but married I totally at the get... same age I am now. Yeah, yeah, that's crazy. Well, that's crazy, dude. So, I like, at the time, now. I was already, like, I'm, like, I'm ready to, you know, not retire, but, like, not film everything I do for my whole life. Sure. <laughs> yeah. Be like I a, feel like know. if you're, like, you know, if you're in your mid or early 20s and you're, like, I'm just going to ride this Twitch thing and, and take it as far as it'll go, it makes sense to me to, you know, to grind it as hard as you can. Ooh. Legendary honeyfish win for Ray. Yeah, we're back. I can appreciate a honeyfish. And I, we, there's nothing wrong with bantering in the early game. You're, oh, you see, I, no you one cares. Ants and Round fish. one through three, they do like eight draws. Crickets. Who cares? I don't want to bring up the embarrassing things Ray was attempting to do with like <laughs> whale early on. It is. It's an interesting match too because like people may have forgotten Ray without being rude. <laughs> I think she kind of got like a free win in the semifinals. Uh, 
you know, Dan yeah, from duck, shot from for Best the heavens. Duck. Yeah, it kind of it fell short of what his plan was going to be. And yet he had the scratch and claw to to get a win uh, over Logic Defender, who was running some Giga Brain strats. So this he has is one like, heart left against the Skunk Gambit. Exactly. Mm -hmm. Like this is a this is a real test for for yeah, the first time. I wouldn't in say a bit. free win. No, oh, sorry, <laughs> I didn't know you could hear me. <laughs> you know. It's all right. I, and right. I and it's I right. would, hey, Dan, right. if you don't mind. It's all right. Hey, but next tournament, next tournament. Yeah, next one, next one. Ooh, the Ram. Hey, give me like, give me like a rage climbing game tournament. I got this. Yeah, <laughs> make just a tournament for Dumping. you. I actually have that happen a decent amount. It'll be like you know, some random creators will be like, hey, can you make a you know just like a speedrunners event so I can just win that real quick? Or <laughs> boomerang really? foo is kind of picking up if you want to throw that one on. Yeah. I'll get started on that. Yeah, I'll work on it, man. I'll work on it. That was a lucky turtle, but I don't think it would have mattered. I got to say, me personally, I'm a big fan of Ray's team name. Uh, What is it? The Smooth Heads? It's <laughs> okay. perfect. Yeah. Yeah, I wonder why. Got, I wonder why you feel that I'm way. feeling a lot of love. We got uh, the Smooth Heads. We got uh, Bald People Rule. Yeah, that just reminds me to take my pills. I'm not even going to ask with the... The whole wheat warmed up bagel over there. I'm butt chugging Propecia and eating warm bagels. Oh, I see. I'm not. I I'm just, not on it yet. But I, look, I, I I consider it daily. I I compliment your hair a lot. I, I, as someone who went through very early age male pattern baldness, I I think you got. I mean, long term, who knows? But in the short mid term, I think you got nothing to worry about. Looks looks full, tight, thick. Now I forget if we're talking about my hair or something else. <laughs> that was a. It's uh, good, it's good does hair. Does parrot work? Does this work? Parrot will work. So it will serve as a second level one turkey, and then it will re imprint next round. So if she wants to move it around and have it become like a second kangaroo or something, she could. But oh, wow. the, the real problem is that two turkeys is great, but it's really only hitting two things right now. Yeah. That that being said, it seems like it's probably gonna be enough. So, uh, I mean, what do I know? Ray's about to shut out Yeti. This is he, he's two away from lethal. <laughs> he just picked up a caterpillar last turn too, which is like, come on. Ambitious for sure. <laughs> yeah, you're not gonna live that long, King. I'm gonna be honest. I think I underestimated Ray. She's she's going for the jugular right off the bat with this like turkey parrot build. I never would have considered it. I would have thought you'd have to like slow play it a little longer, get like a, a tiger, get uh, some sheep going here, but she's making like a mid game Turkey totally work. She sold her ant level two. And I thought this dumb ass and, uh, <laughs> and I was wrong. Like this, this is new gamer technology. Like, and, and not to mention she's ready with like, uh, you know, 60 seconds remaining. Kind of a statement if rounds. you 15 0 someone in a 1v1. One, one I mean, that it, it, it's the kind of thing that people have oh, that was a been great killed badger. for less. That was a great badger. I'm oh, still that's another badger. a second badger. That's going to kill too. <laughs> oh my God. It's actually kind of incredible. She's got uh, Yeti 15 to 1 right now with like very little that Yeti can do to pull himself out here. And a level three Rue. It's going to be tough. I'm just looking at what we got here. I kind of love Snake here, but I think you just keep what you got because Yeti has to figure something out. Yeah, that's the if you're winning like by so much, you don't really have to invest in a pivot. You can just strengthen what you already have. Even if you lose a round or two, it doesn't matter too much. I, I just don't, I mean, I'm looking at Yeti's team. He's got a bison that doesn't have anything to trigger the bison effect. He's uh, probably one turn away from his caterpillar popping, but even then it's only going to steal a little bit of HP. If Yeti has 10 turns, he, he ends up beating her every time. Because he'll have a level three with the bison. He'll probably start crushing, uh, but he doesn't. He doesn't have that. So he's just yeah, going to lose. Leopard, Leopard doesn't quite hit the turkey. And he should have put the pair on the beetle here because he should have acknowledged that he lost it by 2 HP. He probably would have ended up winning if he had done that. 
Man, that is a, that's just a nasty first round. 15 all. <laughs> Holy shit. Oh, God, Fucking I got roll. so lucky. That was <laughs> so an insane sorry. turkey roll. That was an insane turkey roll. Uh, <laughs> bit of a rolling crazy. sesh right there. It is a best of three, though. Ray, you did it. Uh, well, yeah, not, over got, yet, not over yet. I've not over yet. I've never got that lucky in my life. <laughs> <laughs> All right, game two, start when you're ready. Ray, we, uh, yeah, we, need, win, we, can, Ray. we need to make and a new the twins uh, code. win the entire tournament. Oh, God. This is it, Ray. You can do it. Yeti's right here, Saikudo. <laughs> <laughs> huh? <laughs> huh? I thought the Yeti. Uh, well, <laughs> well, he's deafened still, right? Nope. Hello. Oh, <laughs> God. Um, this is going to be the the code. Give me one second to set it up. <laughs> no worries. Well, you know, at, at least he won't have to hear it for long because Ray's so good. She's going to win again. Let's okay, go. Ray. Okay, Ray. Okay, okay. Let's chill out. Let's chill out. Like, you know, right here. Very good right here, fight. He's always, he's always he's also an excellent player. Please come he's, on, help me out. Look, I'm biased, all right? What am I supposed to do? I'm biased. I'll admit it. I'll admit I'm biased for Ray. What, what are we going to do? Um, you'll put up a good fight, though. He'll surely put up a great fight. I'm just, I'm, I'm biased. I... I just need to make sure they're in a game against each other. Because there was, there was a little bit of leaking going on there. But I, I mean... Two people got in the game is start. Yeah, okay, it's good. Look at that. No problem. The shiny bikers against the witty presidents. Lin Manuel Miranda. Are you talking about Lin Manuel Miranda here? Well, someone named their team the witty presidents. So hmm. it just seemed befitting. All right. Well, hey, Yeti turns it around. There's a win. On the board. Let's go, Yeti. I, I'm a round up. I'm round up. Oh, I forgot to deafen them. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Just secretly tell all the strats. What do you think about Bird? Talk to me about Twitter, man. I think it's horrible. Like, I, I really <laughs> do. I, maybe in 10 uh, HP, I haven't rolled it too much in the since the update to, to take you to more lives. So in versus, it might be okay. Because, like, you can afford to throw some early rounds if it gives you a benefit later. But... I, I think it's tough. Anything with one HP that isn't an ant, I think is really hard to run early. But these, these are just like a, it's a ragtag team here. We got crickets, we got beavers. We got a 2-3 otter somehow. All right, yeah. It's, it's gonna and be let a me one, tell you, one. Ray is an avid pig user. I really don't, I don't see it. I, I would maybe say the pig is the one of the worst tier one units. I That's mean, just my take on it. 2-2, two, two, like, if it's what you get in the shop, I prefer a pig over something like a mosquito. Oh, I'd take the mosquito any day. I couldn't I couldn't bite on that. Because half the time, you end up using a mosquito, and it just it hits an ant. And it's like, it just, you know, just buffs the unit anyway. Yo, but when it hits the ant, that's great, because you didn't have to live through the ant's attack. <sighs> I'm going to guess, perhaps, perhaps. The ant's going to get the buff regardless, but or it's going to give the buff regardless. But I'm also I'm I'm a little off kilter. Like I don't run the the uh, strategy here where I choose what like the Yeti's doing. I don't choose what unit's gonna get the ant buff. I just run it at the start and then, you know, I I let the chips fall where they may. Ooh. But that's raised. My my apologies. My my mistake. Yeti came out with a big fish. How did that fish appear? I I'm loving that we got two honey fish here. Yeah, it's a strategy you rare. don't see too often, but <laughs> they're both letting it ride. I'm not the biggest so, honey fish enthusiast. Yeti has two birds buffing each other. Okay, now now they're going to all go to the fish. At some point, you got two birds, now oh. one bird, an ant, and a flamingo. All of those units are highly disposable. It's an asset because you can sell those at any point to pivot to a better unit Ooh. or pill them for that matter. I'm a avid tropical fish fan. I think it's terrible personally, but <laughs> I love tropical early on. Cause then you just, you get to like, you know, I mean, this is a little late. It's round four, turn four. It just gives a little health. It's nice. Health is good. I don't know. I, I haven't played much pay to win since, uh, since the 10 patch came out. So I'm a little, uh, out of practice. I'm, I'm way into the free to play right now. Maybe, maybe it's got some room to grow for me. 
Ooh, this is gonna be, a, I think, a juicy honey fish win. Honey fish gets the job done, yeah. And yet he's up right now. I still think this is very much in flux right now. Anybody could win. Like the benefit to to Yeti's team, and and he is up right now. But again, like so many of these units are totally disposable. Like there goes the flamingo, and then the ant's not long for this world. He's got a caterpillar to get the scaling off the fish now. Like he's got an engine to get him going. I'm Ray has Ray is pretty good. This is a a weird team. It's ambitious <laughs> for sure. <laughs> I think I think that this can work if you're okay losing this round and then pilling both of those ants or getting a level two ant in the future. Right. It could it could get you there. But this round is is probably gonna hurt a little bit. All right, seems she's about done. Still rocking that bird though. I mean, look, man, you you have a 13-8 fish. 13-9? <laughs> this you know, is a bird tropical fish statement against your tier list. It is, and, and I'm okay with that. We already saw the goat rise a little bit relative to what I thought it could do. Actually, I think Ray might be okay. It, it's going to be... Maybe it's not going to be that close. But uh, just due to the order and composition... I think of, it's actually a, team. Ooh, it's a win for Ray. Yeah, I think if if, if Yeti reconfigures the, the order of his units, he might be able to pull out a win even without changing stats. But just due to the positioning there, he definitely he did not get it done. He has to stop trying to make Caterpillar happen. I mean, I I would agree in principle, but I don't think that's going to happen. He's obsessed with Caterpill. I think it'll work. I, I, I think he can get there. I, I personally, for me, I, I think he's got to get rid of that tropical fish, though. I know it will offend you. I am offended, yeah. I think this bird I, and this fish are getting real strong, real buff, and you're kind of hating because they're so powerful. Wow, I he's think he's cycled. He's got a couple of units Ooh. that like that don't do anything yet. Hatching Chick is not one of them, though. Hatching Chick is really good. <laughs> I think Hatching Chick is, like, S-tier, depending when you get it. I think so, too, yeah. I, I see it almost like a, it's like an early Scorpion. Like, you give up one space, but it's it's going to have, like, a huge impact disproportionate to that. Mm -hmm. But you got to get rid of that Tropical Fish. He's going Big right. Fish, baby, 1711. Because also, you know why it's good? Because the Butterfly is going to sprout its beautiful wings. It's true. You need to start buffing this fish. He has no unit that's going to scale. He's, he didn't go puppy. I mean, he's... I th I think I think you got to sell the fish. <laughs> I just... I don't have any other reasoning beyond that. But. Okay, Ray's team took a huge turn. This is the... We're going back to Turkey at some point. This is the Turkey Audible, I think. Oh, you Ooh, know what? Going to lose to the honey pot. Always hurts. The honey pot has taken six hearts from her. Oh, scorpion. A real scorpion. No, no shot. You go. That's too early for scorpion. You got to get rid of the fish. You got to. Yeah, see? All there right, you go. Right. Right. You know what? I, it did its job. It did its job. <laughs> scorpion at the back. That Surely just for a placeholder. <laughs> yeah, what the hell is even that? Bison? You like the bison here, man. He's, he's got to get to a level three in order to make it pop. I, I might keep it frozen for a couple rolls just to see. Oh, and the tabbing has begun. Here we go. All right, I'm, I'm switching over to Ray. I can't handle the tab Andy. <laughs> he's trying Ray's to make, probably trying to make sure the scorpion hits the, uh, uh, I don't even know, maybe hits the whale or the kangaroo. It feels not symbiotic to have root and ox. Too many mouths to feed. It is true, actually. I, but I think that uh, you you can keep the kangaroo longer than you can keep the ox. Like, the ox does really well by itself early. The kangaroo, it can actually last because it really scales with the unit in front of it rather than itself. I think you ditched that. I hate ox. I think in the in the new patch arena, I think it's pretty good. But versus is, is anyone's game. Okay. I think... I'm just looking. Yeti's got a lot of big numbers. How did that bird get so big? <laughs> uh, the the five five from the hatching chick helps out uh, a lot, and then a lot of tropical fish. Bus. Oh, was it, it was, the fish? Was it? Ah, uh, I didn't uh, even well, recognize. it helped out. Sure, yeah. Mm, added a little bit of value. Mm, still loses to one scorpion. Still I, I loses. 
And Ray, uh, she's got two lives left. Two lives left. But it's a dangerous position because Yeti is like scaling faster and also ahead on lives. So it's gonna take a, it's gonna take a seriously fortuitous pivot here. She's got two pairs. Oh, she's gonna go ox pair pair. Yeah. Do it. I know you're gonna do it. Yeah. Finish it off. Yes, sir. Then just you know you gotta sell that kangaroo. I mean not this I turn, but. I would I wouldn't touch that kangaroo. I would leave that around. Kangaroo. The snail can go for sure. Yeah, sure. I mean that's you know what that's the best case for the snail. Actually, you know what? Maybe she outthought me on that one. A snail just a just to crush a scorpion's dreams. God, that thirty twenty fish in the back. It's gonna be a honeypot win, I think. I think you're right. I think Dude, you're right. <laughs> honeypot has won her or won him three rounds. It's gotta hurt. <laughs> yeah, it would it's, be it's the best draw. three gold ever spent. Without honeypot, it would be ten ten. Okay, now he's got, you're right, he has the bison out there knowing it's going to pop next turn. And, you know, I like what he did here. He's basically saying, like, the bison is not that special right now, but, you know, I can afford to lose this round to spend a little extra time buffing it so it's good enough just in case this round goes wrong. He made a misplay there. He threw the chocolate on the bison, which is useless because there's no level three. You could just throw the chocolate on the, on the caterpillar and you'd have two 2017 units. It is true. I think, I think the order on the Caterpillar probably is a little better. He might win regardless, though. I'm just, let me, let me tab over to what Ray's got going on. It's a bit of a hodgepodge. I think, it, it, you know, the, the problem with the whale build, it worked so well for her last time, but you're hitting the point where, like, once, if it doesn't get you returns immediately, like, it's not taking you there long term either. Not a misplay. He's playing to lose a round. Yeah, but if he wins, it's over. Ray has one heart. So if, all he needs to do is win, and if you have 229, like it's 17 kind of health units, it's, you're it's just going to win. It's a bit of an optimistic rooster, but anything can happen. Do you believe that? The games, yeah, you can't really say that in this game. Basically, as soon as the round starts, it's mathematically ordained to, to, <laughs> to who's going to win and who's going to lose. Okay. It's all about killing that fish. You, you know, know what? what? This is uh, actually not looking bad. Yeah, I actually got the job done there. There you go. I swear to God, Yeti would have won that if he had simply put the chocolate on the right creature. <laughs> so she's a, a bit of hope creeps in, but now he does have the level three caterpillar. So the bison's going to scale four, four every turn, which is going to be nuts. Yeah, now he's got garlic. Might have been a win-win regardless for him. Ray, staring at so many options, hasn't done anything. <laughs> this is a, it's a tough one because you, you get trapped sometimes in this game where you're like, I barely won that last run. I need every unit, but I know that they're going to get stronger this time, so I can't just stick with what worked. So you got you to gotta choose you know, your least favorite animal and send them, even if they won you the last round. What is she doing? Oh, that's interesting. Okay. All right. I like Mammoth in front. I reserve judgment on it. Because I feel like there, there's been like 10 things in a row where you're like, how do you feel about this? And I'm like, it's ass. <laughs> so I don't want to just be the guy who says everything sucks. But you like I to think, be results oriented here. Yeah. You know what? Here's what I'll say. I think I think Mammoth Whale is the best way to use a Mammoth. Yeah. In, That's true. in my estimation. It's not like the greatest unit alive, but... And we're, we're early enough, I think it could do something. I think late game, you, you kind of snooze on 4-4 four, four on everybody because people are hitting for 50, but I, th I think that, that now it could make a difference. I think this is Curtains. Oh, it's going to be the honey again. a it? honey win. <laughs> wow. <laughs>
Honestly, if she had had honey on that kangaroo, uh, I think it would have been uh, still even. Honey's the game changer. Hello, hello, hello. Hi. Hello. The V honey every pot. time. Yeah, the V <laughs> so many times. Just tough. Honey oh, Ray, pot, I don't Harry know if this is like that one bad to say right now. In the top right, if you click the magnifying glass, you can see your opponent's old comp from the last what? round. What? Yeah, you can yeah, check yeah. the old I, I don't you know if it's know like that? cheating to tell her this, no. but I feel like it's just a regular game no, thing. No, not, not cheating at all. Tips. It's just it's not cheating. Yeah. Dude, Yeti's a tabbing Tabitha. He doesn't go a second without tabbing. <laughs> so I was tabbing a lot. you my comp the whole time? Yeah, no, no, you can't, it, you can't actively see the the current comp. You, you see can the last see the previous oh, you see the previous one. But it helps a yeah. lot because if they don't if change forget. it, you can try and counter their comp. It helps a lot when you, you get sway. It's in the top right yeah. when you're mm -hmm. playing? Top okay. right, yeah. there's a magnifying glass. It, it'll don't help click a lot the, when you uh, Don't click the swords because I think that'll cause you to view a replay and it might crash your game. It's weird. Oh. oh. Just the <laughs> magnifying glass. Well, unless you're losing, in which case, click the sword for sure. True. Um, all right, so here's the code. That just in case. Last I will game. Put... Yep, time to put it in. Almost leaked. I was gonna say. Uh, hey, I already leaked. <laughs> already leaked. That's a creative code. No, I, I did not leak the that. Screen, I leaked it. Join, join. Oh God, Sakuto leaked Wait, it. Wait, what? I, you didn't give me a warning. I had that full screen. I was drinking a bottle. Wait, are you in? I, he warned. Yeah, I'm in. I'm in. He specifically okay, cool, cool. did warn. <laughs> <laughs> uh, all right, yeah, he's in, but Ray's not Ready. in. I think. Oh, it, it says I'm loading in. Oh, okay. Uh, yeah, we'll there's probably another server. Oh, restart, restart. Yep, yeah, restart. Okay. All right, I'm going to start a new, new lobby, just in case. Wait, why is everyone saying okay. scam chat? Moz, did you pay out the wrong people? And... It says I'm loading Are you looking... Wait. What is going on? It was supposed to be for the set, and the mods paid out for game two. So people did a bet for game one, and then we persisted that bet through game two, and then the mods paid out for a game two result. Well, hey, let's just pray to God that Yeti wins so that it doesn't end up looking like we scammed everybody. Wait, is this a random person? What's happening? Yeah, I think it is. I think we have a non. Uh, okay, right. Can you make out? the code? Oh. I'm, okay, I'm having uh, problems. Remake it. Remake it. <laughs> Here's I'm an idea for the code, the Yeti. Code. Make it something that is not just final game or grand final. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> yeah that would be a good idea. I sort of. Agree also, with that. by the way, Ray is going was... absolutely beast mode against a random <laughs> right now. <laughs> yeah, Ray is <laughs> slapping this guy. Absolutely slapping him. They went exact. Style. Oh, she's playing nobody, and that's why it's going to be a ditto. I don't know if she'll recognize. I wonder how long it'll take her to realize that nobody. I don't know. Oh, okay. Oh. Okay. Good job, I did, right? I you didn't won. Get in the game. It was weird. Woo! All right, let's Wait, go. Why, why can you make? Can out? you make the game? Because I couldn't oh. get in. <laughs> oh, okay. Yeah, I'm sorry. Uh, <laughs> oh, okay. Yeah, that makes sense. Hey, thanks for the points, mods. I really appreciate that. <laughs> Don't. Hey, come on, man. Hey, come on, bro. <laughs> They're struggling out here. That was a good round. <laughs> good round. We. <laughs> neither of us can resist it, Lud. No. Man, it's right. coming down to the final right, I'm in, I'm in, I'm in. There we go. Okay, cool, cool. Good luck, All right, good luck. good luck, guys. Good luck. All right. <laughs> Predictions, Northern Line. How are you feeling? Um, I... Here's the thing. If Ray, She seems to have a pension for the summon builds. If she gets the dream line, she gets an early whale. She gets uh, an early sheep. She gets an early turkey. I think that that's really hard to beat. But for consistency <laughs> and adaptability... Did you see I that? I think I gotta go with yeah. Triple the, freeze. The triple, fr including a frozen horse, which I, we don't need to talk about. It, that's, that's a little fine. disgusting. Okay, yeah, he's he's playing a long game with two birds. It's gonna be a draw. Early draw, very typical. Yet he won with the birds right last time. It is true, and and even though I uh, I insulted it, I gotta admit it got the job done eventually, quite comfortably as well. You know what I like double horse for? Okay, go double horse, spawn like an ant, spawn a fish, and then they're like they're like a five two unit. Sell the horses, and then just move on with your life. I think that that can be fine. Like if and if you have no other options and you have to buy like a horse and one other unit, you always buy the horse first so you get like a little buff for one turn. But I I'm still like I, I just now don't I'm buy it. <laughs> She's actually going full summoner build. Yeah, I think she really she's comfortable in that like that summon archetype. I, I 
I don't love it, but I think it can work with the perfect conditions. Yeti Ooh, going yeah. crap. The other bird. advantage of the horse is it does let you rotate easily, because if you switch units, it'll give it a little bit of a buff for that turn. You are also it's a horse true, Harry, yeah. right? I also am a horse. Yeah, I spam horse, so I... You're it does a help horse rotate, whale you know, lover, you and I think buff. Ray is kind of similar to you. Uh, yeah, we practiced together, so, uh, you know. Obviously, uh, you know, one of us, you know, went in the loser's bracket, so that was a thing, but, uh, <clears throat> yeah. <laughs> Is she just, she, she seems like she's trying to keep triple cricket. Yeah, I mean, cricket's really good with those two horses out there. I do feel the frustration. She's trying to put the other horse in the she back wants stronger. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. She, and the yeah. game doesn't let you. <laughs> you have to kind of wiggle the horses around the right way. You know, you got to use the horse to move the other. Dodo would be kind of big here because the Dodo She's gets running like a three, long three. time. I'm, I'm worried. Uh, 27 seconds. She's got 20 seconds and seven gold. This happened to me last time. I bad, bad situation. What are you thinking here, Ray? 15 seconds, seven gold. This is not. Ray could go level two. You could get a you could get a level three creature. She needs one more. She needs one more. She's only got eight seconds. That is a crazy That's a play. Putt. Not bad with two horses. She's got to pivot off horse. Frozen dog. Yeah. I I think it could work. It, I, I'm, I'm still not sold. I'm being polite. I'm not sold on the, uh, the horse cricket build overall. But I think if you get a dog in there, she's getting a lot of triggers off of the horses for sure. Yeah. The, uh, the good news is like this melon armor doesn't really matter when you have cricket army. Yeah, yeah. Just breaks it on the first go. I think she wins this. Yeah. All right. Good start for Ray. All I'm gonna say, and this is not playing favorites. Those three early games is the same as one late game win. So hey, one one three gold garlic armor <laughs> and the whole horse cricket yeah. house of cards falls down. That is true. One garlic armor would just destroy this. Did you see what she just did? Um, she's going no, full horse dog. She went double honey pot on both crickets. You Jesus, know, it's respectable. Gone. Realistically, I mean, if he doesn't get like a garlic a armor or a hippo, it's gonna work. I... This is crazy. Uh, okay, but the only one horse makes this a little. I guess it's just for the dog to be buffed a bit, but the dog doesn't get that much. It only gets one, so it's not. I, I think this early, it still could be pretty good. As long as this thing dies before. It's gonna be a draw here. It's gonna be an even, yeah. Not too bad, though. Mm. Here's my dog hypothesis. Never okay. bust the dog with in-game summons. Only buff the dog with out-of-game summons. Yeah. yeah. Now there's a chance. <laughs> the horse has left. You're happy the horse has left? I'm ha now, now I'm back in. Yeah, I mean, the horse is definitely a bait. Like, I feel like it's good sometimes, but a lot. it's so easy to think it's good when it, like, just falls off. Maybe buy the cricket, combine the cricket, buy the dodo. You know what? Put me on. Uh, I'm going to go on Yeti's stream for a second here. What counters what he's building right now? He's just got a good squad. Nothing too special. He's got an 11 5 fish. Hmm. He's putting a lot of stock in. Like, so last time we went big fish, it seems like he's trying to go big swan. I love big swan. Great build. Yeah, big swan. But sometimes you just don't get swans, and then you're just stuck with like a level one swan. Which is always sad. I'd still keep it over a horse, but I know that's not really about that anymore. <laughs> I'm just, like, I'm, I'm hung up. Yeah, no matter what happens, you know, Bill doesn't pass in the house. <laughs> Fucking horses. <laughs> Sons of bitches. Yes, it's early. I don't, here's what I'll say. Even though I'm not the biggest fan of the summon build, I think... Ray has made a, a smart pivot. She's got some good units. Yeti's team right now, I'd rather see a 5'11 fish than an 11'5, but you don't always have control over that. But I, I still think this is a toss-up right now. Mm. I mean, I think it's going to be a win for Yeti. I believe you are correct. That dodo is pathetic. It needs time. For sure. 
You got you got a one attack a dodo. Ooh. <laughs> little pill of the turtle. Seed of poppy for for you. Okay. Probably take it. We're probably gonna see, in my estimation, maybe a, a puppy freeze out of Yeti, and then we'll be looking for a caterpillar. We've seen him run it four times in this tournament so far. He goes hog wild. Hatching chick, I, I though. I think there's a dream here. Oof, I love hatching chick. The, the beauty of it is you can kind of like, even if, if you're running a caterpillar, hatching chick lets you like bootstrap wins while your caterpillar is garbage. It basically, like, a hatching chick feeding into a unit that then has garlic armor on it is, is like no lose strategies. Eventually, your caterpillar pops, and then, you know, the opposition's got some serious problems. Probably worth unfreezing that puppy you're never going to use. Mm -hmm. Oh, what? Did you see that last second order switch? He put a hatching chick on the bird? The bird. Yeah, I guess rather than having one giant unit, he, sp he split up the love a bit. I saw some tabbing first as well, and you never know <laughs> what that... I don't, I don't have the, the IQ. I don't have the, the, the cores in my brain to figure out how that would change things, but you never know. Melon over the meat. Interesting. Yeah, yeah, the melon armor on the meat. Um, oh, that was, I mean, that wasn't close there. All right, raise chance to make a comeback. What's the idea? I am not really sure. Uh, survive until five star units come out and then hope she gets, uh, hope she gets a turkey first turn maybe. Yeah, I think that makes sense. I had a feeling we'd see the whale. I, and I think this can be good. I think, honestly, I think the cricket's got to go and also mm. the spider. I don't know what you replace it with just yet, but like a, a four or five cricket that spawns a two two and a B is, is feeding yeah. like one dog is not quite what I'd want to see yeah, right I now. think the dog probably isn't going to. Oof. I, I feel like the dog just doesn't make a lot of sense right now because it's a level one dog this late, you know? It's. I'm fishing for kangaroo. The chicken, that's a really good scaling unit, I think. Selling the turtle is the last one I thought. Yeah, that's not what I was thinking either. The chicken, though, and the snail aren't bad. While we were talking, now Yeti has a rooster, a 7 5 rooster as part of the squad. Oh, with the bird involved? With the bird buffing the rooster every turn. I melon mean, armor, I guess they, they pill the turtle. There's melon armor on a what's going to be a 15-12 goose. He's making an argument that bird's decent. I'm, I'm eager to try it now. Like, I, I, I had ridden it off for so long. Oh, that was a good kangaroo. Wait, which bird? The one that, uh, the blue Just the, uh, the Twitter yeah, bird, yeah. Bird. Yeah, I thought that one sucked, but I've seen it do a few things from Yeti. Yeah, I also, I, I thought it was, like, almost unplayable. Yeah, yeah, me too. Oh, that was huge. That might have gotten him the win. Yeah. Oh, man. No, it's a tie. Oh, still But still, a tie. a tie is good for her. She's been losing the past few rounds, so. <sighs> yeah, but that was all it's because close. the spider popped out a turtle. That was a bit of RNG. Oh, <laughs> all right, we take those. <gasps> Wait a minute. Were, were you now, freaking if out she of... looks, the hippo could be good, right? He had a few summons, I, if I remember. Hippo? Uh, I mean... Did he have any summons other than the uh, chicken? I don't think he's got... Yeah, he's got one summon in the back. Oh, okay. That's it. Um, I mean, she's got to get rid of the cricket and the dog, I think. I feel like those are really holding back the... Uh... Come on, Ray. Big moves. Got an 11-7 rooster at the back on Yeti. One away from level two. Yeti, or it, he moves quick. It's, I mean, I know it's crazy. Like 45 seconds left to go. Just visions of like a tiger dancing oh. in his head right now. Oh, Ray committed. She committed to cricket. She's going level three cricket now. I think if you're going to try this and, and you could give it a shot, you're going to need to draw here, get it to level three, get a bison get garlic on it, and then maybe it, it can hang up there at the front. Can hang with the big boys. 
Okay, Melon's gone. Maybe Turtle again? No. The, the Turtle could do it, but nope. Funny. That, uh, that was a bit of a stomping. So he's two away from lethal. Okay, you could go level three Cricket. If she chocolates the Cricket, I'm going to lose it. <laughs> <laughs> Plain and simple. She's doing something that I do, which is like, I think it's a bad play, but I'm going to freeze it and do it later she, and hope people forget. She's getting some bad rolls here, though. I think she ignores that spider and just tries to go for higher class units, I think. She feels like oh. she's trying to go level two spider. Yeah, I mean, that's a play, but I think it might be better to just ignore oh, level two dog it. No, don't board. go for the dog. It's too late. It's it is too a late. Bit late. It is a bit late for level two dog. I think she just needs to try and get high class, like high level units. I, I don't think... Uh... Oh, she... Oh, there you go. That's pretty good. Yeah, that's well. Mm. The tiger's good. You can sell something for it. I mean, mm. I just don't know what you would throw it in with right here. I think if you tiger whale rooster, it doubles the whale and then it doubles the rooster after the whale dies. Oh, well, is this factual? That would be really good. I, I actually have never seen that interaction, so I don't know if it works that way. But your honor, can we get a confirmation? I honestly don't know, but it sounds he sounded confident when he yeah. said it. Uh, tiger works; it it doubles anything in front of it, no matter what. That was Jim so Hansen the whale would it summon two roosters then, or yeah? So yeah. while the whole would die, it would summon two roosters, two and points, then the, the rooster Freeze that was the in front of the tiger, would, the tiger. would also oh, double she's the, got to the rooster. Sell the... Oh my god! And she didn't get to freeze the chocolate. She's almost assuredly going to lose this one. Yeah, the the gorilla is just going to be cracked here at the front. Oh, that gorilla had oh, one health, yeah, too. That, that's, that gorilla is going to... It's another free shot. I don't think she can get through the swan. It's just too it's strong. It's a level 2 15 9 rooster in the back. I'm sorry. Is that what I'm looking at? Yep. It's... <laughs> I, I, I don't want to be... It's looking tough for Valkyrie, who 15 owed Yeti in round one and now has one life left. You could go level 3 Cricket. I don't know why the hell you would. I don't know why you did that either. This is where you look. Honestly, you run four oh, scorpions no. here. Oh no! Oh, she's she's desperate. I think you can tell. Uh, that felt like when you're at the doctor's office and you see the round peg and you just put it in the round hole. Not much logic behind it, but they fit. You can go level three. Are you talking works. about a proctologist? <laughs> hey, I, I go there too, <laughs> but that's just for fun. <laughs> Having. I, I I feel like Yeti, he's already celebrating. He's 42 seconds just looking at the 14-14 gorilla up at the front. His team is so good. I love a scorpion. Go scorpion in the front though, right? Scorpion in the front would it would blow out the gorilla for sure. Oh. I think this is it. I think this is the end, boys. I mean, even if you get through the squad, you got three uh, yeah, 17 that, attack chickens at the those back. Those chickens are going to be. Hmm. There it is. Hello, hello, hello. GG. 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 Well played. It was a, a 15 0 blowout game one. It was. Yeah. A bit of a comeback story for you, Yeti. Oh. Uh, which means our two champions are Yeti and Saikuno. Ray, still, you know, hey, you were you're out there. All right? go. Honestly, I'm surprised I even got this far. <laughs> you played super well. <laughs> no, you did really well. I struggling also that last beat Yeti game. in a game, too, so it's not like, you know, <sighs> mm -hmm. maybe a little, little boned by the cricket, but that happens to everybody. This was yeah, to further my agenda. Oh, my gosh. I really. Ugh. Yeah. I've oh, been fighting so against uh, against propaganda that uh, set two is weaker than set one, but I think it's firmly stronger. So this is my way of beating the propaganda. Well, it's definitely stronger than like a cricket, a two-star <laughs> dog, and a spider. That's true. Yeah. You know what? I respect that. I was talking some serious smack about the bluebird, and then I, I've oh, been yeah, made to yeah. reconsider. 
I agree. I agree. That bluebird was surprisingly powerful. Yay. Well, GG's. Yay. Congrats, GG's. Yeti. Thanks, Thank you. guys, for playing in the tournament. Yeti, you Thank won. You did all your things in, like, the next, you know, 90 Ooh. days. Um, Let's go. It'll show up. It'll get there. Yeah. <laughs> in due time. Uh, thank you, Ray, for playing. Thank you, thank you, Saikuno. Thank you, Northern Line, for commentating. Yep. Thanks, Thanks for the blood. tournament, Ludwig. Thanks for having Thanks us. Logic Auto. Thanks Appreciate for having you guys. Us, bye. Mm -hmm. All right, bye, everyone. everyone. Goodbye. Ciao. Goodbye. Yeah. See you guys, guys later. later. Thanks a bunch. Let's go. Yeti versus Thug Files. Ah, we're fine. We're fine. I don't want to keep these people any longer. I've already kept them four hours. Getting four hours of someone's day, that's, that's enough for me. Let's go. Uh, all right, boys. That was the Super Auto Pets tournament. A little bit scuffed at the start just because there's not like a great way to spectate Super Auto Pets, unfortunately. But I think the end was pretty cool. I think watching the, the matches for the consolation bracket and the championship bracket, the semis and the finals were great. Yeah, if, if spectating existed, it would be way um, better. You know, if, if you could just, like, for example, bounce around, like, seeing everyone's comp in a 16-man, that'd be pretty cool. But Yeti honestly won that because of the honeypot. Where's the hat? The hat will come in the next update. That's the only way for them to actually get it out. But I'll show you what it looks like. This is the hat that only Yeti Apocalypse will have. There it is. It's the crown or the, the championship trophy hat. One of one, he'll be the only gamer... On Super Auto Pets to have it, which is pretty badass. That'll be pretty hype. So if you're ever in a Super Auto Pets game and you and a homie rolls up with this hat, know that he went through the trenches to earn that. Really fought tooth and nail to get that one. Uh. Anyway, hope you guys enjoyed the tournament. If you did, you can express your enjoyment to me. By checking to see if you have a Twitch Prime. Boys, all you got to do is click on the subscribe button. See if it says subscribe free in purple. Super easy, super breezy. You click on the subscribe button. Scroll down. Look for a little checkbox here. Hit that checkbox. Hit the subscribe free button. Imagine. Imagine. Imagine you guys get crazy with it. Nah, I'm just kidding though. Unless. Unless. And I think I'm going to play a bit of Super Auto Pets. Because honestly, I've only been spectating Super Auto Pets, so I would I wouldn't mind I wouldn't mind playing a little myself. I wouldn't mind dabbling. Wow! Thank you for the subs, boys. Polar flu. That's five gifted from Jorg Schwarin. Hodor time. Thank you for the prime. Sushin Blau Turgor. What are these names from? It sounds like Hitchhiker's Guide to the Galaxy creatures. DM CG. Sigi, I Pavli, Mr. Lin, thank you very much. Ether, Suction Puppy, Vend, appreciate it, appreciate it. Germa's addicted, is he? Saikuno vs. Northern Lion. I mean, if they want to, I'm down. Are they doing it? I don't know if Saikuno's down. Oh, no. Also, Ray, did you know if you pill a turtle, it gives permanent melon armor? Permanent? Oh, you didn't. No wonder. You kept skipping that. And I was like, why should you I didn't know it was permanent. permanent? I thought it was like yeah. a one time. What? Well, Ray, what, do you, what did you think the pill was for? I thought it was you just kill your for unit? like a one I can't believe Ray didn't know about pilling till just now. You guys doing the Thug Finals? Yeti? Yo, Yeti! He left the call. He left the call. He was in... I know it might seem like I was talking to myself, but I was in a Discord call with him that he, that he left. They can't hear me. Yeti! Oh, what's up, blood? You guys doing Thug Finals? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Uh, you, want, you want me to add you to the call? I uh, would love to, yeah. All right, cool, cool. One second. I would love to commentate this. We got a little Thug Finals action. Don't mind if I do. If you guys don't know, Thug Finals is a term, at least in the Smash scene, that usually means, like, an additional finals. 
for whatever reason, you know, sometimes a, a considered better player might not have been in the finals because they couldn't play in the tournament or because they got eliminated for whatever reason. So Thug Finals is going to be between Yeti and Saikuno who won each of their brackets. Yeti. Hello, everybody. We're having Ludwig. a final final. The Thug We're Finals. Final Ray. final. Thug final. Ray uh, Venge on Yeti, round two, dark side <laughs> edition electric boogaloo. Let's go. The boogaloo. You guys Let's doing go. bow one or bow three? I probably just don't one. Know. I don't know. Classic I've, I've bow one. <laughs> Never bow one. Uh, can right, you make the code? Right. I, I'm having weird issues with making it. Okay. Thank I, you for the sub, it, yeah. Keegan. Thank you, um, Alinthus. Thank you, Lol No. Thank you, Paul Revere. Right. Turbo Laser Wolf. There's tier the three sub. I keep forgetting before. to cancel this tier three. Holy shit. I can't believe a tier three, dude. What the hell? TSW Tide. Thank you for the two months. Claude PG. Thank you for the nine months. Epic Killa. Thank you for the eight. Arcanum Cleric. Now we're getting some real nerdy shit here. Thank you very much. Ray almost won the tournament without knowing basic info. Ray 15 owed. Insane. I, I will say, I feel like 1v1 in this game is pretty hype, but also huge variance. Huge variance. You're my mans. Unimaginable levels of variance. Yeah, I'll commentate it with Ray. Me and Ray. So you get free trades on ants if he did gets he, Did he just call me out? <laughs> Exactly. <laughs> People love putting ants in the front. I do love as my ants. As long as it front. doesn't buff the first one, perfect. One kill, and then we trade. Considering Yeti, the bad stream, oh, no, you do trade. Can you stream it to Discord, Yeti? As good What's as up? it gets. Can you Discord stream that bitch? Me. Oh, sure, sure. Hit this Ooh, Let's go. Got you. Saikuno versus Mango happened, and Mango lost. I can't lost. tell. 2 0, I think. Why didn't we just stay in the Discord? You know, this is a great question. Uh, want to go back scuffed. to it? Oh, I actually this, got it. We oh, got it. it's working. It's working. <laughs> All right. <laughs> Good. It's a nice tournament, Lud. Dude, it again. was. Yeah, I it was. I think a bit scuffed at the start. At least, um, just spectator POV because like you can't uh, spectate. Yeah. So are like, they gonna add that? Uh, maybe eventually. Yeah. The devs are just two guys, though. Wow, this sounds like Among Us. Yeah, it is kind of like Among Us. Except they actually talk to us and give us... <laughs> you are savage today. Jeez. Savage Wait, kudo. Is, was that wrong? I, this guy no, woke up was the wrong side of the bed. Right, Trade traded again. He hasn't lied yet. A little bit of an even Steven off rip. Lots of good starts, good starts. I'm picking up the level 2 pig for Mango. This is my revenge for him. Why does Mango go level 2 pig? I don't oh, know. No, that was Ray I... that went level... Ray, you're the pig... Was crazy. I, just for stats. <laughs> I was losing my mind over there. Yeti, you move. F you actually both play Yeti and Saikuno. You play so fast. Uh -huh. I like playing fast. It makes me feel I good. I go by yeah, same. I go by reflexes. I, <laughs> also, <laughs> after I lost like seven gold that one turn, I I'm traumatized and never want that to happen again. Um, and then right after, he had his dog in front of his sheep for like three rounds. Classic. I did like that he saw one. It was crazy. Listen, Classic I saw this w. documentary on sheep dogs, <laughs> and uh, the dog, you know, guides the sheep around, not the other way around. You know. <laughs> that, that is, what? That is huh? true. You never, you never heard of a sheep dog? Yeah, they kind of guide the sheep. But, but sheep dogs still go behind the sheep. They do. They herd them. They, but my dogs are them. different. All oh. right. Yeah. No, I, I feel that. <laughs> oh, that bone! You're crazy. I was lucky with oh, that. Oh God. Sheesh. Yeti the Indomitable. Good start. Saikuno, how was the uh, the 16-man bracket? I went, I got destroyed, absolutely demolished, and uh, I regretted absolutely nothing. It was kind of fun, and I got a hat, so. <laughs> yeah, that's what I, I did. I don't know if I could have beat Yeti, so, I mean. Well, you know, we're about to see. Yeah, we're going to find <laughs> out. We'll see. I, I don't have a lot of confidence. I actually was telling Lud before we even did this tournament that this is Tycuna was better than me. In DMs. <laughs> Wait, who told you that? I was saying that Yeti to Lud. Because oh. I was, I, I, Yeti has to join, and I was like, man, I don't want no fucking sweaty-ass hoes in this bitch. And he's like, Tycuna's better than me. And I was like, oh, okay. I am? 
I well, think so. That's what he said, and then he won the tournament. So maybe he I didn't think I was going to do that well. Yeah, he's a liar. You yeah, should have seen me. No, I, I was. Yeti just lied for the scam there. I was doing sixteen yeah. man brackets with my chat, and I was consistently getting like top four, and that was it. I wasn't able to get any Ws. <laughs> my chat's not good. They're Ooh. just subsets of your chat, lud. Holy Jesus, that fish is cracked Ooh. out. Okay, wait, my chat's Ooh. really good. First of all. <laughs> Fish is so good. That is the a fish great is fish. fish is crazy. That fish gave me trauma. This it is the same fish he's been carrying for. Okay. It just Ooh. scales. Interesting. This is a this is a gambleroni of a play, but I'm willing to try it. Kind of excited for to see your gambleroni. Beep up, hog. Keep a bug for sure. Interesting. Wow. Wow. Yeah, that's the weird champ play I got. I I'm guessing. Oh, wait a minute. Hello. This could work out if I get lucky puffer shots. I love honey badger. Honey yeah, badger is so too. good. If the puffer hits the hatching chick, it's Jesus. Oh, not terrible, but. Oh, oh lucky there for me. No oh, man. Oh. Oh. Oh, wait. Nope. The honey I, badger. It's going to be a win. It's going to be a win. Yep, so W. Fuck. Oh. Honey badger. Goaty throaty. I've been saying oh, that. The honey fish yeah. is just a subset of that, really. He's not. He's an inferior version, too. Oh, that was so lucky, Eddie. Is this lucky? <laughs> oh, not that guy. Yeah, this guy sucks, doesn't he? <laughs> yeah, that guy blows. <laughs> hmm. That felt weird because now his turtle is just going to remove all of the things that he put equipment on. Like, he specifically put equipment on fish and on chick. That's plus 10 damage, and now he's going to lose both of it. That's, uh, you know, I'm going to say crazy and dumb. <laughs> but we'll see. All right. Especially Trying if this guy the blowfish for hits everything the uh, can, chick. Everything. Oh, that's an early yeah. caterpillar. There you go. Didn't we just unlock tier three? Break the melon. Yes. Break the melon. Okay, uh, not the best, honestly. I'm not gonna. Broke lie. the melon armor too. Yeah, this was terrible for Yeti. I think Yeti. Oh, oh will wait, lose. he's gonna kill the ah. fish. He's gonna lose this one. This trades in with. <gasps> oh, oh no, it's that's be... so disgusting. It's gonna be a draw. Wait. Oh, <laughs> oh wait. Oh, it's because it spawns after. Okay. <laughs> take the draw. I'll take the draw. The double. Uh, why, the double wait, why doesn't beak? the uh, why doesn't the um, badger work? Because the summon happens afterwards. Because the summon happens after the thing, I guess. Because the summon yeah. happens afterwards. That's why. Mm -hmm. <laughs> All right. Hold the phone. Hmm. Okay, look. Hey, I'm a firm believer in the powers of the butterfly. But what is the... Is the butterfly really stealing from the fish here? Oh, level three hatching chick. Or level two hatching chick. All right, now, never mind. Sure. He's good. Now he can go big fish. Level two hatching chick is sick. It's just monkey, but it can go anywhere. Yeah, it's a flex monkey. Ain't nobody mad about a flex monkey. Okay, we're in it. Oh, lucky turtle spawn. Can you get that lucky? Okay. <laughs> that is pretty lucky, yeah. It looks like Saikuno completely thing, ditched his former sure strategy. No matter what. I think I do, but fish. the rams are so, there's so many of them. Which I think is good, but he'll probably oh. lose in the short term. Let's go. Real quick, by the way, we have an absolute bait tweet from Barstool Sports. Power ranking the top 10 female singers of all time. 
and they have Addison Ray in 10th. This is classic bait. This is just Twitter interaction bait. All these people who quote retweeted. Just getting baited so hard. The only reason I knew about this is because now Addison Ray is trending on Twitter. I'm just disappointed. They're making a live action Avatar The Last Airbender. That's also trending right now. All right, how's the squad doing here? This swan is replaceable. They just found out the actor they're going to use for Uncle Iroh. I'll show you right after this game. Okay. Crocodile is kind of sick. It doesn't kill, unfortunately. I love Crocodile, though. Still looks like a big loss. Sakuno's kind of getting owned right now. 100 Honey Badger's only oh. a 5-4. Like, it needs to power up a it's bit. It's getting close there. Uh-huh. This is him. <laughs> Kim's Convenience in Mandalorian star Paul Sun Hyung Lee. Honestly, great pick. I'm on board. I don't really know these shows, but I I think people think highly of them. And he looks accurate. And this person is playing Gyatso, which is like, okay. I don't think you can get a better pick there. Oh man, this is this is kind of a bad situation for me. Now, call me a hater. Scaling too much. These are the actors meant to Thank play you. Aang, Katara, Sokka, and Zuko. Is this two out of three? Or is it just one game? Uh, I'm down to play on however many. Here's my thing. <sighs> Five in a row. And then at the end, everyone will remember I just that. Feel and like, like, oh, he did it. He got the one. The charm that kids have when they're animated does not translate to when they are live action. So I'll never be happy with the choice for any kid. I'm always disappointed. And it's not their fault at all. Aang is a kid. You're supposed to have like an 11 or a 12 year old play a kid. That's how it works. But anytime a kid plays an animated kid role, I just find it annoying. Even though, like, I love Aang as a character. All right. Yet he's kind of thrashing right now. Level 2 Swan's an interesting play. I don't love it. Ooh, Mammoth. Sushi to try to buff up the fish. Yeah, every time the fish gets buffed. Oh, this is going to be a good squad now, though. Wow. This is actually going to be a great squad. It's going to be a 20... A 1721 fish, 1721 butterfly. I don't think Saikuno wins this. He's 112 Lamau. <laughs> okay. Oh, okay, you fucking nerd. <laughs> Actually, <laughs> um canonically, he's 112. <laughs> All right, eat shit. I kind of liked the One Piece live action actors. I don't know. I, I looked at them and I liked it. I guarantee you the live piece one action or the One Piece live action movie is going to be a big stinking pile of shit. Because you're condensing what they put into. I'm sorry. What is it? They, they put in. I'm trying to think. You are condensing what took a thousand episodes into eight. Yeah, I, you know, I just don't think you're getting there. Okay, one more, one more. That was me taking Revenge that, for Mango. That, was a that, game. That, was a that wasn't, that wasn't Revenge game, for Ray. That was me Revenge for Mango. It's a best of three. It's a best of three. Yeah, that was for Mango. He's. It's a show, and it's only East Blue. 
is East Blue Arlong Park. So this is basically going to be like, okay, let's get Usopp. Let's get Zoro. Let's get... Oh, wait, so Sanji's not even going to be in it? But I thought Sanji was in it. Is Sanji in Arlong Park? I thought Sanji was after Arlong Park. Oh, you guys are right then. It goes up to Chopper. In eight episodes? This took the actual animated show 400 episodes to do. Maybe 300? Maybe I'm blanking. I think I always extended on hindsight. In my mind, the Sanji arc where they're on the floating restaurant, that was like 70 episodes. <laughs> the way I remember it, it felt like they were there for fucking eternity. But it was probably like three episodes. All right, new game, new game. Yeti won game one. Looks like he's going to win. All right, no, going to draw. 400 is this time skip. Right, okay. And then when do they actually get through the whale thing, through the mouth, to the new world? That's like six, seven hundred. That's like the hundreds? Wait, what? No, no, I'm talking about when they go to like the new world. Like fish, fish man. Fishman, right before. It's right after the time skip. <whistles> worst arc. I think the worst arc is the. What is it? Is it? No, not Annie's lobby. The um. Uh, Sky Lightning God one. <laughs> Sky Pia. Unless the guy comes back and becomes a character later on. And I don't know if that's the case. Sky Pia. Trash. Fish, fish arc, Fishman Island. Pro actually, you know what? Worse than, worse than Skypea. Thriller Bark is with. Uh, no, I've seen Thriller Bark, right? Isn't Thriller Bark like right after um, they get fucking uh, what's his name? I think I've seen that. Brooke, yeah, right. Yeah, I've seen Thriller Bark. I think I probably. Yeah, that was that weird fight in that weird lava place. Saikuno with the double horse build actually works. Gets a win. Fish Island is top five arcs. I'm glad that you are able to enjoy that. Honestly, that means you're going to live a happier life than everybody else in chat. Because if you can enjoy watching a giant stinky dump, then every single thing you will watch for the rest of your days is going to be hype. Yeah, I've seen Evangelion. Right now, I'm watching JoJo's Bizarre Adventure. It's just like a little too dramatic for me, though. It's just like a touch too dramatic. I almost think that a live act... Oh, wow. Hor wow. He would have wanted the horse regardless because of the honeypot, but... So I could have kind of crushing with the summons. The problem, you know, I this is my hot take. I think JoJo's Bizarre Adventure would be one of the best live action remakes 
because they are animated with the worst dialogue, most over-exaggerated um, writing of all time. And so you could get even the most terrible dog shit actors and it'd probably turn out great. Sell the swan. What the hell? Skunk, man. I like the skunk. Oh, they did a live action for one. I'm at part three, and the dialogue kind of feels like this. Jotaro, no, you'll die if you do that. Immediately does that. Shut the fuck up, you dumb cunt. Walks away, inner monologue. Huh. That was scary. And that's, that's like every single scene. And it's like, oh my god. <laughs> I'm rolling my eyes every time. That's part of the joke. And I think that's what they were hoping for. But by God, is it not funny? On the 18th time. They're riding one joke into the ground. Double snail? What are you, psycho? Double swan I like. Triple swan! I can't believe he kept the snail. I don't watch anime for comedy. Or, or comedy. I also agree. I don't watch anime for comedy. The only funny anime I've ever seen is The Devil's a Part Timer. Psyche K is about as funny as, like, you know, a PBS documentary. I don't get how people laugh at that. Damn, horse summon build actually thriving. With a level one shitty ass horse, the honey horse is clutch. One Punch Man? I mean, I kind of just like the fights. But I've never been like, ha <laughs> ha! That was one punch! Like, they spent five minutes hyping up how big and bad this monster would be, and then one punch took him out. Oh my god. <laughs> I don't know if that's what I'm supposed to be doing. Oh, I love Amoeba Turtle. Amoeba Turtle is a classic. I like Pear, yeah. It's a long-term play. This is going to be actually super good because the, the amoeba is going to get rid of melon, splash, and honeypot. I don't know if he'll win this. I think, he, uh, he, I think he'll still lose, though. He's still going to lose because of... Um, ah, yeah. I mean, honestly, Saikuno's just got a good setup right now. If I ever insult your anime for calling it not funny or whatever that you like, and you're ever feeling like insecure about it, all you have to say is, ah, it's funnier in the manga. <laughs> and then I'll be like, all right, yeah, fine. No, I can't really argue that. I don't fucking know. So you can just say that, and then I just have to be like, all right, bet. It's just a good way to defend anything you might like. This is a weird team. I, I, I would have kept the amoeba. I mean, I think he was fine. You just needed the level 3 butterfly to get the power up. Uh, this melon armor is not even going to be used, really. Yeah, this looks tough. Could still be a... No, this is... This is Jeejus, man. Maybe? No. Honeypot W. 
Got oh, revenge for race. You can't the get honey revenge. pot gambit. Fifteen zero. I got fifteen zero again. Can I? Can I lose with a little? You have again. to do one more, right? Just yeah, it's game game three. It's game can three I lose now. With anything but fifteen zero, please. It's one to one. <laughs> oh, I swear man. I'm better than okay. this. All right, I'm ready for the original passcode. I have the One Piece manga set, but I'm missing a few, and I bought them on Amazon, but they don't ship out because they're sold out for like until like I don't know soon, I guess. Don't like the code? Whoops. <laughs> what the fuck? He's birding the bird? Oh, that's crazy. Quick basic intro to Super Auto Pets. Yeah, you know, you're just supposed to pick out the best creatures you can. Every animal has a different ability. So, for example, the ants, when they die, will give someone behind it, after they faint, two attack in one health. Random person behind it. So, if the ant is second to last, it will guaranteed give the person in very last a power up. I'm imagining this is going to be a draw. Could be a win, though. Actually will be a win because kind of luckily both power ups went to the bird. If the power up had gone to the second ant, then Yeti would have tied. So that was a bit lucky. And so then you just kind of roll through and you try to pick the team comps you're most comfortable with. Yeti, for example, loves going bird. The bird gives the person in the very far left a power up. And then ants are always, you, you never hate having an ant. Oh, you yeah, have duck true. strat? I yeah. have songbird strat. Yeti, you can't get uh, 15 would Oh, I'm muted. Yeti, you can't get 15 would Good luck. I know. I've already, I've already broken the curse. We're good. Just tuned into Germa stream. Look what he's rocking. Bad. Really bad. Please. No. Oh, <laughs> shit. Okay, he's rocking. He oh, my God. Jerma is rocking triple hedgehog. When the hedgehog dies, it will deal two damage to every single player on the field. So going triple hedgehog is like insane. Let's see how it works out for him here. Turtle's going to hit. Melon armor breaks through. Why does it seem like his is running with like better frame rate than any video game I've ever seen in my life? Hedgehog kind of crushes Ram. Although it doesn't really affect. Well, actually, this is going to be kind of good for him. Wait, what's hive mine? Oh, the extension. Oh, wait, you guys are getting baited. Guys, you're getting baited. You're getting baited. You're getting baited. <laughs> Guys, Hive Mind is back this weekend, but it's going to be an exclusive Riot Games Hive Mind episode. It's an exclusive Riot Games Hive Mind episode that I will not be hosting or Charlie will not be hosting. Riot Games asked to do a Hive Mind episode, and so for this Hive Mind episode, it will only be Riot. Um, gamers and players. Double Hedgehog! Leads to a draw. I just got rid of the extension, so it should go away now. Although, chat, we are working on Season 3 of Hivemind. Okay? We are working on Season 3 of Hivemind. I'm excited for the ride, people. I'm not at all salty in any way. This makes it sound like I'm salty. Saying I'm not salty for some reason makes it sound like you are omega salty. <laughs> but I, I am <laughs> I am okay. I'm happy that they're doing it. They reached out to me beforehand. I was like, that's hype. That's hype. I'm on board. Go for it. Go off. You have my blessing. Unscuffed parasocial. I mean, to be clear, at the start, Hivevine was kind of scuffed. Every game show kind of starts scuffed, right? Like even Mogul Money... Episode one was kind of scuffed. The buzzers barely worked episode one of Mogul Money. 
Mogul money's always scuffed. Okay, eat shit and die. <laughs> Mogul money's great, please, for the love of God. Next episode of Mogul Money, I think it's either end of November or December. It's a little just weird because the holidays, really. Because people like, you know, people are out for the holidays. Neck and neck match. They've drawn like three times in a row. They're on turn five already. You're saying eat shit and die or eat shit die? Like live, laugh, love, but eat shit, die. <laughs> Julie Roberts' newest film. That sounds like a box office hit. The pill is good because it will make the effect that the animal have be everlasting. This is only for out-of-game effects. So, for example, like, uh, the turtle gives Mel... Oh, I, can see, I actually don't know. You kind of just have to know which ones it works on and which ones it doesn't. The turtle gives melon armor to the person behind it when the turtle faints. Oh, it's only after faint effects. That's it, yeah. So, some animals, after they die, have an effect. The turtle, when it dies, gives melon armor to the person behind it. So, if you kill the turtle with a pill, then it will give permanent melon armor to the person behind it. And looks like a win for Saikuno. Ooh, level two turtle would be kind of pog. You bring Swan to the front. Level two turtle gives melon armor to both people behind it. Ooh, sell rabbit, go rooster. Throw a cupcake on the rooster, maybe. Throw a cupcake on someone else. Yeah. Cupcake, cupcake on the rooster makes a lot of sense, if, especially if you're going to hatching chick, the homie. Cupcake the turtle doesn't make any sense in any way, shape, or form. I think you 100% cupcake the rooster because it, it affects the rooster and then the thing the rooster spawns. You got to sell bird though now. I don't, they should have swapped the... He should have put swan in the way back and then everything else was fine. This order's a little weird. Oh, Honey Badger for Saikuno is kind of epic. Not going to matter at all. But still epic. Yeti's team's looking pretty formidable. Probably got a garlic, maybe. Nah, just roll. Yeah, there. Now he switches to Swan. He should have done that last turn. No, garlic's useless for you if you have turtle. Easy hit the can. Can just uh, uh, elevates all units. Hit the can again. Should have hit the can first, though. Ew, honey swan? What? It's 1-1 one, one right now. Saikuno won game one. Or, excuse me. Yeti won game one. Saikuno won game two going 15-0. For the honey badger? Oh, yeah. I guess that makes sense then. It is a honey badger counter. Oy, oy, oy. Chances of a Reddit recap today? We could Reddit re. It's been a minute since I've dropped that Reddit recap. So come and join our Flash Wood Wing Noggin. Ooh, the Rams are really good against the chick, but they came out at the wrong time. Turkey, though. Yeah, look at that. Saikuno wins it. This is back and forth. Ow, fuck. All right, get the can, always. Level two swan, don't love it, but okay. Roll again, for sure. Straight up roll. Go can, maybe? Yeah. End turn. Probably going to lose this one because you only <laughs> the only thing Yeti did is change his swan to 11-9 instead of 10-8. So almost assuredly going to lose this. I kind of like that switch, though. Rooster in the front. 
You should probably be putting the rooster in the way back so it can get buffed by the chick. Melon overrides honey. Yeah, that's true. He's got a weird team with too much going on. Real quick, by the way, Germa watch. We have Germa who has two level two hedgehogs. Again, when a hedgehog dies, it injures everybody on the field. And he's going tiger hedgehog. Which means that it will hit everybody on the field twice for eight damage. Which is fucking insane. And yet he's getting rolled. Oh, yet he's getting big time rolled. But that was to be expected. He changed almost nothing about his team. Okay, chocolate the rooster. Easy. The rooster in the back gets melon armored. Easy. Roll one. You want to get a pill here. No! Oh, what? I vehemently disagree with everything that's happened. I mean, uh, the, just the bird is one of his stronger units. And also giving some buffs. Ooh, I don't know if this is good enough. I guess that's a decent mammoth. Because he's had so many cans that an 812 mammoth is actually pretty decent. I don't actually hate it. Real quick, let's take a look at Tiger Hedgehog. This is a, a terrible team comp for a couple of reasons. Reason number one... The Hedgehog's going to deal 8 damage to everybody, but since the Hedgehog is going to attack so late, it's going to kill the Tiger behind it, meaning that he has the only a chance of drawing, no chance of winning. Uh, watching this. Sorry. Sorry to ju jump so much. It looks like Yeti is going to... Um, he's going to win this with the Honeypot. Honeypot for the W. Um, yeah, he lost. He lost. <laughs> He lost. He could go level 3 Hedgehog, though. I don't know how to spell Hedgehog. I didn't get a... He didn't get oh. a pet for that. That is weird. This is going to do 6 damage to everybody. No, it's going to do 12. I have to keep the tiger alive. It's not going to be alive. He didn't have shop space. Doesn't it usually replace someone in the shop? With Tiger, yeah. It's going to be insane. Do another one? No, I don't think I want to. <laughs> They're trying to tell him to do another hedgehog. No, I don't think I want to. All right, let's see how Yeti's team does. It won last time with the honeypot. Saikuno, ooh, he goes Hippo. I love that. Hippo gains 4-4. Four, four, and he's got Fly Turkey. Oh, what a sweat team. Fly Turkey's pretty good. Because it will kill, like, baby units. I think this is still a loss, though. Yeah. Because the honeypot. Honeypot's a game changer, man. They both have two lives left. Level two swan. That's an, a, a possibility. Gorilla is a possibility. I think your mammoth isn't doing much for you. Yeti classically misclicking to see what the guy has. All right, Germa, real quick, making the play of a lifetime. He went Rooster in the back, which is actually going to be really good for him. I think he should go Turtle behind Tiger, and then it'll be a 7-1 chick with Melon Armor.
Let's see what Yeti does here. He has two lives left. Saikuno has two lives left. Melon Armor on the Hippo. Double Fly? Oh, that is so gross. That is disgusting. And a level two turkey. Oh, this is game over. He needs to pivot to a rhino yesterday. Yeah, Saikuno's going to win if he doesn't pivot. Let's see what uh, Germa does here. It looks like he's also going up against a Hedgehog user, which is insane because the Hedgehog's kind of a rare build. Why is this game running at, like, the fastest frame in the world? Okay. So Hedgehog dies. It deals 16 damage, kills everybody, and then you win because of Rooster. What a sick team. Oh, no, it's a draw because of Whale. What a sick team. God, it's terrible, though. He has one win and one heart left. All right. Yeti can't go level two chick. It's not going to be enough. Gorilla's not going to cut it either. You need Rhino. You need Hippo. Preferably a Rhino. Ooh, that's a bold play. Ooh, that's a bold play. I got to go pee. Wait a second. Still a loss, right? Yeah. Kind of close. But, you know, flies. Flies get it done. Well, that was a close one. That, that was, was a, a good one. set of three. GG, boys. GG's. Oh, I didn't get Yeti. a... I didn't see a single... Oh, no. That was so well played. Well played, dude. That was good. <sighs> that, I've never done that comp before with a shark, chicken, hippo... Usually yeah. I go full summoner. The hippo really kind of mixed it up, and then usually the oh, shark we... I replace early. I've never done that comp before. But... We are over. All right, let's go. Okay, boys, here's my goal. I've been inspired by a man known as Jerma, who's going double. He's going tiger hedgehog level three. That's inspirational. I want to win with a level three hedgehog. In typical Ludwig fashion, I want to take the beauty in the art of what someone did, a.k.a. level 3 Hedgehog, and then nail it to such a perfect precision where it becomes a victorious path instead of leading to a um, wonderful train wreck of one win in one heart. So that's my goal. I'm going to go I'm going to go maybe duck into a like a a, a big hedgehog. Germa's addicted to this game. It's honestly such a good Germa game. My favorite part about Germa is how long he takes. <laughs> Germa sweats for a good 10 minutes before he actually plays around. I think he's been on this game for about... 30 minutes like Saikuno in Germa or Saikuno and Yeti played a best of three Germa has played one pub match all right let's do this wait is duck in this build am I on the right build okay let me go beaver let me go fish and then let me go I'll go cricket I'll bite 
comedic muffins. That just sounds like the funny orange. Um, amazing sausages. That's a little too masculine. Offensive herbs. Mm, to a white person, that's almost every herb with the exception of mayo and salt. My favorite herb, mayo. Amazing comedic sausages. That works. Cutie, when I pull down my pant. Hey, small penis, tiny. All right, this should be a win for us. All right, this should be a loss for us. All right, this should be a draw for us. Okay, I want to go double beaver. Bird? No, I don't want to go bird. I really want to go duck. I mean, shit. Now I don't. Uh, is duck in? Am I on the right one? Why do I feel like I'm not on the right one? Duck is base set. Okay, okay. So I actually is head, but um, hedgehog still in this build, right, chat? Triple, quadruple fish. I'm gonna get owned. As long as I can still go hedgehog. Hedgehog's a tier two unit anyway. Okay, let's let's do this so I can maybe get a. Uh, I mean, I'll go blowfish. I'll go blowfish every day of the week. Hedgehog and duck are both in base set. Yep, I'll switch to base set after this game. I just don't want to be a dodging Daryl. I think we are going to get rolled here. Oh, now we're definitely getting rolled. Oh, oh, fuck. Oh, that's brutal. Oh, that sucks. Wait, we have a chance of drawing? I'll take it. Uh, hmm. Apple roll. Apple roll. Roll. Oh, this is tough. I'll freeze the fish. Roll. That should be fine. It's so slow. Speed of the fights. All right, yeah. Mods prediction. What does the no the first level speed up do? I guess this is a fine pace. I can bite for this pace. Quick win for the boys. Yeah, this is the PC Chris gave me. All right, I'll go level three bird. Rooster. I don't really want to go rooster this time. But I should. I should. I should do what God gave me. God gives you a rooster, you go rooster. It's too fast now. Oh, look, you guys are just never pleased, huh? Damn, that's a big ass Gara bug. Holy shit. Okay, a bit of a loss. When God gives you a cock, monk of speed. Feel that, brother. Feel that on an emotional level. No. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Holy shit! It does four? Check out Jerma. He's going insane. I have him pulled up. He's going so slow that it would take so long. I'll wait for him to enter the fight chat. I promise you I got it pulled up, but Jerma, by God, is he the slowest man I've ever seen.
My puffer is big. I wouldn't mind selling you and then going turtle. Turtle right here. You know, I would love a level two. I would love a level two rooster. This is such a big puffer fish. I don't think I've ever wanted the level three puffer. I might try to do that too. Uh, We're going to live here. Oh, never mind. We're going to die. Oh, we live with one HP. That's so big. Let's go. I think we're going to lose now, though. Wait, hold up. Hold up. Oh, you have 11 HP. That's so inconvenient. That is so inconvenient. Okay. I'll buy you. Hedgehog puffer combo. I only have one more life. Hold up, this is Germa. I want to see this so bad. Mm. How does this hedgehog work? Mm, okay. Here we go. <laughs> Dude, it's so bad. Okay. It's Do it again. <laughs> Wait, it's actually so good. That's a win. It's actually so good. I'm never gonna lose another game again. <laughs> I've never seen he died. You just that's have to lose every win. time until you get three uh, level three hedgehog and a mushroom. <laughs> level three hedgehog with mushroom rooster in the back is actually decent. That's crazy. He's a he's a madman. All right, I think I'm gonna go roll me. I kind of want to go mm, hedgehog here. This will get rid of my melon armor. That's fine. Wait, this is actually pretty good for me. Okay, and the... Yes? Oh, wow. One HP. Are you serious? This puffer fish should roll, everybody. Look at that. This is a good combo. Yeah. Yeah. Wow, that's an early T-Rex. Turn 9 T-Rex is crazy. I guess I could put the rooster in the front. Yeah, that's not the worst idea. Oh, you're kidding me. I think we still win this because our rooster is much bigger. You left three gold? Chat, you're memeing. You have to be memeing on me. You guys have to know by now that if you have a T-Rex and you have three gold left, it gives everybody 2-2. Two -two. You have to know that. I should put this guy in the front, though. Especially because there's a command for it. No, it's not going to spawn two. I'm so stupid, chat. I'm so stupid. I don't know why I was convinced to do this. Like, it was a good idea. Damn it. Oh, my God. Am I going to lose now? I should still win. I should still win, but what a stupid error. Germa POV? I just want to see if Germa wins with this set. I've never seen a, a set this unique. So, he has level three hedgehog with tiger, which does... 16 12 damage to everybody i think and then he has a he has a mushroom so that and on both so it does another 12 damage to everybody and then he has a rooster in the back he needs a level two rooster if he had a level two rooster it would be better it's a really hype build 
Uh, I will use... No, I will do this. No, I will... What the hell is even that? I will do this. And then I will use a pair on you. And then maybe, maybe like this? No, wait, hold up. How does the order have to go? Maybe like this? T-Rex first, rooster second, hatching chick on rooster. This is fine. This works. Chick on the puffer is not bad, yeah. I don't think we lose to this squad. This squad seems terrible. This squad's not even going to get to see my best. Actually, you know what? This might be a draw. No, never mind. Germa right now is rocking a, an insane team. As so he has long Bison. As I can keep that rooster alive. Bison level three hedgehog. Very bad. I don't think oh, good. this is a hard one to win, though. He's no, got I'm Snake. Oh, enough. he's got... This oh, no, enough. Chad. This might be it for him. Shit, it's not enough. Yeah, and garlic armor. Oh, it's not enough. Wow! <laughs> kill everybody. It's going to kill his no. whole team. Oh, it's over. Oh, <laughs> oh Damn. That was fun. That was a fun build. That's sad. Okay, let's go level two. Roll one. Um, okay. Let's do let's do a little order switch. I'm going to lose my melon armor, but I'm okay with that. I'm not stressing the melon armor that much. Yeah, I decided to go chick on this guy. Okay, this doesn't make any sense. So the mushroom gets rid of the poison ability. So it just becomes a pretty bad unit. And then you don't spawn with poison. So all in all, that was just a terrible play. This gets rid of the melon armor. No, I'm sure he didn't know. We get rid of the coconut armor. And we win. Yeah, it's a day one mistake. I think that's enough for um, a payout. Yeah, you could just never put an item on a scorpion. Oh my god, hello! Oh wait, tough one. Hold up, hold up. This is a tough battle. Oh, please hit the hatching chick. Oh no, he's dead. Oh, this is a loss. Oh, we lose by one. If he had hit the hatching chick, we would have won. This is so bad. Probably should have changed the order. I was greedy. Seven wins, I'll take it. German wanted to thank you for the invite. Well, hello. Hello. Hopefully you guys enjoyed Super Auto Pets. I think it's a good Germa game. All right, I want to go free to win anyway. Duck. Duck. Ant. Tip for everybody at home. Always put duck in the front. Miffed buttocks. Talkative buttocks. Will withering or oh, I thought that was orgasms. Withering buttocks. I haven't been to the gym in a while. Mary.
Derringer, thank you the prime. You always go duck first because people go ant first every time. And duck is the weakest creature in the game, so it'll always kill an ant. I still lose, so don't listen to me. I have no idea what I'm talking about. Duck. Roll. Beaver. Roll. Sell beaver. Oh, it's duck time again. End. We are going big duck because I want to win with either pufferfish or hedgehog. That's a big fucking ant for no reason. Honey, why is your ant? Oh, this guy went early duck, it looks like. Hello, Germa! Thank you for the raid. Okay. Oh, baby! Okay. All right. Uh, whoo. Okay. All right. We're chat. We're going to go. We're going to go big duck or we're going to go hedgehog. Hello, Germa. How's it going? Hopefully you guys enjoyed Super Auto Pets. Sorry for making your streamer play Super Auto Pets if you hated it, but I think it's a pretty fun game. And I was inspired by Germa. He had a very creative build going level three hedgehog. Now, I also would like to go level three hedgehog. I have aspirations of level three hedgehog. My game plan to get there, though, is a little bit different than Germa's. No? Um, yeah, I'll do it at this point. My plan to win this is duck strat. Because every time you sell a duck, it buffs your entire team. We're going to go with three squad. We're going to rock the three squad, yeah. I have I have aspirations. I think the three squad can win. Our ant trades pretty nicely. And then we have a huge hedgehog. Look at this hedgehog. That's a big boy. Dare I say it's a win. You don't need five units. Three can make it happen. Okay, roll. Yeah, I could I could see the crab being useful. Thank you, Creative Cloud. Appreciate the update. I'll go beaver. Raid song. Raid song, we all leave. Let's be real. If Amelia's not here, you're all leaving anyway, so. I'll, you know, I'll take the L where I see it. This is just simply bait. That was crazy. He killed the ant behind him. All right. Good start. Good start. Good start. Smiley face. I've never won with a hedgehog before. Ooh, yes. Yes. I'll pill you. Roll you. I'll sell you. I'll double you up. Oh, I should have added two. That's fine, actually. And then garlic on the hedgehog. No. I could go kangaroo. That works. Four, four can do it. This is a little bit of a fragile team. I agree with you. But let's see. Okay, we're going to kill the horse in the back, which is kind of sick. And that's a big kangaroo. Okay, okay. I don't know. I never used to be such a hedgehog believer, but Germa kind of opened my eyes. 
Level two crab is useless. We don't care about a level two crab. I kind of want to use garlic on someone, but I don't know who. Maybe the Rue. Level two Rue is appealing. And I'll go beaver for now. I really need more hedgehogs, though. Two crabs. I personally hate crab. It's more like I, uh, I am forced in this position at the moment. This guy's also going hedgehog. Apparently, Germa fans are out in the wild right now. He's going whale hedgehog. Oh, my God. So, the whale absorbs the hedgehog, spawns a new hedgehog. The hedgehog dies, kills... You're gonna... And he has a hedgehog in the back? And he has a honey pot, this devious bastard? I mean, he's still gonna lose, like, terribly. It's gonna be an embarrassing loss. But, hey, the Frigid Sausages is an avid germ of your... Germa fan number one. Okay. Nothing here for me. Nothing here for me. Mm, I kind of like skunk. Okay, let's, let's throw a pear down. Let's roll one more. I mean, really, I would appreciate something. A level two dodo. I'll do that. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Whew. Wait, did I miss a dolphin? I kind of went tunnel vision. The blinders were on. All right, they got the mafia hats on. I don't really see myself losing this one. I need a level two hedgehog. A level two hedgehog would have crushed that team. Still a win. Still a win. I like this. Does pill the hedgehog do anything? I have famously pilled the hedgehog. It permanently lowers the stats for every single person on your team. <laughs> it is hype. It's not good though. Okay, I want to go skunk. Please give me a hedgehog. Sorry about that. I guess you hate me. Fair enough. You know what? I'm going to do a legendary triple roll. I'm fishing. I'm fishing. I'll take a level two skunk. It's better than salad. That wasn't the worst case. I was fishing for a hog. I ended up with the salad. It's okay. Decent situation here, though. God, a level two hedgehog would do so much, though. Kill the worm. All right. We're going to go through the melon armor because melon armor only protects for 20. What percent of HP does a level two skunk remove? I have no idea. I've never even seen one. Let's find out. The answer, 66%. Oh, wow. Okay, we do this. We do that. We do this. We do that. Oh, chat, what is math? How does math work? So right now, this guy gives 28 to the kangaroo. I should probably put this on the kangaroo. The Rue needs some HP. I agree. Wow, eight eight. Holy shit. <sighs> and I need a. I need this hedgehog to be bigger. I got such a tiny hog. Oh, this is a good scorpion though. The hippo also gets thrashed. All right, this is a win. This is a win. We're barely winning now, though. The back of me here? Kind of weak. Seven wins. Believers get paid out. Roll. Sushi is interesting, but please roll me. Level two kangaroo is great. Thank you very much for that. Please roll me. Another kangaroo. I appreciate that. Pre please, please roll. All right, sushi. 
freeze the pair. Mm, crocodile, I don't mind. I could think about crocodile. Monkey is good, yeah. I agree with that sentiment. We're going to kill this hippo. Oh, this is an easy This team is terrible. This is an uninspired team. We need more health on this kangaroo, though. Everybody playing Hedgehog? It does feel like Hedgehog meta has sweeped the nation. Uh, okay, if I go... Pair... Pair... Roll... Roll... Roll. Snake. Ooh. I don't really know where it'd fit in, though. Yeah, you don't need a level 3 Dodo. Level 3 Dodo adds triple the, H uh, the, uh, the attack, but attack caps at 50. Snake for cat. On a 1619. This team's kind of good. Uh-oh. We get rid of melon armor. That's kind of key for us. Holy shit, we just got fucking rolled. Oh, we're gonna lose this. Oh, we're gonna lose this. Okay. We got kind of owned. It's alright, we still have a couple lives. Let's go pear. Let's go sushi. I wanna freeze you. Chocolate. Maybe uh, Skunk Leopard. I kind of like a Skunk Leopard. Alright, let's see if level 2 Hedgehog makes a difference. Oh, that was clutch! Oh, we're going to die to the stake, though. Oh, it did make a difference, but it was not a good difference. It ends up just killing me. Okay. All right. Does make a difference. The difference isn't good. Sell the cat. Let's go leopard. I'm going to save the honeypot. Roll. I'll save this guy. Roll. I'm going to go Melon on the Hedgehog. I should probably Dodo the Leopard. No, because the Leopard has 4 HP. Wait, I'm sorry. Does this mean deal 50% of my attack or of the of the attack of the enemy's health? Oh, it's 50% of my attack? Oh. 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 I did not know this till now. I'm going to honeypot the skunk just because, you know, this is a do or die must win situation. Leopard in front, it dies a hedgehog. No, it's fine. It does it at the beginning of the battle. So it kills the horse, which is good on this summon team. Wait, this is actually kind of big because our hedgehog's going to live for a while. It's going to be a huge kangaroo. Wait, I'm going to kill a 42-4 character though. <gasps> that was so stupid of me. No, oh, no. Wait, this was dumb as fuck. Oh, God. Wait, we killed a ram? 
Oh no. Do we win this? I think we win. I think we win. All right, I do need to buff up that leopard by one HP. Holy sh! How is our team winning? I think our team's pretty shit. I'll <laughs> keep it a stack. This team is pretty bad here. So let's, mm, let's, mm, let's, let's sell the skunk. And then snake the kangaroo. That's my thought process. Skunk is key. All right, people like skunk, so I'll keep skunk. I'm not that convinced. Maybe I should melon my kangaroo. Hmm. Nobody out pizzas the hut. I guess I could melon the leopard. Do one of this. Do one of these. Do one of those. All right, Godspeed. It's in God's hands now. This all comes down to how much damage the leopard does because it attacks a random enemy. That was big. That was big. We kill the rhino. We kill the swan. Big damage. Oh, he lives with 2 HP. <gasps> no, we're going to lose. We're going to lose. Oh, no. We're going to tie with one. Oh, my God. That was insane. I've never seen something go so down to the wire. <gasps> okay, let's throw some steak on the dodo. Roll. Chocolate the leopard? And then let's just... Let's buff up our dodo a bit so it buffs up the leopard a bit. Alright, let's see. Oh, this is going to be huge, actually. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. That was so big. Because now the tiger affects the swan, which is like, who gives a shit? Holy fuck. That was so clutch. And it's going to kill the creatures in the back because the... Woo! Let's go! Oh, my God. I've never wanted the hedgehog before. Or a leopard or a skunk. This was mostly a brand new team. Man, big hedgehog was kind of sick. Germa meta goaded. Woo, baby. Believers get paid out in a major way. Love that for them. All right, let's go again. Let's go again. Uh, what would be another fun build? Should we try to do it again with a level three hedgehog? Okay, we were duck. Uh, I mean, I'll just do this. Dense astronauts upset... Upset insolent bell towers. 735 in the ringing. You ever deal with insolent bell towers? Mods gamble? Uh, I think this should be a classy loss. <laughs> nice. Love that for me. Love that for me. Okay, we'll go fish. I always love a duck. And uh, I will roll again. I will roll one more time. I will freeze you, freeze you, roll again. <laughs> you know? 
the sextuple fish? I don't mind it. That's a school. Do we win? Are you telling me we we wait? Do we win this? We're gonna we're gonna win. It? Oh, we're gonna draw. We're gonna draw. Oh no, we're gonna lose. <laughs> okay. Love that. Love that for me. Early losses don't matter. Everybody knows that. Okay, we'll do this. We'll do this, I think. I don't really know how this works anymore. I'm going to be honest. I'm a little confused. Uh, I guess I'll do this. And I'm going to end. No, I'm not going to sell the duck yet. I, we're just going to end. We're not going to combine the fishes just yet. No, trust me. I've thought about this extensively. This is genius in many ways. And by the way, by the way, we won. Okay? So. Not an early loss. And we didn't lose anything for not selling the duck. Hmm. Now I'm a bit at loss. Uh, I could go... What if we went level 3 rat, chat? What if we won with a rat? Double dog, no. No. Dodo, I'll, I'll bite. I'll bite on the dodo. Rat is trash. I've heard people say that, so let me... Assage your concerns with the rat and try to make it happen. Assage, yeah, it means calm. It's your vocab word of the day. That's not how you say it. I'm literally French. I'm just throwing it out there. I am literally French. And the rat did work. Okay, let's bring out turtle. Instantly fucking kill it. Bring out the bunny. Buy the salad. Wrap up that turn. You're 3% French. Relax. Okay, I wouldn't agree with that. Ooh, Honey Badger in the back. I'm a little nervous. Honey Badger stresses me out. If I get... I, th I think we win this pretty clean. Actually, not even... Because the honey badger helps us out. It's not even a honey badger. It's just a badger. Okay. Now, I'm considering a swan. I don't mind that, but I'm not that convinced. A uh, level 2 bunny is something I like, if I could get it. A level 2 rat is something I like, if I could get it. Let's just do this first. I can, I can get it. I can get it. This is a good start. Ooh, that's a bit tough, though. Actually, no, we end up killing it because of the dodo. Bus. Early bus with the dodo. We live! We don't kill the kangaroo by ourselves, but we're going to win this one for sure. It's actually pronounced GIF. I'm a firm GIF user. Thank you, Andors, for the one year. Thanks for the entertainment over the year. Appreciate it. Change the stream title. People are getting confused. Oh. Yeah. Good call. Mods. Okay, let's do this. Let's do this. Let's do this. Let's do... Wow. Wow. Oh, God. They're giving me so many options. Uh, wow. 
Wow, wow, wow. Let's do this. Let's do this. And let's do this. Don't actually know if I'll go Scorpion. It seems a little... Scorpion's like a late game guy. It's kind of cool to have him this early, but like, what am I getting rid of? A 2-2 deer? A 3-7 whale? Boo-hoo. Sleep, sleep. Surely we just crush. I think the rat might single-handedly thrash half their team. That's a bad badger for you. That badger's gonna kill your... I mean, this dog is looking decently buff. We might, we might, we might, uh... Oh, we're gonna barely win this. Yeah, good job, Rat. Get him. Get him, baby. That's a win. That's a win. We could try to go big scorp. We could try to go big scorp. That's a, Do you guys want to try big scorpion? The thing is, we were going big rat. So it's a little bit of a, it, like, we can't go big rat. Let's do big rat for now. Let's go big scorp later, okay? Let's, you know. Uh, I'm gonna have to sell fish, or I could just sell rabbit. Let me let me use garlic here. Let me roll here. Okay, yeah. Let me. Yeah, I'm gonna sell the fish. Turkey's not good in this comp. Sell fish, buy cow. All for you. Sell cow. And then we're just going to roll and pray that we get something good. <laughs> I mean, hedgehog enthusiasts everywhere are kind of losing their minds. We already did hedgehog. Let's move on. Let's move on from hedgehog. We can go double dodo. I believe it works like this order. We'll go double dodo. I didn't know about this until today. There's secret technique you can dodo stack. The higher attack creature will always go first. So dodo will give its power to the dodo. Who will give its power to the rat. And then the rat will go to town. Some big snipes at the beginning from this squad. Overall, not that scary of a team. And that gives us, like, the full benefit of a dodo. And now we can combine them. Wait, parrot? No, parrot doesn't work here. I'd love if it did, but it just doesn't. Kangaroo could work. Kangaroo behind. Uh, can yeah, kangaroo could work. Kangaroo could work. It's a little weak. We went kangaroo last time, so maybe let's mix it up. I could go ox. Ox is fine. If I go dodo, ox, rat, that's a pretty good combo. I think a better option is simply rolling. I wouldn't mind you being level two. I mean, we the Jaguar was pretty sick last time. I was impressed with the Jaguar. Jaguar Dodo is good comp. Good comp indeed. Yeah, I'll bite. I like Jaguar Dodo. I think it's under repped. And plus, the monkey's going to buff this rat, so eventually the dodo's going to be useless.
Oh, that was huge. That was really lucky. I mean, that was the guy's whole team. You got nothing left. Whew. Unlucky. <laughs> Unlucky. And the, and the whale killed my rat. Uh, that's funny. Okay, we can we can do this. We can do this. We can freeze this. Roll this. I want a level 3 rat. More than I want a level 3 dodo. You are astonishingly bad with animal names. This is the same exact team. Is this the same exact thing that happened last time, except this dog is slightly stronger? I think we still win this. Okay, good, good, good. Eight wins. Eight wins, eight hearts. Uh, okay, I'll do this. Roll here. Not the best case scenario. Okay, I'll, you know what? I'll keep it simple. Roll three times. Please, God. Give me that level three rat. I want it so bad. They're giving me a level three dodo. I could go level three dodo. Level three dodo would actually be pretty strong too. Do I even need to go level three dodo? Yeah, it would be like a 50 HP. Oh, just that's the worst character to kill. Actually, that was fine. Oh, another rat enthusiast. Perhaps a Ludwig viewer. Hello, extra fingers. I am you, but stronger. You need a level three rat for the achievement. Yeah, I know. I know. And I'm at nine wins. Just give me a rat. Yeah! Woohoo! All right, this, 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 this should be the win. I think we're going to win here with the rat. Level three rat squad. Uh, actually, it depends. We could lose this. Unless the jaguar hits the dog, I think we lose. I love my luck. Boy, do I love it. Still a close game, actually. But a win. Let's go! Hits the dog! And that's a rat W. You know how people have, like, crypto Twitter accounts? I keep wanting to talk about my wins that I get on Super Auto Pets off stream, but I don't want to tweet about them because I think it's annoying. So I've been thinking about making, like, a crypto Twitter where all I talk about is my Super Auto Pets wins. <laughs> I'll call it Ludwig Crypto, but it's just screenshots of my of my wins. And then you guys can sell them as NFTs. <laughs> I don't think I'll play Super Auto Pets long enough that I'll actually commit to a Twitter, but... You sell every Super Auto Pets win as an NFT. Look at that achievement, though, now. So this screen shows you every character you've gotten to level 3, and then also one with. So I've done it already with the Dodo, but now I have the Rat right here. Unlocked. I would love to do the same with a Hedgehog. I got a little unlucky because I didn't get a level 3 Hedgehog. But let's go Big Scorp. I've never gone Big Scorpion before. Disgruntled Posers. You know, like the people you see in Vegas who, like, ask you for a picture and then they say, Alright, now give me 15 fucking dollars. They get really upset. One duck? That sounds like a guy who's afraid to abandon but wants to go full duck strat.
We're going to go big Scorp. Yeah, that's the plan. If we can get it. This is a big ant. Hopefully the ant does not power up the ant. That is the worst case scenario. Literally. We had a chance before that. How are there so many noobs out there? I'll show you how. This is the player best, uh, base for Super Auto Pets over the past six months. I started playing Super Auto Pets in early November. November 3rd. The game has never had more players until today. Today is the most people who have ever attempted to play Super Auto Pets. It's like Christmas noobs for Call of Duty. There's a phenomenon because Call of Duty's always come out mid-November. Then, you know, the kids will be like, Mommy, Mommy, get me it. It's $60. I don't have a credit card. And then the parents will be like, oh, you can get it for Christmas, son. And then Christmas rolls around a month after the game's already been out. So, like, all the adults or people who, are, you know, have finances buy the game in November, play it for a month. Then the Christmas kids play it a month late, and they get thrashed. This is the same thing, but it's more like the... Um, super Auto Pet Tournament Viewer Noob. The game is planned to be released for iOS. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, you know what? They gave me Big Hedgehog. They gave me Big Hedgehog. I've never won with Level 3 Hedgehog. I'm going to try. I should have waited to roll, but I'm, I'm not going to go Dodo. We've gone Dodo every time. I think it's high time we ditch the Dodo. I'll throw a little... I don't need to throw meat on anything, actually. No, I'm fine. I'm just going to throw that duck out there. Yeah, I, I want to mix it up a bit. I don't want to go Dodo Jaguar again. A little variety is a spice. Oh, you went Hedgehog 2, Seaspy! Well, that fucked me more than it fucked you, I'll tell you what. I believe this is still going to be a draw. I will say the difference between Hedgehog in the front and Hedgehog in the back is confidence. Hedgehog in the back screams insecurity. Oh, wow. I'm dumb. I could freeze duck. I'm not obsessed with this, though. Yeah, I'll hold it here. I'll hold it here. This is uh, this is actually a good team because I'm going to kill the horse and I'm going to kill the sheep and I'm going to kill... Oh, this is actually great for me. Oh, no! It healed before I hit them! Oh, I didn't think it would work like that! Oh, that's so unfortunate. Oh, it did the flamingo buff before it did the hedgehog nerf. That is bad order. Can we, can we get a better order of operations here, please? How do I want to do this? So let's sell the duck. Freeze the fish. I'll buy the duck, sell the duck, buy the fish. I'll buy Mr. Bunny Rabbit. I'll freeze the garlic roll, and I will go... I will go garlic on the hedgehog. That's fine. Now, Alaskan bullworm is its own thing. The worm's good, but I am trying to go level 5 hedgehog. So it doesn't make sense for me. For what my goals are in life. Easy win. Level 5. Okay, I'm speaking out of my ass then. But level 3. In my dreams in the shower, when I'm walking down the street, I can still hear him juice me, squeeze me. Wait, this might have sounded funny with TTS. Why didn't that play? For some reason, it's not playing. 
It's selling you short of your funny humor. Oh, come on. Oh, baby, give me something. I'll do that. No, I don't. I don't. I want to go. Actually, you know, this is actually a... This is the Germa. This is the Germa. Uh, this is not great for me. Hello? Sorry, I had to sell 50 shares of Cloud9. Let's sell this fish. Let's go rooster. Roll it. Ooh, 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 ooh. This ant, this bunny, this ant, this bunny, this ant, this bunny. And hippo. Hmm. Hmm. Whoa, 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 whoa. I have too many options here. I have too many options. Hedgehog is not the same. I'll freeze the pill. I'll sell the rabbit. I'll buy the snail. And then I'll probably call it a turn there. I'm going to freeze the monkey too. No, I'm not going to pill the hedgehog. You devious sons of bitches. Oh, keep it up. Wait, this is pretty good. I think we lose this. No, we should. We should. Uh, we should draw here. No, we lose this for sure. No, no, we should draw this. We're drawing too much. We're drawing too much because I'm trying to find a way to get my team comp to mesh together, but I don't think we're getting there. It's not lining up as well as I I would have hoped. I still have a snail. Okay. All right, we're we're getting there a bit. Uh, this is a big turtle. Oh, we kill. You know, we win this one. There's uh, there's there's uh, there's there's hope. There's hope. Turtle's an odd choice. Well, Turtle's actually really symbiotic with Hedgehog. Because um, the Turtle, if it dies, just gives someone Melon Armor. Rather than losing Melon Armor. Oh, there it is! <gasps> At last. My love for you. <sighs> Do I sell Swan now? I should have gone. That was a bad order of operations. Nobody's impressed by my order of operations here. I have, a, I have a genius strategy next turn. Rooster in front, no shot. This is, trust me, a genius strategy. 
I mean, if our... <laughs> this guy might just win outright. Because then you do melon on the chick at the end. Oh, baby. Oh, baby. Okay, hold up. Hold up. Hold up. Hold up. Hold up. Let's do this. Sell you. Let's buy you. Bing, bang. Actually, bing. I should do it on here. I should do it on this guy. I should do it on the... I should buff the rooster. Roll one. Monkey. Uh, you know what? I'm going to go croc. I'm going to go legendary crocodile for now. I'll freeze a pill. I'm going to freeze a pill for this turtle. I'm going to try this crocodile. Because this is going to do a shit ton of damage to whoever's in the back. Which is oftentimes, like now, their best unit. Okay, double crocodile. Let's see how this works out. It's a win! Let's go! <sighs> okay, let's... Let's do this. Hmm. Pill the turtle now. Freeze, monkey. Melon, roll. Steak, roll. I think I regret peeling my turtle. We'll see. Wow, what a beastly squad. Oh, this is actually so good for me though. Uh no, it's not. Cuz he's not going to he's not powerful enough. I'm literally just going to chew through most of the units here. This will be interesting. I actually don't know how this ends up. What a big dog. All right, we kill the chick. We almost kill the shark. I believe this is a win. Oh, let's go. Okay. Honestly, the uh, the crocodile was kind of clutch there. Hmm. Okay, let's do one of these. Sushi, I don't mind. I don't love. I'll I'll unfreeze it. We got the level three hog. You know what I'm considering is going tiger on the rooster, but the tiger will just die. So probably not. I could go snake behind hog with the tiger. But we're kind of trying to go scorched earth policy. Like, I could sell...
Okay, this is tough. I think I think we came here with a mission. And it was to use Tiger Hedgehog in fucking Crush. That was our goal, right? That's what we came in here to do. That was a dream of ours since we were young boys. Tiger Snake, it's tried, it's true. People know about Tiger Snake. We've seen Tiger Snake. Tiger Snake's very effective. But we've seen it. It's not that special. I could go... Tiger Rooster. Because the Tiger will take 12 HP of damage. And then it will live with 1 HP and then spawn 2 chicks. I don't know how this is going to turn out. Snake machine gun, it's it's a we've seen it. There's nothing special about it. Oh, this is such a cringe team. This team is cringe tacular. Oh god. Oh god. Oh, no! 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 <sighs> we have one heart left. There's no way to go triple tiger chat. It's not a thing. It doesn't exist, chat. It doesn't exist. It doesn't it doesn't exist. Okay. I want to win with the Hedgehog. And this is the best strat to do it. I mean, that looked great. That was like the that was the dream situation to run into right there. <sighs> Three more wins. Stop trying to force feed me tigers. For the love of God. Yeah. But now Tiger the Hedgehog means I have to get rid of this snake. Stop giving me tigers. I could go dolphin, I guess.
I think it doesn't work right now. I think we have to do it like this. I think we very simply need to do this because we are stuck with the snake. Because now the mushroom will allow the snake to attack again. It just doesn't, it doesn't work out. I tried the math. It doesn't add up. Oh, that sucks though. Oh boy, that sucks. <laughs> okay. Nice. We kill the snake. I mean, that worked really well. The mushroom is going to be a bit of a pain in the ass. Oh, do we lose this? Okay, okay. That's fine. That's fine. We're still in it. I could get a level two snake. Oh, but I'm one penny short. Maybe I sell this tiger right here. I did what I had to do for my family. I did what I had to do for my family. Four squad Marty for the win, baby. Holy shit, that's a big bus. We get two hits in. Nice. Snake is dead. Nice. Turkey's dead. Big team hits. Hedgehog's back. Woo! Okay. <laughs> what? That did 54? How did that do 54? Four squad Marty for the win. Okay, melon on the tiger is probably more sensical than melon on the snake. Let's do one of these. Bing, bang. Roll. I mean, I could just go mammoth. I could also go snake behind my rooster. Or I could go crocodile. I think snake behind the rooster makes a little more sense, though. This is such an insane team comp. I have never tried. Jerma's a genius. <sighs> okay. All right. Another whale turkey team. It's a level five, though. That's really good for us. That's a big fucking turkey, though. Turkey's dead? This is going to be huge damage. Such a godlike squad, man. This is such a godlike squad. One win away. Oh god, one win away. I think my strategy should be cupcake. Roll. Melon.
I think I melon this snake and I one up this snake in case. All right, boys. For the level three hedgehog win, this is everything. For Germa, baby. Come on. Give it to me. Give me the W, please. That's a big fucking buffalo. That's a big buffalo. Oh, no. That's a big fucking buffalo. But we're going to kill the turkey with our hedgehog. And tiger. Buffalo dies. Bus dies. Wait, no, did we do it? The one up mushroom! Let's go! No way! That's such a beautiful team, man. The one up mushroom snake. Oh, God. That was the greatest final game. Oh, hey, DJ McSwinky, you put on a hell of a show. The Delicious Housewives? I would tune into that podcast. <sighs> My God. That was such a good win, chat. I got to screenshot this one. Yeah, hey, hey, sometimes, sometimes you should toot your own horn. This might be my most proud win ever. Whoo, with the hedgehog too. Wait, did I, have I won three in a row? Tweet it. As long as you guys all like and reply to the tweet, you know, hey, man, I, I'll tweet it. You know what? I'll do the, I'll do a classy tweet. I'll just at Germa. A classic at tweet. That's the Schlatt special. Oh, baby. Have we, chat, have we won three in a row? Do I need to, I feel like I shouldn't, I shouldn't quit on a win, man. You, you don't quit on a W. Putting it on open seas. Bidding starts at three Ethereum. That's the floor for this one. <sighs> Let me see that check mark. Hedgehog check mark. Oh, that feels good, man. That was probably the coolest team I've ever rocked. I can safely say that. But I wouldn't mind now trying to win with um, a big scorp. I've never done Big Scorp. I think Big Scorp is cool. I want to try it out. Um, salty soup. I like my soup a bit salty. Alaskan bollworm. That's, I mean, that's, you know, we've been, been there, done that. We've seen that. All right, a little bit of a trade. I think this is going to be a draw. If my math adds up in my head quick enough. Almost a win. Damn near. Big Scorp weakness is still small Scorp. Yeah, you're right about that. See a duck, buy a duck. Honey pot? Mm, I don't really love a honey pot. Uh, I'll sell duck and I'll buy fish. That seems fine. Thanks, Joe Bobby. 
Appreciate you. You were here, baby. Okay, that was sad for me. This is actually fine. I damn near am confident enough to say we win this. Germa retweeted my tweet. Germa RT secured, boys. Okay. I'll combine the ants. I'll buy the fish. I'll save a pill. I'll roll. I'll sell this guy. We've already done Big Rat. I've never done Big Elephant, but it doesn't tickle me that much. For now, I'm going to do this. You don't have a big fish win? I do, I do. Uh, maybe not on stream, but I've definitely won. I think I've won a pig fish before. Did we ever do the Halloween costume stream in a shocking display that no one is surprised by? I did not connect my Amazon card correctly. And thus, I was unable to actually make the purchase. Uh, so I never, ever bought it. I've never gone big ox either. Huh. I need a scorpion somewhere. Saikuno on mogul money. Imagine. That'd be crazy. <laughs> Who knows? It's not like Saikuno would leak any information. And I know Ray wouldn't leak, especially after how she, you know, has had information leaked to her before. So... I wouldn't mind going here. I'm not obsessed with level 2 ant. Turtle, turtle, turtle's all right. Turtle's all right. I'm not I I'm good without turtle. I'll shoot this. Sheep in front of ox is goaded. It's all right. I wouldn't call it goaded. It's it's a it's a winning strategy. It's not goaded. Fuck you. That's... I think this is a loss. Yeah. Hedgehog with honey in the back. I like that. Okay, let's roll. Honey Badger, I like. I don't obsess over. Whale, I like. I don't freak out over. But for now, I don't mind doing this. And this. And this. And this. And this. And this? We got an early worm. But I'm trying to go big, big. It's going to be hard to get this. In a move everyone's surprised by, level three fish, goodbye. Yes. Even though it was level 3 in my strongest warrior, this allows me to um, scale my team. And I still think I win, to be honest. Because I get two ants 
I have a big ass whale. The ox is going to get pretty buffed from this. I'm pretty sure this is a win. Unfreeze the ant. I'm kind of looking for a level three. I'm 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 fiending for a level three ant. But you know, I'll, I'll cap it at level two. It's not like I'm gonna roll and get an ant right now anyway. Ooh, I could go bus. Whale deer is a classic. How does parrot work with ox? I guess it works exactly like you would think it does. Parrot on the whale and it just swallows the whale? That sounds stupid. <laughs> sounds really dumb. Parrot Swan doesn't work. No way. Try it? Sure. Fuck it. Let's see how this works. And the ant comes out immediately? Okay. And now what happens? The whale comes out? Okay. This seems to be only buffing this kangaroo tremendously. I think, by the way, against all odds, we still win. <laughs> that was terrible? But we still won. Uh, I'm not obsessed over that. I'll tell you what. No. Ant again. No thank you. No thank you. Ox, please. Monkey sees. Monkey doos. I would like to freeze this. Kangaroo behind the ox is viable. I should probably just do this. We did our parrot turn. We don't need to do it again. Wait, penguin? I just ignored some animals that I don't know. I just kind of ignored penguin. I am going whale. I'm not a whale believer, but I am going whale just for now. This is a brief whale session. I'm going to soon pivot off whale. Okay, that's a big kangaroo. Let's go. All right. Tier 2 whale with spider and lost. I think your bigger problem is the spider. Kind of have to go deer if you're going like that. Uh, okay, let's do this. Oh, I love that. I'll bring out the deer. I'll roll. Freeze the cow. Roll. Roll. Freeze the cow. Roll. 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 Okay. The plan is Big Scorp. It's always been Big Scorp. 
So I'm saving up the cows to find a scorpion. Garlic the ox doesn't make sense. Because the ox turns into melon armor. So I, there's no reason to do that. But I also think we can just win straight up. I'm a little nervous about that that sweet, sweet honey badger in the back. I'm a little nervous about him. But I, I think we win this pretty handily. Handedly? Is it handedly or handily? I don't even know. Yeah, we win this. Level 3 cow. Should we try to win with a level 3 cow? That's so stupid, chat. That's so stupid. That's genuinely so stupid. <laughs> uh, How do I even get... Okay, let's do this. Does this work? It does. <laughs> uh, fly is actually pretty good in this squad. But I do I really want to become a dirty fly user? A dirty, filthy, stinky fly user? I mean, I guess, is anyone really going to judge me being a fly user? If I'm going triple cow. Like, do you really have the room to be like, oh, that's so lame. <laughs> uh, I, th I think we can't go big scorp anymore, unfortunately. Fly's lame, but I'm going level three cow. We're, we, I think it's this is not a scorp win. Is it wrong to not tell you? What the fuck was even that about? <laughs> Come on! The whole point was he's supposed to live, you dick. I think we still end up losing by one HP. All right, we have one life left. Shit. 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 I don't even think you fit in the squad, man. I'm not going to lie. Tiger fly. No, we can't go tiger fly because I need to go cow. I'm not selling the cow. We're going level three cow chat. The cow stays or I walk. Oh, that's so unlucky. Fuck. What is up with every crocodile Andy? Jeez. Hold up. What's the math here? I think we lose this chat. I think it's game over for us. By 2 HP. <sighs> that is so unlucky. I, 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 I should have swapped cow. I should have put the cow in the back. Okay, let's go big scorp for real now. Hey, let's quit mess. Let's quit hoot and hollering. Pig, really? I mean, this is, <laughs> this is the worst squad of all time. What am I doing? This is such a bad squad. The rude ice cubes. We're gonna get rocked. <laughs> We're so fucking owned. Okay. That's okay. I don't mind losing early. I don't mind losing early. Triple. Quadruple. Fish. Fuck you. Wait, wait, wait to give it to the fish. Yeah, give it all to the fish. Okay, almost. I mean, that's going to win. Four ants, that gets the job done. Okay. 
You go bing, bang, boom, bop, skadooble, schlip schlip. This is a easy win. When can you unlock Scorpion Chat? Do you know? Don't give it to the elephant. Cuts me deep. Cuts me deep, it does. Yeah, that works. We probably went with four here. Ooh, that is a fearsome squad. This is really just going to be so good for my kangaroo. Oh, I forgot the kangaroo in the elephant. Oh, I forgot about. Oh, hey. <laughs> Boy, did I forget how this guy works. Yep, I forgot. That's why the elephant's bad. I knew the elephant was bad. Forgot. You know what? We can fast forward this cutscene. Congratulations on having a level 2 and a level 1 horse. Uh, okay. Freeze this. Roll this. Stop trying to make Hedgehog happen. I mean, fuck it. Do I really want to go camel? No. Camel's a temporary thing. What do you mean switch elephant? This is the perfect order. Let's go! Three wins. Not bad. Sorry, did someone say when Scorpion unlocks? Do we know this? Is this information gatherable? Scorp is tier 5. I see. I'll do that for now. That is unfortunate, the amount of HP you had. Okay, this is a big kangaroo. Should be able to take care of one, two, three. Easy. It's tier five units. Okay, so whenever it says tier five units unlocked. So I'm at tier four right now. Noted. I mean, stop trying to make this camel happen. Hippo's interesting to me. But I'm alright, I'm alright. I'm gonna switch off this squad. This squad is a very temporary thing. I don't care too much about it. I know I rolled past a Rue. I don't think I'm going level 3. Oh, if I combine one now, I get tier 5. I see. Oh, that's a big kangaroo. Oh, I think we lose this one. Jesus. What the goddamn... Okay, that's fine. Still have two lives. Hmm, no. Let's... Oh, 
Oh shit. Oh shit. Good pivot. Good pivot. It's a good pivot. I've never actually won with a level 3 hippo. I know hippos are good, though. What the hell? Damn it. That sucked. What the hell is up with crocodile meta? Every one of their ants is using crocodile these days. You still lose because I have a honey. Get owned. Nice job killing him. I wouldn't mind doing this, doing this, doing this, doing this, doing this, doing this, doing this. I kind of like dolphin. Order? No, nah, this is the right order. Wow, good snipe. Oh, fuck. God damn it. Everybody's running crocodile these days. And puffer fish? What a fat puffy. Jeez. I got kind of rocked by a puffer fish. I'm not doing well. In fact, I'm doing a little poorly. Should probably throw garlic armor on you. I should probably throw a pear on you. And I'll save the chocolate. Roll. Roll. There's a scorpion. There's... Okay. Okay. <sighs> Big scorp can happen. Big scorp can happen. We just need to live. And this is a good squad to go up against. This is our squad, but IMO a bit weaker. Damn, that whale survived. We killed through Melon Armor. Nice. We almost killed through Melon Armor, but we don't. And Kangaroo solos. Good, good, good. Shilada. Okay, sell you. Sell you. Hello, level two hippo. Hello, Scorpion. Cow time. So, it's going to take a little bit. I still think we use Dodo on Kangaroo for now because we need wins. Dodo on Hippo doesn't help my Kangaroo. Dodo on Hippo's good, but my Kangaroo needs... Uh, if I, Because then it would be Kangaroo, Dodo, Hippo. My Kangaroo would get, would get owned. This, are, this works out great for us, though. That's not the best case scenario, though. Oh, no. Oh, no. Fuck! Oh. Okay, I can make Big Scorp happen. I can make Big Scorp happen. I can make Big Scorp happen. I can make Big Scorp creamy nuts. Creamy nuts. We can do Big Scorp. We can do Big Scorp. Big Scorp, keep on turning. We win this one. A round one W is pretty big. You know what the problem is? By the time we get to a scorpion, we have too many losses, and we're trying to pivot into a very difficult build. I just need to go with, like, a cheesy early build that just gets Ws. Like this. That's a perfect cheesy early build. Duck trades with Ant. Love that. That should have traded. We got kind of owned. That's such a big duck. Holy shit, how are we losing? 
to draw. You can't duck strat to Scorp because you'd have to hold ducks for like 10 rounds. Uh, we can sell duck because peacock is decent. And then if we do this, it's actually pretty powerful. Giraffe. Giraffe. No, we're we're just, we're just gonna go peacock. I think the peacock can get us two tier five, and then we can win. Elephant cock, elephant cock is good, but for now we don't need it. Look, I'm all with you boys. Elephant cock's great. We do not need it. Alright, zero deaths. We just gotta keep up the zero death streak. I'll pill you. I don't mind that. I'll do this. I'll roll you. I'll roll you. Freeze that, roll you. Oh, uh, you know, I'll I'll bite. I'll bite. Oh, this is this is great. This is the best case scenario. A honey pot against a peacock. Whoo! Okay. Creamy nuts is a good name. Better yet, we're doing well. Okay, roll. Nothing here for us. Level two. Garlic on that dude. This guy don't make sense. This doesn't make sense. Giraffe. We need to get to tier five. We need to get to tier five, baby. Honey Badger will help us get there. Okay. Now that's a good peacock. Spider-Man trailer? Did it come out? I thought the movie got leaked. I heard that somewhere. Unless this is some, like, TMZ news. No, 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 no. Get out of here. Get out of here. Level 3 Peacock, I've never even thought to do. Trail looks good. I'll take a peek at it. Guys, are you telling me I should get hype on Marvel movies? I more or less gave up on Marvel movies after the end of the uh, the last Marvel. Oh, we try, we draw this one. Look at that. At the end of Endgame, I was like, ah, I'm all right. You know, I feel like I watched 12 movies, paid eighty dollars for this experience. It was, it was all right. I didn't, I did, I'm not, I don't regret it. I won't say that. I'm not head over heels. I'm not absolutely losing my shit. It was alright, though. Level 3 Peacock, by the way. Pretty impressive. I have left almost every Marvel movie going, you know, that hey, that was, that was worth my time. Uh, but I will never, ever watch this again. That's how I leave most Marvel movies. We're going to lose this one, by the way. Narrowly lose it. I like Marvel, but I also like watching you play Pokemon. I don't know what the implication is there. What do you mean? What do you mean? <laughs> uh... 
do I? How do I play this? I'm just sick of this shitty elephant. I want to sell them, but it's like, what for? I don't know, man. I uh, Elephant and giraffe and skunk can all go. And honey badger and peacock. In fact, there's not a single human on my team that I'm like, oh yeah, he should stick around. All right, we win this one. Five wins, one loss, human. You're telling me I misspoke? You're telling me I said a word wrong. Isn't Scorpion in here now? Where are you? Where are you, you son of a bitch? Show your fucking face. Where are you? I need to find the damn scorp. All right, we crushed this team. Holy shit. You guys, you don't even get to see my giraffe. Okay, never mind. You don't have to see my monkey. Six wins. Six wins is easy, though. Give me scorpion. Give me scorpion. Let me see it. Come on. Tiger. Okay, if I tiger the skunk, what happens? Does anybody know? Let's find out. I just need a fucking scorpion. This is crazy. I've never struggled this hard ever. It does 266% drops? No. Oh shit! That's crazy. This would be better with like a hippo. Okay, I need a scorp. I, you know what, Chad? I don't think we're going to find a Scorpion. I've never won with Peacock, so I shouldn't be too upset here. Sykuno Raid! Hello, Saikuno enthusiasts. Welcome back. Welcome, or I guess not back. Welcome to. Welcome to Z Stream. Oh my god. Saikuno streams kind of go hard, huh? This is probably worth. We'll go with the old four squad, Marty. How's it going, guys? Isn't Saikuno kind of goaded at this game? Oh, we're going to lose so bad. Damn it, Turkey. 
Why remove the garlic? Because it only saves 2 HP. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. Okay, let's do this. Oh no, hold up, hold up, hold the phone. Let's do this. Let's do this. Let's do this. Sorry, I'm deep in focus. I'm deep in focus. I would love to enjoy the... Raid. <sighs> Shit. Shit. What do I do? What do I do? Triple rooster. I know, I know, but I don't want to go triple rooster. Oh, God. Oh, God. I'm choking. I'm choking the bag here. I'm literally just choking the bag here. I need a snake, really. We're trying to win with creative team composition. So, for now, the team comp I have tried out is... Um... Oh, we won that one. We won a bit earlier with a cool team. I won with a legendary level 3 hedgehog with snake and tiger. So when the hedgehog dies, it does 6 damage to everyone. And then it comes back as a mushroom and then does 6 damage to everyone. It was cool and pog champ. And I was trying to get... I've been trying, I should say. I've been trying to get a win. I should get you. I've been trying to get a win with a big scorpion, but I literally have not seen a scorpion all game. Not one single scorpion. Crocodile is pretty good because we have a skunk that does 66% of health. Oh, we're going to get rocked right here, chat. Oh, chat, we lose this one. Oh, we killed the tiger, though. Wait, there's a chance we win this. Oh, no. All right, we only have one health. That's all I got. That's all I got. I don't want to use the peacock. I just kind of ended up... Oh, no. That's so unlucky. Wait! That'll kill, actually. Woo! Okay. Okay. We have one heart, and we're one win away. There's no point in freezing a snail, because if I lost, it would have been over. That was kind of stupid of me. <laughs> Dolphin for the snipe. Aw, oh, shit. <laughs> I should have waited! There was a snake. Oh, dude. That would have been so big. Okay. All right, whatever. Let's see it. Uh, is this team good enough to win? Please don't have a big, strong unit in the front. Okay, that's actually good. This is actually a super winnable team. Okay, you killed my... Goddamn. Oh, no, you killed my tiger. It's okay. Actually, that's right. I kill your cat. I almost kill your monkey. Oh, we, we, we lose. Oh, we lose. Wait. It's a draw. Oh. One health, one went away. Oh, God. I don't even think cow makes sense here.
Maybe I should go snake behind the peacock. Sell the dolphin. I should try to find a skunk. Let's yo oh level two crocodile. Level two crocodile or try to find a skunk. Oh, that is a level three. Oh, thank God you guys are here. I'm dumb. Okay, so the way this works now, the skunk is going to do 99% of health to two guys. Then my crocodile does seven damage to the person in the back, and then my dolphin does five damage to someone else. So let's see if this can help us win. Wait, please hit him. Snipe the... Wait, no, because we have splash damage that kills him! I don't know if we win though, chat. I don't know if we win though. We're going up against a summon build. Oh, that's so cringe. I don't think it's enough. It's not enough. Dude, no! No! Why are you That was so cool to an epic win. <sighs> A level three skunk. I've never. I wonder if I would have won if I had gone snake. Or if I would have gone level two crocodile even. Okay, I still have aspirations. Hopes and dreams. A love of the game. Flopping buttocks. Oh, please go to the ant. Thank you very much. Easy win. Easy win. Why is the sub anniversary notification so annoying? Because it wants you to share your subscription with me. Everyone who has a sub notification right now, stop letting it just sit there and please just use your sub notification right now, smiley face. If you got a sub notification, use it. Oh my god. Dude, that's crazy. What the heck? How many of you were just holding on to sub notifications? No, this is not subbing. This is literally not even people who are subbing. These are people who were subbed who are just finally using their notification. Hold up. If you got a sub notification, use it right now. If you got it, use it. If you got it, use it. Oh my god. Dude, that's crazy. That's crazy. Chat, why do you guys keep your sub notice for so long? 
if you don't know, the sub notif is basically like right here. I'm subbed to Soda for 10 months. And every time I open a stream, it says, let him know. And so I have to like click the sub thing, then hit enter, and then I sub. And then he has an auto pop-up that says, thanks for subbing. Maybe he'll say thank you to me. I haven't done my pet research. Thank you, Shroob Queen. Loga Hauntis. Is that like Pocahontas, but your name is Logan? Logan, if you're white, I'm just going to let you know right now. That's so, you know, we're getting a little edgy there, Logan. Perhaps a little edgy if you're just a white man. I'm the Loga Hauntis of white men in high school. I'm not saying cancel Logan, but I'm just saying let's stop his streaming career before it starts there. Thank you, Fun Purple Gnome, Ethan, Dark Jado, Oscarigm. Thank you, thank you, thank you. All right. I do this, I do that. Give me a little bit of this, a little bit of that, a little bit of this, a little bit of that. Yes, yes. Do you think Logahontas actually paid? <laughs> okay, now we're getting deep into lore about Pocahontas. Kyle's Wash, thank you the Prime. Vept, E. Chung gifted five subs for no reason. Thank you for that, E. Chung. You didn't need to do that, though. That was very kind. Appreciate you. Kid Ants, thank you for the sub. Mega Prawn, thank you for the, the, the one year. thousand percent hype train yeah that is pretty high all i look for chat is primers all right I, I don't want you know i feel bad when people use their hard-earned dollar right now i have um 30 no twenty-eight thousand subs three thousand are gifted which is a lot of money man that's like fifteen thousand dollars that people have spent on just gifting me you know that's crazy and then uh ooh, ooh. Ooh, ooh, oh yeah, you know, I'll, uh, yeah, no, uh, yeah, I'll bite. Chipotle has gifted the 1800 subs. It's, if you see right now, a man known as Tips gifted me. That's, that's who that is. That's Chipotle. Tips is the head of, um, I don't know what the head, I don't know what the word is. He works at OTK. He does all the nerdy shit that no one else at OTK wants to do. Thank you, Cubox, for the prime. Cowboy Bacon, thank you for the sub. He's like, yeah, I guess he's like my slime, but he's for the entire organization, which is a little different. Okay, I wouldn't mind a little bit of garlic on the swan. That sounds interesting. I'm going to make what's called a mogul move here. Unfreeze you, unfreeze you, roll you. Roll you. This one's for the boys back home. We're going whale hog. Whale hog is legendary. Because watch this chat. Because, okay, hold up. I have to break, I have to do a breakdown. When a hedgehog dies, it does two damage to everyone on the field, including yourself. It's going to hit the deer and the cricket, which means only one of them can spawn a summon. Just kidding, I did my math wrong. They can both spawn a summon. But you know, it was still cool in Pog Champ. It's a bit of a debate. But now, it's going to kill the horse in the back and the cricket. So all I have to do is kill the dog and the bus and I win. Okay. 
You know what? It turns out it was a bit dumb. Because apparently every time I do damage to him, I do damage to myself. Do I have merch coming out soon? No. I have merch coming out. Okay, I don't know why I said no. I do have merch coming out very soon. I, I, when I started the sentence, I was like, oh, I'm going to make a tricky joke. And I'm going to say no. I have merch coming out very soon. But that doesn't make any sense. That's just a stupid thing to say out loud. So I'm sorry for baiting you. One, two, yes. Do I have a bidet coming soon? Soon's not the word I would say. It's not coming 2021. I have merch coming 2021. Oh, this is going to kill the hedgehog? Which is going to hit the dog? Oh, this is epic. This is an epic gamer moment. Hits the hedgehog, which then hits the dog for five, which leaves the dog at one HP. Or three HP because that's garlic armor. Fair enough. Man, this is this is all Pog and Champ today. Merch sneak peek when? Yeah, you know, it'll come. It's not going to... I think the way it's going to end up stretching out is that the merch won't come. You know, why is the peacock not right in front of the whale? Has nobody noticed how dumb I've been? Petrifyingly stupid in a way. I should likely go bison. I still want to keep this hedgehog strat going because I think it's kind of funny. Guys, can you really call me a bison berry with how varied I've been today? I have won with so many epic, cool people, and you guys are calling me bison berry. Your words hurt, and I need you to know that. Monkey doesn't make sense. I'm not a hedge... Okay, you know what? I'm actually down to be a hedgehog Harry. I'm flattered if you guys think I'm a hedgehog Harry. Jesus. That was the best person you could have hit because now my peacock gets an upgrade. Sheesh. I hit the chick. Hit the whale. Get you. Peacock gets a buff from that. Easy win. I'm going to die to this guy. Oh, you have two chicks? Oh, is this going to be a draw? Yeah, it is. No, it's a loss! <gasps> Dang, first loss. I'm so interested in going dolphin. But I would have to get rid of Peacock to make that happen. Which I'm a little less secure in doing. Because right now, Peacock is my best character. No, I need the fish for Barry Bison. I'm just going to do the thing where you roll. And then the decision is made for you because you're out of turns. That was a little unfortunate. That that dolphin kind of sniped me there and fucked my shit up. Fucked my shit up. Okay, let's sell you. Let's bring out the dolphin. Bring out the dancing lobsters. Oh, fuck. Oh, you shouldn't have. I find no joy or love in a fly. Cross my heart and hope to die if I ever if I ever go on stream and use a fly. <laughs> Stop trying to make lobsters happen. Get owned sheep and now you can't spawn both of your sheep? Oh, get owned. Absolutely thrashed. Oh, and your second ram is gone? Get owned. 
Oh, and your dodo dies? Oh, and my fish dies? Uh-oh. <laughs> Wait, are we going to lose this? I think we're going to lose this, Chad. Damn, that's a big-ass fucking homie there. We're getting there, though. We're getting there. We're getting there. Okay, we got we got to do a, a little bit of this. A little bit of that. A little bit of this. A little bit of that. A little bit of this. A little bit of that. A little bit of this. A little bit of that. Okay, we're going epically huge hedgehog here. Let's see how this pans out. I can't imagine that this is not just incredibly stupid. But who knows? Who knows? It's a draw. It's a draw, baby. Okay. You know what I hate? This fucking fish on my squad. Me likey snake. Here's my epic gamer plan. Ready? Roll one. Roll again. Roll one more time. Okay, you guys found me out. I had zero plan. I was just kind of hoping it would all work out. <clears throat> nice! We killed the fly! That's huge! Wait, this actually is so good because then the... <gasps> Yo, we directly counter this team so well. Oh, we just win. This is a hard counter. Fucking roll that team. Hedgehog is sick, but we are quite a few wins away. So let's do this. Let's do this. Let's do this. Let's melon. Now we should do this. We need this bison to get buffer. Wait. Nice. Thank God we killed the crab before the action happened. Okay, that that was kind of lucky. We're this is still a really tough battle to win. Wait, we're gonna kill our own team. Wait, chat, we're gonna lose. We're gonna lose so hard here. Oh god, dude, oh. we're literally just buffing this crab. Damn it. Doesn't matter. Still got the believers paid out. Let's go. Vague clean hats. I do like clean hats. My goal is just to go big scorp. That's what I've been trying to do. Unfortunately, I have not had the opportunity. And, um, and this is going to start with a win. I all oh, never mind by a win, by the way. That was a lie. All right, let's go double you. No, let's go you here. I'll sell. I'll do this. I'll do this. And.
That was actually a secret five head play. Jesus. What a good squad. What the hell? Do we win this? And we still win? My God. Big Scorp is tricky. Encourage a scaling build with poodles and penguins. All right. See a poodle, buy a poodle. Yeah, I'll bite. No, I, I don't fuck with crabs. Big crab doesn't get anybody... Ex nobody's excited about big crab. Are you kidding me? Oh, poodles pay to win. Yeah, that's a good point. This is looking like a possible win here. Big crab, nothing gets me softer. I don't want to go big crab. I will consider going a level above in the fish. Yeah, that's interesting to me. Uh-huh. Uh, you know what? I'm a hedgehog herald. I'll be the first to admit it. I like hedgehog. I like Hedgehog. I think it's a cute build. It's fun. What a weird ass badger. If I lose to a guy who goes middle badger, I'm embarrassed. I'm embarrassed. Oh, thank God. Hedgehog is bad. I agree. But it is fun. And things that are fun cannot be bad. Because if you're having a good time, then that's all that matters. I'll do that. That's a little better. Was there a hedgehog there in a puffer fish that I missed? Did I miss a puffer fish? Did I just not even see it? Dude, this is gonna fuck me up so bad. <laughs> oh god. Oh jeez. Okay. I'll do this. I'll do that. I'll do this. No shot. Yeah, I'll take a level two. I wouldn't mind a deer. Where does a deer fit in, though? Probably pill the ant. Why not hedgehog in the back? Because hedgehog hits everybody on the team. So if you put the hedgehog in the back, you're basically saying, I am playing for a draw, and I don't play for level three horse? Dude, come on. I mean, this actually isn't that bad. I mean, my kangaroo's big time. You okay, level... You know what? If, if you got a level 3 horse and you're still getting rolled by my first two units... I'm with Northern Lion. Holy shit. Uh, 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 okay. I'm going to sell this. I like dolphin. I'm going to do this. <gasps> At last, my love for you. Okay. How do I, how do I functionally add this guy to the squad?
I put an ant in the back. Did you guys see that? Did you guys see me put an ant in the back? Do you know why I did that? Because I'm so confident I'll win. It was not an accident. It was actually a genius play. I'm so I'm um, that's how and that's how nuts I am chat I'll do shit like I'm crazy like that I'll put him in the back because it's like I don't even need the ant let him sit back there the opponent's gonna be like oh I'm playing an idiot and then they're gonna lose and they're gonna be like wait maybe I'm the idiot oh yeah that was so lucky That's exactly what I needed. That was genuinely the best possible thing I could have gotten. Oh, baby. Monkey. Oh, let's go. I skipped a kangaroo. I probably should have got that. That's true. Oh, did you have a big camel you were planning on using to buff your squad? What an L. Are you still possibly going to beat me because your squad's fucking stacked? No, you're not, because I have a better monkey. Dang, it feels good to have a good monkey. Six wins without losing one. And I think it's time for Big Scorp. Who do, do I want to use anyone here? Crocodile doesn't... It tickles me a little. Squirrel's mid. <sighs> Seal's good. I could buy that the seal is an epic win. Just because I should be buying food. It's just a kind of a worse bunny though. Oh, that's... Oh, wait. Please hit him. Please hit the bunny. Please hit him. Dolphin, you missed by an inch. Ugh. All right. All right. This is the squad's going to beat us. The squad's going to beat us. But this is the type of squad we will end up beating with enough time. For now, we got fucking rolled. That's alright, it's our first loss. Okay, I'll do this. Are you serious? That didn't just happen to me. I'm not throwing, because look. I kill him. Swan's dead from Dolphin. I kill him. I live. Big Scorp, kill him. I live. Kill him. I live. Melon armor kind of fucks me, actually. I think we end up losing this because of Melon armor. You know what? We were fucking close, though, too. It's all right. It's all right. We still get two losses. We still have two losses. Everybody relax. Everybody relax. I'll do it. Okay, this is, this is, this is working. This is working. What does the seal do? Uh, oh, you shit. Yes! Woo! Yeah! I am a better gamer.
<laughs> Holy shit. Uh, a level two cat, does it do something insane, chat? Does it do what I think it should do? For once in your goddamn life, hit the monkey or the scorpion. We're going to do a uh, tiger cat doesn't work. We're going to do tiger um, dolphin. Tiger cat does not work. Tiger only works in game. Cat, or, 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 excuse me. Tiger works in game. Cat works out of game. They are not symbiotic chat. Uh, this is a scary squad. We're going to kill the rooster. But this is a scary squad. And it's a level fucking huge. We're going to lose this one for sure. All right, we're actually not that far off from winning this. Okay. Let's go sell you. Tiger in front. Roll. Pizza big time. Hmm. Because Tiger the Cat, once again, does not work. Just to be very clear, Tiger Cat doesn't work. You guys are saying it a lot. It's not how it works. <sighs> really? That's unlucky. Let's throw down a melon. Okay, this is actually a very winnable game. Because we're going to kill the ti- Look at that. <gasps> that was so clutch. Yo. Yo, we destroyed that team. We killed the crab before it could uh, absorb the ability. And we killed the snake. So the whole squad just fell apart. Instantly melted. Um, No, that's lame. Pizza, yes. Thank you. Chocolate. We can't get level two monkey this turn. Probably just do this. I don't know how this works. I, my, my brain can't comprehend this. I think it's going to be too late. Uh, I don't know. This is crazy. Fuck yeah. One win away. The problem here, chat, is it's the final level. I can get a I can get a level three cat just so I win with one. Just for the achievement. But I would not functionally be able to even use this creature. So it's kind of a throw. But it'll be very epic if I win this. Unless it's a draw. Yeah, you're right. It's possible to draw. 
Come on, please, please don't lose this, Ludwig. Oh, you killed the snake. I can't tell. I can't do the math that quick, chat. We kill this ox. The cat kills the dodo. The bison. It's a win. Let's go! We won with Big Scorp level 3 cat. Level 3 cat is such a meme. I've never seen a bigger meme in my life than level 3 cat. That I never get to use, by the way. I've never got to use this in my life. All right, chat, we're going to do one more, and then I'm going to wrap up. Because I'll never end on a law or win. I'm still live. How you feeling? Bad? Yeah. Bad news, burgers? Bad news, What's going on, brother? Well, I had to do Twitch Rivals. Oh, yeah? How'd that go? Lost every game. Okay. Oh, fair enough. That sucks. Slippery feet. Uh, yeah, I'm wrapping up after. Nah. No, I've been lying like seven and a half hours. So I'll probably wrap up on the next uh, loss. Does this say beautiful tie? Yes, it is. Next time I lose, which doesn't happen often. Pfft, I'm a bit of a fiend in these streets right now. This is so weird. Uh, <laughs> that was so weird. I didn't know what else to do, man. I panicked. Oh, we crushed this team. Double horse. Seeing someone switch to the horse side is kind of like seeing a relative join QAnon. I want to tell you that you're down the wrong path, but I just know you're going to fight me and argue me with no information or facts. So, I won't fight it. I'll just let you walk down this path. Ooh, yeah. Ooh, yeah. This is good. We probably win this one. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, now touch me, baby. Uh, hopefully, this buff goes onto the duck. Thank you very much, game. Appreciate you hearing me. Oh, never mind. Big loss. Simply on world record pace. Rumor has it. I'll take a little peek. Big simp. Oh, yeah, he is. I'm going to sell you, sell you, buy you, buy you, buy you, roll, roll, freeze, freeze, roll, good turn. He's on world record pace, but he's still a good 20 minutes away. I'll keep updated. Because I'm about to end, so it'd be kind of tight if I could end and then host him right when he gets the world record. But it would suck to host him right when he chokes the world record, so it's a, you know, it's a fine balance you have to strike. 
Oh, good puffer fish. What if we go level three puffer fish? I feel like puffer fish is unexplored in a pog champ. Um, strat. He's on PB pace, not world record pace. Is his world record not like 10 seconds? Oh, he just got into red. Yeah, I feel like hosting someone on world record pace is a little bit stressful. Uh, yeah, I'll do this. Do I go big? I've never tried big spider. <laughs> big ox. Well, the ox kind of needs someone in front of it. That's kind of the whole point. But I could win with an ox. I think spider sucks. Yeah, that's true. But if it just wins me early game, I'm fine. That's a big dog you have there, sir. That's literally going to get one shot by my sick ox. You could have pilled in front of the ox. Is there any difference as long as your ox isn't in the front? Like, I know it gives him perma melon armor, but he also just has melon armor every time someone dies in front of him. Maybe that's ignorant. Fuck you, game. You dick. All right. This should get a spider win. I think my new favorite thing in this game is getting a unit that can snipe. Like dolphin or crocodile. Snake a little less because snake's still kind of lame. His speedrun's dead, is it? What do you mean? It doesn't look dead. Unless... Yeah, I, I mean, I trust you guys, but... Dead seems crazy to say. Yeah, Tiger Snake's a little lame, but, like, Tiger Dolphin, I think, is very cool. I am a... Avid skunk lover. No, I don't like turkey. I'm going to switch off turkey. Or ant. Let's do rooster. I'll throw that roost ass around. Oh, this is an easy win. Not big spider. I don't know. I'm I hate summon builds, and I just think spider's kind of bad. I I like things like skunk. Uh I'm thinking of doing something a little loco. I'll shoot this for now though. I'll take what the Lord giveth. I've never gone big rhino. Big rhino could be fun. Oh, puffish, true. Oh, hit this guy. Oh, that works too. With melon armor, should be a win, right? Double bunny rabbit, huh? Rhino is very juice me, squeeze me. Hey, retweet plus one of that. Tiger behind Rhino, you basically get a lot more attack, but you end up running out of um, attack pretty quick. It's not as great as you would imagine. Okay, let's sell this. Let's sell this. Let's clean house. Let's do uh, this. Let's do this. Nah, Rooster's a little lame, no? Hmm. 
We could do parrot. Let's get some originality going, you know? This is going to be a good parrot. Parrot is a weaker tiger, yes. Oh, that dog took a hit. That parrot got rocked. Oh, almost. Oh, you get you walk because you killed two. Oh my god, keep it going, King. I like Rhino. Simply's on PB pace for his splits. His current best possible time would be second on the leaderboards. I see. Which is still amazing. All right, seven wins. Wow, it feels like we're already at endgame. This is what happens. Oh, love that. Love that. Ah, uh, we'll ignore you. I'll hold on to it. I feel like this is what happens uh, when you don't draw a lot and you don't lose a lot. You don't even get to, like, really build out your team. I feel like my team is, like... It's, like, five rounds from where I want it to be, but... I mean, I can't complain. Oh, I love that. Oh, I love that. I just won by too much. I just won too early. I know a parrot only copies a level one ability. Yeah. I am knowledgeable about that. Little hog action. A little hog wild. I like leopard. I should probably go dodo leopard. Oh, look at that. Oh, you were so close, leopard man. Although it's fine, because I think we'll end up killing it with... Uh, oh, no, we'll be... Well, yeah, what's well, 1 HP? We're fine. Two chicks? I believe we draw this, though. Never mind, we win. Skunk Hedgehog? Skunk Hedgehog can be decent, yeah. That sounds like a, a good team. Mm, nothing here for me. Dolphin's kind of cool. That's it. We're going for shooters only. So what happens here is the skunk removes 99% of one creature's health. The dolphin kills the lowest unit. Oh, you... Oh, no! Fuck! That was unlucky. That was unlucky. It hits... Uh, you know what? We still end up drawing, so I'm fine, but that was funny. You please? It's actually generally good as long as it doesn't have melon armor. Uh, let's do this. 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 And that's just kind of a hard counter. Tiger. No splash. No, splash is good, but unfortunately, it just ends up biting us in the ass if they have a... See, look, the dolphin's going to kill this guy, I think. Oh, no, he's going to kill the dog? We just get a free dog kill. That's crazy. Oh, my God, we just destroyed that squad. Do we still lose? No, 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 no. Do we? No, we win. Do we? I can't do math quick enough. Oh, baby! We lose. Shit. Okay. We, uh, we, uh, ooh, hey.
Dolphin. Fuck. Are you fucking kidding me? Sack of shit game. Would have appreciated that five seconds ago. This, okay, so now, because the tiger, two people are going to lose 99% of their health. The dolphin will attack the weakest unit, which hopefully will end up being this hippo, which would be Pogchamp. Thank you very much, game. Thank you very much. And that's a win. Wrap it up, baby. Jeejes. That's a cool team. I just want to end stream, baby. What? I've been playing eight hours of Super Auto Pets. I can't win. Can't stop winning, I should say. All right. Well, look. I said I'd keep going. I will never end on a loss. Or, uh, excuse me. I'll never end on a win. Oh, simply just died. I saw it. Clean hands. Because that's... I wash every time after I pee. Every time. I'm not going to play too much longer because I do want to go raw climbing too. Oh, is that a draw? Good old-fashioned loss? Just kidding. Fucking lost to a horse team? That's embarrassing. I might try to go Hedgehog. All right, we can fast this one. Hey, we can fast forward this one. Lord knows this does not end well. Why would I even pill? Peacock is interesting. I love this. Do you think we win with two? Oh, no, we do not. Wait, actually, we might. Because he... Oh, we we draw? That's insane. Uh, look, I can't be mad about a draw with two. I guess they only had three, yeah. Oh, dude, our squad rolls this team. Our squad destroys this team. Look at this. Look at this hedgehog massacre. <gasps> oh, shot through the heart. I'll give you a uh, five subs if you win with the level three zombie fly. I know it's possible. Yeah, no shit, it's possible. Fly's just broken. What do you mean? Fly's like a good character. Wait, zo what is... Wait, 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 wait. Am I being dumb? What is zombie fly? <gasps> what it summons... Oh. Oh. Is that kind of like winning with like a level three bus? Or like a level three honeybee? Miss Peacock? I uh, know, I'm not going to use it. I'm going to get rid of the Peacock soon. If you keep Peacock around too long, you're getting baited.
I think the only people who are going to stick on my team is probably Dodo, Puffer, Hedgehog. I could throw a whale in. Not like torqued about it, but I don't hate it. Kind of funny. Funny. This seems really bad. Oh, it is. Yeah, it is. Garlic on the puffer? Well, yeah, because I want the puffer to live, man. Every time it gets hit, it thrashes someone. No, don't tell me the servers are crashing. Oh, no. Hold up. Let me hit it with a classic Alt F4. This is the only way that can get me off my win streak. Forgot it shows my email. I am unable to log in. Oh! We're back in, baby! Alright, let's see. Oh, this is so good! So what's gonna happen right now is this is gonna do four damage to everyone. It doesn't kill anyone yet, right? But then, oh, Pufferfish snipes, and then this snipes, oh my god, this is so, oh, I'm losing my mind, that's so beautiful. That was art. Oh, and then this is gonna be so beautiful, oh, baby, oh my god, and then the, the, the badger's gonna kill its own teammate for the win? Oh, 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 that was beautiful. I think I'm a hog believer. Okay, let's stall. Yeah, let's do this. We'll do this. This is fine. Uh, you know, I'll throw this in here. I'll probably end up throwing the dodo a little higher up. Maybe like that. Puffer in the back's fine. The dodo could go up one for now, though. The peacock's still really powerful. 10 HP, like, that's good. Okay, so you're going to swallow, you're going to get the bus. That's going to end up killing the dog, which is sick, because the dog won't get a power-up now. Kills the spider? Oh my god, this is so beautiful. I mean, we're going to kill our own peacock here, kind of sad. <laughs> um, but we end up winning for sure, right? Yeah. Oh, no, we draw. No, we don't. Pufferfish for the win because garlic armor. Oh, baby. That was art. I mean, yes. You say dolphin. I say how high. Yeah, it's fine. Garlic the whale does seem like a good play. I think this whale's a short term. This whale's probably going to go away soon. Because I'd rather use the 10-9 hedgehog than whale it. Peace out, Rue. So fucking sick.
I need a stronger puffer fish, though. This is actually a little dicey, because I think there's a chance we lose. No, we should, we should win. Yeah, we're feeding the peacock, but the peacock has no HP, so it's like, who cares? All right. Uh, Pufferfish and Dodo, probably, right? Yeah. <sighs> I mean, we're going to go full snipe squad. I could just get rid of the dolphin, I guess. Because it, it doesn't make sense to sell the sell the whale. Because then it's like, is it is it hedgehog, snake? Yeah, it doesn't make sense. I think for now I'm feeling this. Makes the most sense. I still did the wrong fucking order. No, I didn't. Yeah, this still doesn't make a lot of sense. Eh, this is a little all around not the greatest order. Killed my own fucking whale. Jesus Christ. Okay, this this was this was, you know, this is a work in progress. We're we're kind of figuring things out still. Holy shit. <laughs> it is not as effective with a camel. Noted. Noted camel does rock my squad. We still have two more lives. Okay, let's do this. Roll. Uh, I'm feeling like the whale is on its way out here. I would love a level three puffer fish. I am so upset at myself. I, I, I Everything I just did was stupid, and I regret everything I've done for the past eight years of my life. <clears throat> All right, let's see what happens. Fuck you, badger. Wait, this is actually kind of good for me. Nice. We still lose. Damn it. Okay. I, I look that I, I played that bad. I made a mistake. I made an error. Okay, so who should Dodo be helping? This whale sucks. Get rid of the fucking whale. That's what I'm feeling in my heart. Fuck the whale. Fuck the whale. That's what it feels like the correct answer is right now. Melon? Skunk? Skunk? Skunk actually works really well here. Still doesn't add up that much. It's not the greatest squad. I don't love it. It actually kind of works out here. There you go. Snake's gone. Oh, 
so close. So close. Do we lose because of that? Oh, no, we draw. Oh, that was so close. I do break my own melon. My order leaves something to be desired. I agree. This, is, this isn't bad. This isn't bad. The mushroom helps the snake a bit. That was the perfect amount of health. That kills the fish. He comes back. Bang. Giraffe is now dead. Love that. He's going to die. It looks like a win. Oh, no. It's going to be a, a loss. A draw. Whew. Whew. Okay. Okay. Oh, my God. I feel like a deer in the back is not crazy. I don't... Wait, sorry. If the blowfish gets hurt and deals 4 damage, does the snake actually trigger that? No. Okay, then yeah, this is fine. I think deer's too weak. I could go whale hog. Yeah. It would be three attacks, though. It might be too much. I think it's too much damage. Okay, definitely this. I think I think these snakes are bait. I think they're bait. I think they're bait, dude. We already gotten the level three hedgehog win. Let's not worry about getting a level three hedgehog here. Let's roll one. No, no, no. Elephant snake. No, no, no. We're good. We're good. We're good. We're good. We're good. This could be a... Oh, this is a... F oh. This is... Oh, no. You copycat! No! Oh, this is a brutal team. Oh, my God. Oh, God. Chat, this is brutal. I don't know how this is going to shake out. Oh, my God. Oh, baby. Holy shit! Whoa! 
<laughs> oh, fuck. Okay. No, this doesn't work though. The hedgehog will kill this guy. All right, let's see. I'm so nervous. Holy shit, dude, we're fucked. Oh, fuck. Oh, baby. Oh, my God. Wait. Wait. six wins <laughs> okay we got a lot of work to do Buff the tiger. I mean, the mushroom. The mushroom will do it. Oh, this is good for me. This is really good for me. Because this is going to be snake fucking takeover. Oh, yes. Yes. This is huge for me. Melon armor gone. Bus gone. Oh, melon armor's back. Dude, that's so big. Oh my god, let's go, Hedgehog. <laughs> Our team is so good. Our team is so good. It's so annoying. I think we gotta sell Dodo. My loins are telling me Dodo is not cutting it for our squad. And rather than have a Dodo, which makes like a like a like a like a 26 attack. Having like um, a tiger back there is amazing, um, or or something just that spawns into something else, like a rooster. You know what I mean? I just rolled past tiger. Fuck yeah. Maybe a spider. I mean, turtle in front of blowfish is actually a pretty good idea. Because it will die 
after the hedgehog does both its things, and then I'll get melon armor fresh. I think that idea is cool. Watch me. Garlic armor? I know he still is going to use the garlic armor. Watch, 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 watch. Just, just listen, just listen, chat. Just listen, just watch. Oh, please kill this fucking shitty ass fly. Please kill this fly. My life relies on you killing this fly. Okay, you're almost there. It's literally gonna die next turn. Fuck yeah. Rooster's dead. Huge. And the mushroom doesn't activate. Turkey's dead. Huge. And then... Woo! And then he's back. Oh my god, I have the best squad in the world. So here's what I meant. Look. Now the pufferfish gets hit, it'll hit somebody, and then it gets meloned after that. That's good. That's like good right there. I could also go dolphin though. I could also go dolphin though. Sushi, I sleep. Dolphin's not that good though. Dolphin's only five damage. Skunk is interesting. Skunk's more interesting than Dolphin. Maybe I just go Sushi Sushi. Let's try out. Let's try out Skunk. Let's try out Skunk. For like huge 50 HP units, this could be pretty big. Like this guy. What the fuck? Oh my god. Oh my god. What the fuck just happened? What? Dude, was that a Tiger Leopard 3? Is that, I didn't exactly see that. There's no way to replay, I think. I guess I can just replay because we're on Twitch.tv, though. Remember to drink plenty of water. Got you, King. Appreciate it. That was one of the coolest teams I've ever seen. Hold up, let me clip it. I want to rewatch it. So Leopard gets rid of 50%. It does 50% of its attack onto a random creature. That's what it does. So whatever attack it has, it does 50% of that to someone new. Exactly see it. Let's try out. Let's try out Scott. Okay. A huge 50 HP units. This could be pretty big. But it's level 3, which means it hits 3 people with 50% of its attack. Plus, there's a tiger. So, what like does that even guy. mean? Does that just do 37 damage to 50 people? Yeah. That means it does 37 damage. Oh, no. That means it does it to 6 people. Which means that it spawned. And it did 18 damage to 6 people. And I'm staring at 13, 9, 9, 16, 27. And so it literally did 2 hits on my porcupine. What? Killed what it fuck? immediately. Killed everything else. This guy lived because it had melon armor. Oh my god. And I got rolled. Oh my god. And he had a level 2 rooster. 
and kangaroo back there and a level two monkey? Like, how the fuck did you have time for all this? God. What the fuck just happened? What? Damn. We were on 18 turn. We drew a lot. Well, we had a cool fucking squad. I'll, I'll take it. We lost, but, you know, I'm happy with it. All right, boys. That is the end of the stream. What a long one, man. That was like a 18-hour stream or some shit. Eight-hour stream. Not even close to 18 hours. I'm just making up numbers at this point. Uh, chat, I don't think I'm going to stream tomorrow. You're my man. That's what my gut tells me. I'm probably not going to go live tomorrow. I've gone live, I think, just about every day in the past, like, eight, nine, ten days. We streamed, like, a shit ton of hours in that time. But I think I'll take a day off. I might stream at night, maybe. We'll see. Maybe I'll, like, have a good old morning and be like, oh, I want to stream for a bit.